<laughs> Good morning, lovely jewellery makers. Oh, it's the weekend. It's the weekend. It's time to party. Yeah. <laughs> that's the most unenthusiastic that's what I, ever. That's what I do. Is it? Is yeah. How you get down at uh, get yeah. down at the discotheque. Yes. <laughs> How are we all, Mum Dance? <laughs> Hey, I am a mum. I'm quite happy with that. I know. I, I, I think. I think as soon as you do have children, well, this is what my husband says. You develop. Do you develop the shoulder twitch? Come on, every single mum dances like it, don't they? We? we all do it. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I'm so glad Lo and Ellen aren't watching. <laughs> now, now we have got a little bit of an announcement, haven't we, Claire? What? Yes. Have we? Yes. Yes. What's it? What's that? Because there's a little, little surprise in the gallery. Oh, yes. Yes. I'm with you now. At about nine o'clock last night, I had a message saying, guess what? Question mark, all the explanation marks. Guess who's producing tomorrow? And I was like, oh, could this be? Could yeah, this be, be for one show only, <laughs> the return <gasps> of Mr. Dickie? Yay! 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 Oh. The bad boy of jewellery maker, <laughs> the Viscount of Value, the Plummet Prince. <laughs> he is back for one show only. Even lovely Lindsay on Gem said, Ah, oh, you're all back together again. Yeah. How it's, I know, yeah, it's a lovely surprise. Isn't we're, it? we're lucky enough to see Liam on a regular basis, but of course he's on Hobby Maker full time now, so <coughs> a real treat, Liam, to have you back in a hot seat. Yeah. And boy, oh boy, he was never going to turn this show down, by the way. He was never, ever, ever. Not only because there's Claire and there's Ollie. Uh, well, the whole team. There's all of us. I mean, that's a lovely team today, isn't it? Yeah. How lovely. It's a real, like, nice mix. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Lovely but Ollie. also because we have Dave Tross. Yes. And I will absolutely say this, hand on heart, the best red jade you have ever, ever seen. This parcel is unbelievable. Ollie, Ollie, you said to me yesterday, didn't you? The reddest red you've ever seen in Jade. Because it can sometimes be like that terracotta-like colour. Look, oh, you see what I mean, Claire? Wow. I know. <gasps> <coughs> I'm going to tease you with it for a bit. I'm going to tease you. It's unbelievable. So that's happening from 10 o'clock this morning. Um, and we've got, like I said, strands. We've got sizes that you've never seen. We've also got, coming up at 9 o'clock and 12 o'clock, unbelievable kits with you. We've got lovely kits. So talk today. about the 9 o'clock kits first. <clears throat> so 9 o'clock kits are all, it's, a, it's like a celestial uh, collection uh, with sterling silver, different gemstones. Love so it. if you want to do your uh, pendants. Yeah. Uh, if your charms, your stacker rings, so there's really <coughs> lovely soldable components. And then at 12 o'clock? And then 12 o'clock, I think the most spinel I think I have ever had that the necklace to work is with. bonkers. Uh, so, really, 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 really lovely, lovely. It's, lovely. Well, should we show that piece? Yes. It's yes. been on Facebook, yeah. we've seen it on yes. social media. So, and actually, so there are, two, there are two versions of this kit, which is really nice. So, I worked with one, and then the. Um, uh, the in-house designers, they did. Did well, they? Well, look at all that sparkle there. Look, look, look at that. That's amazing, Claire. And that connector is part of the Masterclass kit yes. as well. Yes, yeah. Which, and it's it's so intricate. It's, it's exquisite. Amazing. Big gram weight on that as yes. well. So that's yeah. at 12 o'clock today. What else do we have? Well, we have last chance opportunities with your, uh, with your jade bangles in green. Um, we've also got some last in stock opportunities in your big pearls. We've got last in stock Sally Hewer to bring you. We're going to do some massive closeout deals on one millimetre sterling silver wire. What? In this hour, yeah, 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 yeah. No, Liam spoke, to, uh, not Liam, sorry, Wayne spoke to me about this, this deal, honestly. Because it's you, because we have you in the studio, <laughs> we're going to do a closeout deal on your one mil sterling silver wow. wire. And... 
your early bird this morning, well, you've got a double dose of early birds this morning. Again, sticking with sterling silver and our lovely Claire McDonald, check out these brand new sterling silver star spacers. Oh, you get, they're lovely. Aren't they beautiful? They're available on pre-order right now. Ignore the price that's on the website because I'm going to make a guarantee. Shall we? Shall we? Under yeah. ten pounds. <gasps> Under ten pounds for nine pound. Uh, for, for for sorry. <laughs> 925, that's what I meant to say. Uh, 925 sterling silver. Lovely Anne and Sue has made up some gorgeous jewellery um, on, on one of our lovely oh, slider lovely. bracelets. Aren't they gorgeous with that oxidisation? Oh, what a morning. And yeah. tools. We've got tools as well. Tools. Tools. Yes. Everybody loves a tool. They do love a tool, yeah. So I might have to do another dance if we carry on. Oh, yeah. Looking forward to that. Does it involve a shoulder twitch? <laughs> and early bird brand new hematites we've actually got too much to squeeze in oh today's show. look at those i love I that know. strand i know what was that liam sorry what was that liam three strands of pearls coming up at 12 o'clock with sterling silver clasps yeah honestly it's jam packed oh. but so you can shop ahead and pre-order guaranteed under 10 pounds for your 925 sterling silver stars Mad deals on the brand new hematite strands as well with your celestial themes. Great for your yeah, kids. Yeah. Um, so you can shop ahead and pre-order on those. Um, they're all locked and loaded on the website. So, you know, go for gold. How many do we actually have those star of those uh, stars, though? Let's have a little look. 200. Right. And so people aren't just going to get one yeah. or two, are they? Should we get this show cracking, though, with yeah. your early birds? I... That's what I meant, sorry. The Wall of Fame. <laughs> I meant the Wall of Fame, that's what I meant, yeah. Like I said, getting so excited. Starting us off this morning, number 110 is Alison. Good morning to you, Alison. I hope you're well. You've made an absolutely beautiful Marla necklace. There it is. Oh, nice. Amazing. And Alison says, hello, jewellery maker. I have made a uh, five millimeter faceted tiger's eye, Marla necklace and matching stretchy bracelet. Both have the matte gold Buddha heads and the Marla has an eight millimeter black obsidian above the black tassel. All components are from jewellery maker. Hope you like it. Take care. Alison, we absolutely Beautiful, Alison. love it. Beautiful. Gorgeous, yeah. Number 111 <coughs> is Jill Taylor. Good morning oh. to you, Jill. Oh, look at that. That looks like it should be That's in a glossy classic. magazine. Yeah, Hi to all the lovely JM crew. I'm having so much fun with the two meter freshwater pearls I bought a few weeks ago. Here is a simple necklace with sterling silver spaces and an extended chain. It's lovely to be able, uh, be able to uh, do so many different designs, knowing there's plenty of pearls to work with. And then I can do it all again with the soft pink beauties too. Good luck to all. And that's from Jill Taylor. Good luck to you, Jill. That's absolutely lovely. stunning. Number 112 is from Lorraine Smith. Oh, Beautiful nice. Lorraine, loving the colours. <clears throat> and she says, hi, jewellery makers. I've been using resin this week. Here is an autumnal pendant with striped agate and gold plated chain. Good luck to everybody and to me, of course. Yes, fingers yeah. crossed for you, Lorraine. Yeah, beautiful. Good luck. Number 113 is from Jim Hall. Oh, oh beautiful. <gasps> Love that, Jim. And, and he says, good morning, everybody. This is a bracelet made using sterling silver spaces and tubes, multicolored tourmaline. Wow. Uh, faceted pairs and marquise garnet. Wow. Beautiful. Wow. Uh, hi, uh, all products are from Jewelry Maker, except for the box, he says. I made the bracelet as part of a suite of jewelry for my niece's birthday. Best of luck to everybody in the drawer and take care. Good luck to That's you, Jim. That's amazing. Yes, yeah, lovely. Lucky niece. Over to you. <clears throat> and I've got 114, and this is Rhea Brown. Wow. Love that. This That's is beautiful. Incredible. I think, actually, I, I, this is Gloria, actually. I, I don't think it's Rhea. I'm pretty sure this is Gloria. <clears throat> I, I think, yeah, I think this is Gloria Brown, not Rhea Brown. Okay. Um, I think we missed a bit there. Hi, JM. This is a sea glass I've purchased from you a week or so ago. I've made... 
<clears throat> I've made the bezel setting from the silver clay, rolled into strips and cut with the pattern scissors from Claire MacDonald's demo and fired it in the kiln. I've rubbed a little baby oil onto the sea glass to help bring out its colour. I hope you like it. Good luck to all the WAF entries and thank you for bringing us the gorgeous gems. Kind regards. And I'm pretty sure that's Gloria. That's incredible, Gloria. Gloria, beautiful. beautiful. Yeah, really lovely. And next I've got 115 and this is Jane Galloway. Oh, that's lovely. I love the photography as well. Hi, these are turquoise chips. Uh, <clears throat> earrings and bracelets. The turquoise chips were from Jewelry Maker. I love the show in the mornings. They always make me smile. Good luck to everyone in the drawer. Thank you. That's lovely, Jane. Gorgeous, Jane. And next I've got 116 and this is Anna Winter. <clears throat> oh, that's lovely, isn't it? That's really, really nice. Good morning to all. I hope you're all well. Please find attached this week's uh, Wall of Fame entry. They were made for a friend's birthday. She loved them. <coughs> the opponents are from JM. Wishing everyone good luck. That's really lovely, Anna. Beautiful. Good luck. Uh, the next I've got 117, and this is Janet. <clears throat> wow. Got all that work. Hi, oh. hiya, gorgeous girls and boys of the JM family. Here is my first ever beaded bauble. One of the few sea beading techniques I've mastered is netting. And it's thanks to marvellous Monica. Uh, a pre-Christmas gift for my mum. Everything, everything is from you, lovely lot. Thanks for all the fun giggles, which are a wonderful addition to the fab deals. Hugs and joy to all. And that's from Janet. Aww, that's wonderful, isn't that Janet. Nice? Lovely. Uh, and last of all, I've got Diane Dubois. What a lovely Wow, name. look at that. Hi, all. Just finished this set. Not sure what I'll do with it. Maybe a Christmas prezi. Good luck to everyone. That is beautiful. It's lovely, Diane. Love that. Absolutely love that. Very, it's almost quite 1960s. Yeah, yeah, that. yeah. Yeah. Um, amazing. Amazing. Make sure you send your entries into the Wall of Fame mm. and good luck to the draw that happens this coming Wednesday. Oh, it's with me, so I'll try and be lucky. Um, hello, Kayla. Morning Aww. to my two favourite blondes. Looking forward to a great show. Just wanted to send you all a hug. Ah, Sending a hug back. Big hugs back. Uh, morning, all. Yes, my lovely <laughs> Liam is back. He is back. He is back. Mm, he is. Yeah. Do you know, it's funny because he walked in this morning. He was quite the celebrity. It was like, it was like Liam! Oh, yeah. my gosh, Liam! <laughs> it was like that this morning, It is it? Lovely. lovely. It is nice. It is really lovely to have you uh, have you in the, in the hot seat once again. Don't forget, you can shop ahead and pre-order on your early bird. Lots of you are already doing that. Um, Sterling Silver Space is in those lovely Stardust, uh, Stardust, uh, um, not Stardust, sorry, Star Shape. Seven million their size. Ignore that price point. Remember, I've already, I've almost already confirmed that these are going under ten pounds. And likewise, all of those hematites. Under £10. There we go. Oh. Not 48 99 All going under £10. Great oh, to go alongside your, yes. uh, your first kits. Yeah, because the detail on each of those is gorgeous. I know. Are we ready? Yes. Fast and Pisces, says Liam. It feels weird hearing you say that, Liam. I know, I know. Liam, Wayne and Ross, they all say it to me. Right, we're going to start with... Oh, some absolutely incredible, incredible pearls. Now, there is only the one. Um, and I'm, are we talking about this one, Liam? They're gigantic. And I discussed a couple of days ago, I was talking about the fact that these, um, to actually get pearls of this size, they sell them individually now. This one, coloured, natural multi... Oh, yes, multicoloured pearl. That's me not reading it correctly. <gasps> Goodness me, naturally coloured. Um, again, let's oh. go back to how I was, uh, what I was uh, discussing earlier um, a few moments ago. So um, they don't sell these by the strand anymore over in Tucson. They tend to be sold individually, um, quite literally because they're rare. And it takes a lot of investment to actually acquire enough pills to quantify a full um, a full strand of this length. You're talking 38 centimetres. Now we talk about the five virtues. They're a bit like the four C's to your to your diamonds. Of course, that size, that shape, that colour, that nacre, um, and also luster. Those are the five virtues. Well, you've got all those in their droves, but really should we just home in on colour? Because a pearl can be bleached, it can be dyed. These colours that you're seeing on this screen are totally and utterly natural. These haven't been coated 
or, 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 or submerged in a dye in any way, shape or form. Those beautiful pistachios, those papayas, those wonderful purples have come from the mollusk itself. Now, when you consider that each individual, uh, each individual pearl will take possibly, and this is, it does depend on the temperature of the water, etc., will take, I don't know, say about three years to actually culture to a size like this, 12 to 13 millimetres. Now start doing the maths of how long it's going to actually um, time investment to make a full strand, plus then consider that not every single pearl will have these natural colours. You can really justify then the fact that it can take absolutely years to, make, to get hold of a strand like this. That is why our pearl suppliers have literally said to us, Look, we can't, I mean, it's not impossible to continue bringing you strands like this. However, it is going to be expensive because we lost a lot of the pearl harvest during the pandemic. Pearl farmers want a quick return. They, they're, not, they're not willing to invest three years into, uh, in, in, into uh, harvesting and hoping that you will get pearls of this size. How exciting then that you actually get these natural colours. Now, we launched them at £250. We're at £179.99. There is only one and I have got what five people uh, okay okay sorry four people one person wants two we haven't got two we've only got the one Thomas Karen Angela and John you can do it you've got to make that check out You've got to make that check out. First come, first serve, can't say any fairer than that. Uh, Valentina, you're there as well. I'm going to leave that one with you because, like I said, we're over allocated. Oh, good luck, people. <clears throat> if you do miss out on that one, or if you wanted to, like John in West Midlands, I do have two of this next one. And they're huge. Wow. These mollusks, right, we kind of assume that when pearl harvesting that the mollusks would be about this size, don't we? Well, when you th think about things like South Sea, they're about dinner plate size. And your Tahitian are about this size. It does depend, but they have to mature for years to get to that size to be able to begin the culturing process. Now, when I tell you that those mollusks, they don't house multiple pearls. When the pearls of this size, it will just be one. I'm going to borrow this bust for a second. Every single one of these, on the back of the Lady Gaga House of Gucci, it is all about these Baroque pearls mm. now, Claire, isn't it? Yeah. All about the big pearls. These are the ones that really mm. are in the limelight. Again, Hollywood quite often actually bears, uh, ha, you know, bears a, um, a reflection on the price point of the gemstones. And it's all about that demand. Love these really accentuated, dramatic fireball. Mm. And that, that, that one that, that, that you're talking about, that's, that, that necklace is all of them together, isn't it? Yeah. These are, you could separate this out, couldn't you? And these are standard, these are pendants. They're yeah. absolutely and incredible. And that's how they, oh, they're natural as well. They're not bleached. That's how they're sold. Mm. In yes. Tucson, yeah. they are normally yeah. sold individually, yeah. uh, usually a triple figure price tag each because they're huge look at it i think we've been very conservative on the sizing i think some of these are definitely bigger than 14 mil <coughs> excuse me at 299 pounds i will count them two four six eight ten twelve fourteen fifteen look at the colors on them <gasps> one of them absolutely ollie ollie's saying one of them for 300 pounds absolutely well, this is working out at £13.33 per pearl. This is why we so frequently say, and I know I'm like a broken record, so do excuse me for this, but just sell them individually on a gold chain and you would absolutely be able to command even the, even the previous price point for just the one. For just the one. It's an exciting variety of pearls. Most people, especially if they're new to the pearl uh, sort of industry, will think, oh, right, round. It's got to be round. Actually, Baroque pearls and fireball pearls are actually challenging round mm. pearls on their price points. They can be even more expensive because of these wonderful anomalies, these beautiful free formations. Wow. You know, it, it, yeah, they're a, they're a work of art. There's two of these available. At 299 that was already an absolutely amazing deal. You can get this home for £49.99 on your split payment. Margaret, I can see you there. London, I can see you there as well. You've got 15 solitaires. Again, they are over allocated, so I'll leave them with you. Look at that. Can I just show you? Just single out one. Just beautiful, imagine that. Isn't it? How beautiful. Imagine that on a gold chain. Wow. It's beautiful, isn't it? And it's totally and utterly natural. Now, I haven't cherry-picked, I've just 
gone to one. They're all amazing. Well done. Uh, what was that, sorry, Liam? <coughs> one big fire, Pearl. Oh, I do. Ooh, he's a big one. I was looking at that, yes. <gasps> now, if a strand is maybe out of your, out of your budget, then we, we too will have to start selling them individually. That's not something that we've made the decision to do. Our suppliers have almost taken that decision for us. Now, this is a big fireball pearl. Oh my goodness me, it's 25 millimeters. Ooh. Now, obviously there is variations. There are only 12 of these available. Look at that. Look how beautiful that natural color is, that beautiful sort of golden, uh, golden color is not dyed. It's all down to the mollusk actually sharing that beautiful color with the pearl itself. <gasps> Um, even if this was at £299, we've just spoken about it, haven't we? That's yeah, a, a reasonable yeah. price point, I think, for something of this level of rarity. It is big. This is a big piece. Now, we've got, did you say 12, Liam? 12 in the vault. Shall we make... Oh, my gosh, look. <gasps> ...one of the biggest Baroque pearls accessible? Half-drilled... So literally just pop this on a, on a featherweight head pin or create your bale or a peg that you might have already in your stash. At 99.99, goodness me, that's an amazing return already. Already. How about if we squeeze the, the final 12 under 50 pounds? That's an amazing price, Liam. Don't tell me you're going again. Oh, he doesn't care, does he? He doesn't care. The clock is ticking in 60 seconds, Liam. Um, can I buy some of these, Liam? Maybe, he says. I can buy them at this price. I'm happy. Do you trust Liam? He says he's only here for one day. Message in. Do you trust him? I do. I do. I think he's a trustworthy chap. He's got a face that I think you can trust. <laughs> <coughs> no, I trust you, Liam. We're already an amazing deal already. The lowest price that it will ever uh, it's ever been at, says Liam. But he wants some, the, the, the whole quantity, the 12, out the door. OK, fair enough. Oh well, if there God. are any left, I think Claire and I will start yes, them up. Please. Half drilled, so you're not going to actually, uh, you know, you're not disturbing, if you like, the beauty of the lustre no. on the underside of the pen. I mean, look at that, Claire, it's stunning. That's that, incredible, isn't it? See if I can place it on the back of my hand. Are you ready? Are you ready? First come, first serve. <gasps> You're not going to see this deal again, says Liam. Ah, oh, Liam. That is really low, isn't it? Liam, uh, uh, you might be a little bit out of touch, <laughs> but have you been on Monica Veneda lately? <coughs> Monica Veneda are selling, are selling Baroque pearls Probably bleached Baroque pearls because they're white, pure, pure white. And I'm fairly sure they are like three figures. Well, they are three figures, definitely. We're over allocated. You have to check them out. Heather, Blessing, Cumbria, Angela, Alan. Well done. Well done. You've all got yours. Oh, my God. Don't forget, one post is <clears throat> packaging all day. And whilst you're at it, you might as well pre-order on your early bird. So that's the Hematite, brand new Hematite strands. And also those lovely sterling silver stars. Mm. Valentina, Gabrielle, well done, lovely. Shaleen, Cumbria, Caroline, Lorna, Mikey. You, it's no good sat in your baskets. There's literally five left within the vault. Oh, Four. morning, everyone. Morning. Morning, oh my everybody. Gosh. Yeah. There'll be an on-screen sellout. Oh, my word, yeah. Lorna's just got two. Well done, lovely. There's two left. No, there's not. They've gone. Well done, well done, oh. well done. Well done. Um, Okie dokie. Ooh, should we do some lovely seed These are seed nice, pills? yeah, these are lovely. I love a seed pill. Yeah. Do you know what? This will look really lovely with your black spinel It would, yeah, cards. yeah, yeah, it would. It's like classic combination, isn't it? I did think, you know, when I saw that, I was like, oh, yeah, that's amazing. You could even add your pearls yes. in there as well if yeah. you wanted to go all yeah, out. Yeah, especially that size, that would work really nicely. Yeah, can you pass it over? Yes, yeah. Pass that beautiful necklace over, Claire. Yeah, if you wanted to put, turn it into that sort of classic... Um, I was going to say Chanel, but actually this is a bit more vintage than Chanel. Would you agree? Mm, yes. Yeah. 
And someone had said about, um, I can't remember the uh, lovely lady's name, but she'd said about like it was like a flapper design. You know, like a oh, Great Gatsby. Yeah, like... Uh, oh, great Gatsby. What am I thinking about? What was that? Just, Downton Abbey. Yeah. Yeah, like 1920s. Yes. Yeah, so that, yeah, oh, mean, layering a, a flapper. What did I say? Flapper. Yes, flapper. I hope you said flapper. I did say flapper. Don't Are make you me, sure? Don't make me doubt now at 25 past eight. Next in, did Claire say <laughs> flapper? That's what she meant to say. I don't say the other word. Ah, oh, but they go perfectly. So this is your masterclass coming up at 12 o'clock today. I adore seed pearls. I just oh, think that beautiful yeah. little delicate size. Everybody's really excited about your masterclass. Um, yeah, so perfect alongside that lovely 925 Sterling Silver Connector. Um, make sure you check out those baskets on those. Might add those to my order today. There you go. Thank you. There you go. One of Liam's favourite things, the Lee. Uh, do you know this is this is based on Suja, S U J A. Oh, I love this. Should be a PowerPoint on yeah. it, Liam. It's it, yeah, it's they it's are. Fab, they, they are. There's just a really lovely. <laughs> um, no, it's not that. <laughs> Sura, Sura, maybe. It's a, just a lovely, really lovely project to um, uh, work she... on. If you want to make something that's, that's quite easy, lovely components, everything you need is in there. Um, and it gives you, it is, well, it's the, when we can remember the, the name of them. It's I'm very sure. current, isn't it? Yeah. Um, design. It's on, yeah. There, there, there is one on the, on the J drive or, on, or whatever drive we use. Um, it's such a lovely <laughs> way of framing, you know. It is. We're based, it's literally that, isn't it? And yeah. you're talking about £140 yes, uh, yeah. for each of their pieces. Yeah. Um, yeah, we could, there's, in the endless amounts of PowerPoints that we have, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I think we've, all, we've shared it before. But where you have the Parve setting in crystal. Now, um, this is silver plated. Uh, if I just turn it over as well, I'll remove that. You've got that beautiful, beautiful, uh, precious, precious plating there backing, giving you that wonderful luxury. Then you've got your crystals, which are almost like cerulean. I mean, this is yes. something that we saw. Yeah. Yeah. You, you, Claire McDonald, <laughs> you. you might have inspired the designer that we can't <laughs> think you, of the name of. Probably. That's a genuine cultured pearl. Should be $49.99. You don't just get the Biwa pearl. You get the lovely little silver plated tassel as well. There you go. You get the two jump rings and you get the silver plated chain. So everything, everything included. And tools what? So all you'd need is some chain nose. <coughs> yeah. It? That's it. Open and close. Yeah, that's away it. You go. It takes seconds. So open and close the jump ring, yeah. attach it to one end of yeah. your pill. Yeah. And then open and close the jump ring, attach it to the tassel. That's it. And then you're done. Job done. Yeah. £14.99 pence only, Claire. That's incredible. That's absolutely incredible. Amazing, amazing, amazing. If you want to know that, jewellers, I will I, leave it with me, message me, and I'll send it to you. I, I follow them. I follow them on, um, on um, Instagram. Um, it's silver plate. I don't know where it's saying silver. Where is it saying? Oh, okay. No, it is silver plated, um, hence the price tag. £14.99. Well, that's an amazing price for the, for the actual mm. Biwa Pearl, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, you could possibly make something like that, but is it even worthwhile at these kind of prices? When no. you actually and break it down. Yeah, isn't it? And it's, it's getting that lovely long chain, that, that tassel, which is, is really nice. You've got a lot of... Um, you know, sometimes some tassels can be a little bit stingy, can't they? That's a nice full... Oh, movement. this is a voluptuous yes. tassel. Yeah. Look at it, yeah. Look at all that lovely yeah. chain in there, yeah. Beautiful voluptuous And it needs tassel. to be that to balance out that big pearl. Yeah, I think so. Make sure you check out your baskets, everybody. Um, and don't forget your early bird as well. You've got your sterling silver stars. They're available, guaranteed under £10. And your hematite, uh, guaranteed under £10. Uh, what did you say, sorry? Oh, we have... We're just gonna we're just gonna whet your appetite for what will be one of the biggest shows ever um, on Jadeite. Now this all master carvings, an absolutely beautiful uh, natural type A Jadeite. Look at the water oh. content that you're seeing within this. I mean, it literally looks wet, doesn't it? Um, floral carvings done literally by hand, polished by wet bamboo, totally and utterly natural. 60 carats, 60 carats in your high goo shape. We discussed yesterday about uh, high goos and how they are the most, um, uh, one of the most symbolic carvings. 
um, because uh, pr historically it was actually placed on the chest and the waist on, of deceased loved ones, and it believed that that, uh, that jade would ke keep them connected and give them a sense of immortality, which is just absolutely lovely. But also in terms of jewellery, I mean, I've certainly sh shown you establishments like, like First Dibs, where you actually have high goos, which have usually a round, brilliant cut gemstone centred, um, or maybe some 18 karat gold framed around for literally thousands upon thousands of pounds. This is certified completely and utterly natural. Every single one of your jadeites um, will have a slight difference to it because this is a, it's a natural gemstone. It's not, yeah. it's not laboratory created. These aren't machine cut. This is done literally by hand. And when you think about it that way, something which is created by mother nature, <coughs> excuse me, and shaped by human hands, it's madness to be able to contemplate getting hold of it for £49.99. £49.99. And and I mean, that's the thing. If, if, if something were hand carved in, I don't know, clay, on concrete, yeah, or yeah. It, it, it shouldn't be that price because that is, that's somebody's artistry yeah. and the time that has gone into uh, making something like that. You know, and that's, that's of a really, you know, of a material that is just everywhere. You know, the, the fact that this is, you know, how, how precious jadeite is. And, and you've got all that skill and that artistry that, you know, it's, you know, master craftsmanship. It's incredible. And they, that's a really good point, Claire. Really, really Thank good you. point. You know, it's, if, if it was carved by wood. Yes, yeah. You know, yeah. which, let's be honest, is yeah. plentiful. Yeah. Uh, at that price, it would be amazing. But it is natural type A, Burmese jadeite. You've got the flowers, which literally circumference all the way around. Beautiful, beautiful gemmy water content within this. Keep on dialing through again, looking like it's going to sell out because I only have the one left. Beautiful. Amazing, amazing. Shall we do... Dan's passing it to me right now. A South Sea Pearl. There are three of these available. Oh, it's pure white. Oh, my goodness me. This is probably what... This is one of the best South Sea pearls I've seen. It, it, yeah, but do you know what, Liam? You can see it. You can see, yeah. I, it's so much so, I'm going to use a piece of paper. Oh, it's not white. Hang on. Have you got a piece of... Could you pass me the wall of fame? Thank you. Thanks, darling. Because I want you to really appreciate the quality of this oh. pearl. Here you go. A beautiful, beautiful, pure white natural South Sea Pearl. Now, from the coast of Australia, South Sea Pearls are, have long been established and considered to be the best pearls in the world. They're also the most diva-ish. So if you can imagine, if you imagine these are like the Mariah Careys in the pearl world, um, they don't like to culture um, anywhere outside a very small location in shark-infested waters. Um, as you can imagine in Australia, there's lots of nasty things in the water mm. that are out to get you. They're completely and utterly natural. Now, that's an absolutely amazing deal already for a South Sea pearl, particularly in a teardrop shape, particularly in a teardrop shape, because La Peregrina, it's the, it's the rarest of shapes. Mm, mm. Um, certainly, I, I know Charlie will actually mention that. Lowest ever price point for you. It is perfectly half drilled, so all you need to do, I'm getting some of those if there's any, of, is there one left? Oh, okay. 16 pounds and 66 pence, it's a Beautiful. massive size. And by the way, one pearl per oyster with your South Seas. Um, okay, let's do um, Is it rose gold? Yes. Oh, I love this. Look how beautiful. Look at that. So you've got the beautiful, oh, beautiful plating. I love that. Mm. Christmas gifts, Claire. Perfect. You know, if you have a little look on, on, I always say Monica Van Ada, but also what about Tiffany's & Co? What mm. about Gucci? What about Astley Clark? What about Misoma? All of those big jewellers are actually working with, Tiffany's have just launched a new chain, actually. Um, I think it's Beyonce who's in the marketing campaign, probably oh. paid an absolute small fortune for it as well. well it's £8,000, by the oh. way, I think, for that bracelet. Um, yeah, Beyonce's in it. Um, but look, take a little look on Monica Venada's website. And it's just, we're only going there because that's the first one and we had it already open. But take a little look, slightly different, different designs. Uh, so the Ulta textured chain bracelet, 95 pounds. By the way, that's much finer in terms of the gram weight, Liam. 
that's quite much 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 finer i love the links on this me too 20 what? pounds what get your christmas gift sorted i would absolutely be uh, yeah there's only five of them available though and rose gold, you know, some people, you either, you either love your silver or your yellow gold. Rose gold is that nice in between. There's four of these available. Pauline's done it. Angela's there. New customers there. Two left now. I'm going to leave it with you. Pauline, I can see you there. New customer. Well done to you. Don't forget the hematite coming up in five minutes' time. You can shop ahead and pre-order on those new cuts. And also with your silver star spaces. Now, anybody for a bit of tanzanite? Oh, yes, please. Not just any tanzanite though, Claire. Unbelievable tanzanite. Oh, so much so I've got to open this. This is too beautiful to sit, look through the little plastic, plastic box. Here we go. No, it shouldn't be 20 pounds. It should be way more than 20 pounds. There's four. Oh my oh, goodness no. me. Do you no, know, no, no. Just gauge my, my I mean, my reaction alone what on earth? I'm sorry, I'm just trying to get this in tweezers. You haven't even seen uh, the, the actual art. Oh, seriously, look at that. That's amazing. Absolutely amazing. How is that six ninety nine? It's oh wrong on every level, isn't it, Claire? It, yes, yeah. Oh, my word. Sold out, well done, well done. Should we do some Baltic Amber, Claire? Oh, yes. I haven't seen that in a while. No. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, how lovely. Liam's... <laughs> Liam says, I think I've peaked too early. Liam, it's, it's, you've still got another four and a half hours, darling. OK? He's out of touch, isn't he? With his <laughs> yes, producing yes. mark. When we say a bit of amber... That's quite a bit, isn't it? It's a metre of amber. Liam, he doesn't do much jewellery maker. Um, because he's heading up hobby maker. Absolutely. Don't we haven't we haven't got rid of him. He's not, he's not allowed to go anywhere. He's here in the building all the time and he's probably one of the hardest members of I'm gonna say the Gemporia partnership, and I generally believe that, don't you? The hardest the hardest Hard, working. Hardest or like working. hardest. No, hardest working. Hardest like. Yeah, definitely hardest working. <laughs> Look at this amazing strand. Beautiful, beautiful amber nuggets. You've got your Baltic, your cherry, you've got honey amber in there, cognac too. Um, there's only three of them. Amber, everybody recognises amber. We used to do uh, amber by the, what, 30 odd centimetres that's, and it would be way. That is amazing. Because uh, I'm thinking if, um, if you do, um, <coughs> do you remember I'd made, I made a bubble star bracelet and you need, you, need, you know, the, the way I'd done it was like a, and it was block colours, so you almost have yeah, that ombre effect, but you need lots of them and you need lots of the colours. That is the perfect, perfect strand to do that. But Claire, we used to do like 38 centimetre strands for yeah, that price. that's amazing. Liam, don't just come on here and start rocking the status quo. <laughs> Who do you think you are? You know, Amber at 39.99. Of course it's sold I'm out. I'm surprised. Of course it's sold out. Our viewers know that's not, that, that's not the usual price for Amber. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. Do some what? Yes, let's do some jade eye. Again, wetting our appetites for the 10 o'clock show. Super, super excited. A red jade eye like you've never seen. Like you have never, ever seen. I'm still not going to show you, because. I, I, but trust me, it's worth the wait. Uh, can oh. I, can I, I know it's not on your graphics, but this is almost like a, an aqua colour. Certified natural type A, but if I hold it against my neckline, can you see from there? It's got that beautiful, almost like a delicate aqua blue, mm. which is, as mentioned, not these aren't my words, the GIA stipulates that it does occur in natural blue, but it is very, very rare. Now, I'm not saying that's what it's certified at, but do you all agree? It's got that really subtle, beautiful azure, yeah, like gorgeous. a summer's day sky. Yes, yeah, yeah. A great size as well, and look how uniform it is. Just, just lovely. Last of stock, clearance deals. What, again, Liam, uh, Liam, Liam, again. That's Liam. beautiful. How many of these are available, Liam? 
As a member of staff, I don't think I can buy him at that price mm. tag. No, he says very confidently, no. It's beautiful. You've got this dove blue. Mm. Absolutely beautiful. That's a mad, mad, mad price tag. If it was any, if it was more like a three figures, I'd still say it's an amazing deal. Wait, Liam, you know what? We've, we've actually overlooked a very defining feature. Do you know what that feature is? They're two mil drill holes, yeah. Two mil drill holes, which means they will literally oh, feed onto wow. your leather. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness me. Your ears picked up when we said the two mil drill holes. Because, Why do we because, get excited well, because, by that? Like you say, see, that means that means you can put your structural wire through it, several cords through it. It just means that, that it, you don't have to. You can do your standard, um, but it just means, as far as jewellery making goes, it opens up so many different mediums you can work with. The sterling yeah. silver wire deal yeah, that we've got perfect. coming up later on. They've sold perfect. out. Well done, well done, well done, well done. Um, okay. It's time, though. It's time for your star buy. Don't forget your sterling silver star spacer beads. Get involved. They're flying on pre-order. They are guaranteed. I'm promising them to you under £10. Seven mil in their size. Not itty bitty. They're big. Um, and also, you've got some brand new hematite colours. All about the celestial seams and cuts. Um, get shopping ahead. All under £10. It's up next. Now, let's start with the stars. I love these. Whatever decade, mm. probably whatever era, stars have always been relevant, haven't they? Yeah, it's a lovely, it's a, it's a pleasing shape, isn't it? And it means, it means a lot. Yeah, it does. Yeah, to everyone. And I think on the, on the back of the pandemic, I read an article, I think it was in the Telegraph, that was talking about how celestial themes are absolutely mm. everywhere in interior design, in jewellery, in clothing, artwork. And maybe it is because we were looking for that, I don't know, that, 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 that sense of positivity, I suppose, on everything that we've just been mm. through. And it's a bit of escapism, isn't it? And like True. another world and you can get lost in it. And it's, yeah. And every morning, so like this morning again, when I, at 5am, 5, 5 I open the door let, to let the dogs out. And it just, every morning, I just stop and look at them, those stars. And it just doesn't have an impact. And if you've got jewellery like that, you're seeing that motif. I do think it's, a, it's just something really lovely that you so can So Claire, enjoy. can I ask you a question? Yeah, of course, yeah. You know what it's going to be related what is it going to? Be? <laughs> Are the stars... <laughs> Particularly beautiful in Wooten and Wallen. <laughs> yes, they are. and Wallen stars are Particu very lovely. Particularly posh stars in Wooten What and Wallen. Now, now, what else is in Wooten and Wallen? What else is in Wooten and Wallen this morning was a very angry Claire because she came downstairs and the kitchen lights had been left on again. Oh, no. So, yes, it wasn't all lovely in Wooten and Wallen. What and Wallen. Lola. Anyway. <laughs> oh, Lola. Electricity is expensive, Lola. Yes. Brand new premieres. Brand new premieres. Am I, have I picked up the wrong strand? I beg your pardon. So we've actually got copper, we've got an antique colour, and we've got your multicoloured. They're all coated, beautiful hematite. Hematite, did you know? 164,000 years. This is actually the oldest writing material known to man. Is it? Yes, in its rough form, we used to use hematite to actually write with. Um, obviously, we know when it's, it's, it's sort of faceted and polished and coated like this, you can get beautiful surface luster. Be mindful, there is much imitation hematite, uh, hematite? hematite on the market. Um, you know that ours is um, completely certified. Now, we've made a price promise, guaranteeing these under £10 for you today. They are double carved as well. So not only are you getting the beauty of the hematite on the, on the one surface, you've got them on both. Great for blood disorders, absolutely. Lots of people believe that it helps with your circulation. Um, um, hence heme, heme as in hemoglobin, yeah, you know, that, that it's, yeah there's that relation to your, uh, to your blood. Lots of people wear it for that reasons too. NASA have discovered it, haven't they? They've actually discovered it in space. Wow. NASA did what? They sent a shuttle away into space. Oh, yes, yeah. To hit a meteor. 
That was not going to affect us in any way, shape or form. But just to check that that's something they can do, to move the course by one millimetre. Cool. You know, like it's Armageddon. quite reassuring, isn't it? It is. Yeah. That's cool. Cool. And this almost is like a, yes, great point. Ollie's just said it's like marking the occasion because that's history in the making. You know, that's, yeah, mm. like you said, reassuring peace yeah. of mind to yeah. know that that possibility can be done. The reason why we're talking about space, again, well, visually, hematite has got this wonderful sort of intergalactical-like beauty, but also it has actually been discovered on uh, um, in, in outer space. There's only a couple of other gemstones that have done, and that is per Peridot is the other one as well. Um, so you've got those beautiful, beautiful connections. I mean, this is something you could literally just put one on a cord and create sort of wish-style bracelet. Yeah. Very it's popular a, across all ages and it's a but it's a very clever um clever star as well if you look because it's that it's got the six six points hasn't it so it's almost like a lovely christmas star it's also like a flower the you know the um, ah, poinsettia yes so, so you, you know if you do your wire work um flowers and things it that would be a perfect um what's is it um, what they're called is it a star star anise yes it's a bit like that isn't it oh so that you it, put it in your christmas lovely, cake yes yeah, so it'd look lovely in um christmas wreath decorations anything like that you've got um yeah. What about with your silver spaces too? Yeah, nice. I mean, how about if I told you that everything here, individually, guaranteed under £10? Guaranteed. Right now, we are talking about that really beautiful, almost like an antique coppery colour. Not just £9.99, £6.99 pence only. Shop ahead on the other strands. There are only 45 of oh, these gosh. left. It is flying out the door. Do you remember? Do you, never been on your screens, by the way. Do you remember the, the sort of this uh, sort of antique copper like colour was always the most popular in the wire, wasn't mm, it? Yes. We don't yeah. see it that often. Um, hello to you, Julie. Sending some advice. Morning, lovely ladies. May I give some advice to everybody? Choose carefully. Uh, when to make a cuppa. I nearly missed the amber bargains. Just to get it well done, oh. Julie. Oh. Oh, I know, yeah. Oh, that was a close call, though. But can I just say, Julie, that's a tough one as well. Amber tea, amber tea. I, I, I'm a proper mm. tea head. Definitely you make sure... You could have a tea's get... made, couldn't you? Yeah, Love that. true. Love that nice tea. Make sure your there. tea is made before 10 o'clock as well. Yeah. In fact, yeah, and Claire's demos, your kits are lovely. And also your masterclass. I mean, I'd get a, a nice thermos flask. Maybe. <coughs> maybe that's the way to go, isn't good it? Good call. Then, and then you can take that in. Have it sat next to you on yes. a coffee table. Yeah. What a good yeah. call. Go and get yourself a big thermos flask. Yeah. Love it. Love it. And just bring in the whole, bu the, the whole box and of biscuits. And some nice biscuits. Yeah. yeah. yeah Never mind about one or two. Get the whole box of biscuits because yeah. you're going to need them today. You really yeah. are. Um, just 14 of these remaining. Well done, everybody. Lots of multi buyers. Nearly sold out. Shall we do? I mean, <laughs> sorry, Liam. Let's do the other colour now. Right, oh, Liam. Do you mean the gold? Yes, yeah. This, this looks lovely together. I'd be putting these two together. And it's not just a difference in colour, it's a difference in texture. Mm, look at that. Ah, oh, beautiful. Yeah absolutely beautiful again double-sided you you know again get your christmas stars now mm. it might sound ridiculous i know mm. we're literally on the eve of october but you try and get hold of stars yeah and this bit now the... goes very quickly doesn't it <coughs> oh it is october year, today so, yeah yeah, yeah i'm still thinking it was september yeah no it's october we're gonna match that price tag for you so your baubles like what we saw on the wall of fame how nice would it be to actually put uh, um, to put your uh, to put your stars within your baubles? Oh, do you know I'd glue it onto you know your lapis there. Oh, I'd glue on a there. pop socket. Yes, I'd, I'd glue some of them on there. That would be nice. Be nice. That's that's the sky. That's your that's your nice. That's your Vincent Van yes, Gogh, isn't it? it? Is, the yeah. perfect edition. If you want yeah. to get hold of this colour, I don't know if it's still available. It was very 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 popular right now. This is the only matte hematite star strand that I actually have available. Um, and they're absolutely flying out the door because they're both sides, Claire. I mean, if you mm. were doing things like you mentioned the bubble style earlier on, yeah. well, that'd and be we perfect have that amber. That. Yes, yeah, that'd be perfect with that. And so something with movement, if you're going to have, you know, like station necklaces again. So, you know, 
uh, maybe inch inch length of chain in between each star. Oh, lovely. And so you're going to see it, aren't you? 360. So it's, it's really important that it's it's double sided. Yeah. Um, you don't just want a flat back, do no, you? You want no. it to look beautiful yes, front and reverse yeah, as absolutely. well. Absolutely. And you've got that there, haven't Multi you? Multi buyers on this one in a beautiful matte texture. Great for things like your wish style bracelets. I know that's something that Ollie said in, in, mm. in the gallery. You know, that's a multitude of wish style bracelets. Oh, it is, yeah. It's a couple of knots either side, yeah, a yeah, different colour cord. Yeah, it'd be beautiful. Sell those at five pounds each. Yeah. At yeah. say an artisanal market, I bet they'd absolutely fly. Yeah, and across because it's across all ages as well, isn't it? It's a nice. It's well, a nice we should look. all be making hopes and dreams yeah. and wishes on yes. a regular basis. And the idea be, behind a wish bracelet is that once you put it on and it's just got one single cord uh, uh, thread of eslon, when it does break, that wish comes true. Yes, love the sentiment. Yeah. Um, good morning to you all, Lynette, Brian, Lynn, Linda, Pauline, Antoinette, Gloria. Sorry, hello to you, Roz, Joy, Pauline, Carol, Cardiff, Nancy. I've got one more star, and I think this is going to be the most popular. This is very pretty, isn't it? Can I also point out that this goes perfectly with the moon and star? Ah, oh, look at this. It is the most popular. It's almost got like a mystic, yes. a mystic yes. beauty to yes. it. It now, because of the demand, oh, we're going to take that. it to nine ninety nine. But we are going lower. We are going lower. I want to show you that. Coming up in a few moments' time, we've also oh. got this strand, oh. and they go perfectly oh, together. That. Yeah, as predicted, Claire, you want this colour. Yeah. It does. Yeah, <coughs> look at that. That is absolutely perfect, isn't it? Yeah. In just under 30 seconds, we are going to drop that price tag. The, yeah. Uh, if you can see the call screen right now, mm. quarter of the stock is already gone and people are multi-buying on that. If you want the moon and star strand, they're coming up again equally double, uh, double carved. What was that? Sorry. 20 in baskets for the final. Eight on the phone lines. 25 in baskets. Yeah, the quantity is going up, 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 up. In terms of the demand for it right now, you know it's not stopping there. How many do we have out of the uh, of these? Okay, just over a hundred. I sometimes when we do hematite, we'll have like 300, 400 mm -hmm. quantity. Not the case today. We only had a hundred opportunities, just over six pounds and ninety nine pence. Get stocked up for Christmas. And I'm going to say something entirely decadent. Imagine these on your Christmas baubles on your Christmas tree. Mm. Imagine these maybe embedded into your pillar candles. Imagine yeah. these maybe dusted, sprinkled over your Christmas table. They're reusable then, aren't they? And that could be something that you do. Oh, oh, I've got an idea. Oh, go on. Got an idea. Got yeah, an idea. Yeah, yeah. So this is about 150 stars. Great maths, Ollie. Sorry, 50 stars. So sprinkle them, maybe give everyone a little gathering of stars on the Christmas table. Give them some Eslon. And then after, you know, when they're sat, they're all podged from their Christmas dinner. <laughs> that's what I do, podged. <laughs> um, you can sit making wish bracelets. Yeah, that's with lovely. The family. Yeah, that's really nice. Beats that that's curly cute. fish, doesn't it? <laughs> Beats the curly fish. 33 of these are left. What's the point of that curly fish? Kills with everybody. Well, it's, yeah. Isn't that like, though, you What? Well, isn't it either like you're just a really horrible person or you're jealous or you're dead? Oh. What are the other options with the fish? Let's make wish bracelet. I think oh, that's, that's much nicer, isn't much, it? Much, much, much nicer. Yeah. I don't want to know that, yeah. the others. Um, 26 of them left. They're flying out the door. 6 99 If you look at the call screens right now, loads of you have still got a phone in your hand. Our call centre will get you, I promise. Sally Ann, new customer, new customer. Megan, Jane, Angela, I can see you there. Uh, new customer, Shrop. If you've got it in your basket and you haven't yet checked out, it'll be allocated on a first come, first serve mm. basis. 15 left, and I've got three rows of names. Three rows of names. Our call centre are amazing, but we are completely and utterly bombarding mm. them right now. So please don't abandon those calls. Jane, I can see you next. Megan, you're out. It, literally, there's, there's a few of you there. I'll leave those ones with you. Keep on dialing through. And. Worst case scenario, you're in exactly the right place for the next opportunity, mm. aren't you? Shall we? Can we do? Yeah. Because they are, they are a perfect pairing, aren't they? Perfect. Mm. Shall we um, think about stars and moon songs? Stars and moon songs? Yeah, stars and moon songs. What was, um, what was Simply Red? He sung one, didn't he? My father the skies, straight into your eyes. I used to fancy him. Did you? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Did he have a ruby in his tooth? Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> I'm not going to lie, he wasn't my cup of tea. He wasn't my cup of tea. I have to say, do you know, do you know, <coughs> do you know, secret crushes, like unconventional crushes, who's, your, who's yours? So we know see, Simply Red is one. Yeah. Who else? Um, Can I tell you mine? Yeah, go on. Mickey Flanagan. Oh, that's, yeah, no, I'm with you on that Got a one. a bit of a crush yeah. on Mickey Flanagan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We've got the same what cheeks. What is his name? We've got the same cheeks, that's why. <laughs> Mick Hucknell, that's it. Oh, you like you fancied him when he had the long hair though, didn't you? <laughs> <coughs> no, the one next to it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I feel mean now. Like that, like that, Claire. Like that. No, like that. See, do like you have a poster that, of him in like your bedroom? that album cover there? Like the album cover. <laughs> yeah. I get it. I get it, I get it. Right, if you want these, and loads of you are already him. getting involved. So again, these are double-sided. When I fall from the sun. Um, look at that, beautiful, sorry. <laughs> and it's a nice big surface area, isn't it? So you get all that, that, that rainbow. Beautiful. I mean, I think this is a good conversation when you have like, um, Peter Kay's another one. Yeah, I like Peter Kay. Peter Come Kay. on, somebody else then, so Peter Kay. Peter Kay's another one, texting. Your, uh, not the obvious celebrity crushes. Someone else, please say Mick Hucknall. Yeah, no, no, he's not. He wouldn't have been up there on my list. Uh, someone out of Pitch Perfect. 57 of these left. I, I, can I just say, if, if, if my um, boss is watching right now, I haven't paid hardly any attention to this strand whatsoever. I do apologise. We're talking about celebrity crushes. It's really important. <laughs> really important but loads of you were there um i knew this of you liam uh liam loves rebel wilson oh yeah yes. i knew that yeah, liam. She, yeah beautiful yeah beautiful. <laughs> yeah very funny yeah yes. she is yeah 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 i can see that but that's the thing personality goes a long way doesn't it totally it goes such more than, a long yeah, way more than and anything. she's beautiful as well yeah. rebel wilson is absolutely beautiful yeah. too but um i find Hello, who's, who's this, sorry? Lorraine, Claire, I loved oh. Mick Hucknall and saw him live twice. Oh, amazing. Wasn't he a bit of a ladies' man, though? Wasn't he the one? He dated yeah. loads of celebrities. Oh, yeah. Jeff Goldlam, yeah. Yeah. Carol, Jeff Goldlam. Uh, Gold, Goldlam, yes. is, he's, hot. he's hot. He is, yeah. He's really hot. Do you know who else I fancy as well? Smooth. Um, Frank Skinner. Frank Skinner? I, I, yeah, I do quite fancy Frank Skinner as well. Isn't he local? I think, yeah, it's Birmingham, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, Gloria. Mick Hucknall is gorgeous, <laughs> I wouldn't say. That. <laughs> That's right, Gloria. <laughs> well, neither did, neither did a load of... He was a bit of a ladies' man, wasn't he? I don't know about... I don't know... I don't know about, I don't know about Mick Hucknall. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. There you go. <laughs> I was always um, more of a John Bon Jovi. Oh, yes, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, like John Bon Jovi. Yeah. Energy Kaz. <laughs> <laughs> he did, yes. Oh, dear. <coughs> he did. Oh, dear me. Any more, Claire? Any other conventional, unconventional crushes? Because I feel like you've got them here. You're delivering. Well, I didn't, didn't realise they were that unconventional. <coughs> well, I think like, who it I is. I who did you fancy then? Aha! What's his name? What's his Morton name? Morton Harkin. Mort Ooh, yeah. yeah. Morton Harkin. I was so lovely. jealous. I was so jealous of the girl in that in that in that drawing. Yeah. It's yeah. like, yeah, look at her dancing. Yeah. Yeah, I'm oh, so jealous. Yeah, he was fit. Pretend that you were her. Should we oh, do the blue? Nice. Oh, we're talking about aha. Uh -huh. we we're talking about aha. Uh -huh. Remember, take on me. Yeah, we used to love him. Absolutely loved him. Um, hello, Janet. Oh, apparently, oh. you know, like Mickey Flanagan, lovely personality, funny. Might not be true about some of the other names that we've oh. mentioned. Says, uh, oh, says really? Yeah. Oh. oh, really? Well, we don't like that. Doesn't matter how much, how much money you got in your bank, you're still going to be a nice person. 
Um, look at that beautiful royal blues, midnight blues, which is very apt, don't you think, alongside the moon and the stars? Yes. Perfectly yeah. apt. So, so, yeah. We've got the biggest quantity of this one. Do you know what? Because all we've been doing is messing around <laughs> in the past couple of minutes. It's a professional TV channel. <laughs> <laughs> Should we take it? Should we take it to a brand new low? I'm mean, not just talking the price point. <laughs> <laughs> just because we've messed around for the past couple of minutes talking about celebrities. Celebrities. What was the one from Wet, Wet, Wet as well? I fancied him. Marty Pello. Marty Pello. Yeah. 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 And... Uh, do you know who I like as well? I, another, I, I really like Bill Nye. Is it Bill Nighy? Nye, Nye? I don't know who he is. Uh, the comedy actor, uh, there's something lovely about him. Bill Nye, Nighy? I, I do, don't know something, him. Something, oh, yeah, you would have, um, when, uh, was it Love Actually? Who's the singer in that? That's Wet, Wet, Wet. It, but when he, in, the, in the Love Actually film, he's the singer in it. Uh, Ollie Murs and Jason Manford for me. Good yes. one, Deb. Yeah. I've met Ollie yeah. Murs. Yeah. And both very him. funny as well. Yeah. Like that. So that's a humour thing as well, I think, isn't it? Ollie Murs so is makes really you nice. He's a really lovely chap. Yeah, really lovely, like lovely chap. Um, uh, hello, Judith. When I was at Little, I loved Leo Sayer. Uh, <laughs> I used to kiss the telly. <laughs> love it. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, Leo Sayer. So hang on, I'm trying to visualise Leo Sayer. I, I do know the name. I do know the name, don't I? He, yeah, uh, isn't, wasn't he... Um, oh, yes, I can't think. I can't think what was Leo the song. Sayer. Yeah, Leo Sayer. Dis, uh, dancing something. <laughs> uh, that doesn't help, doesn't help me. Um, you know, we were talking about Never Ending Story the other day. I fancied, like, my ultimate first-time crush was a Treyu. I've never watched it. Is that... Is that a person or a creature? <laughs> it's oh, the one that, it was, yeah, it was, the, it was like the hero in Never Ending Story oh, that just like, rode oh. around topless on a horse. Oh. He was, yeah, he was fit. He was fit. He did, he was topless. He was. He had his chest out. <laughs> All right, he had a waistcoat in my dreams, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Keep on dialing through, everybody. Well done. Right, right, right. Enough of that. Enough of that. Look, here he is. Here comes a tray you through the clouds, literally, and you're really bird. Um, behind him are a blaze of beautiful sterling silver star spaces. Up next. <laughs> Love this. Absolutely love this. Now, the spacer. Trusty spacer beads. Oh, Claire. yeah. You can't get enough of them, can you? Why do, it, why do we need spacers in our lives? So, well, to literally space things out. They're very good for that. Uh, a focal. It's a good way of getting, if they're precious metal, getting um, precious metal into your design. Yeah, true. Uh, a focal point. And they can mean something, especially when they're a symbol like that. Yeah, so, absolutely. Because we, 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 we're quite familiar with sort of the round spaces i mean um so we have those quite a lot obviously and like you said you can you sort of stretch out your carrot mm, weights mm. you can create punctuation etc yeah. etc cetera, et cetera. but what we don't get very often is actually the ones which have um sort of details like this that become if you like a focal a pendant if you like or a design feature yeah. um in their own individual right now if i actually show you if i point towards the ones that are laid down horizontally they've got really lovely uh, some generous drill holes. So that means even your thicker cords and your leathers, um, braids even will actually work their way through there. There's seven millimeters in their size. And if I actually just flip it over so you can see the front and the reverse, there we go, there we go. You can see you've got that oxidization nice. giving you that added yeah. detail. Yeah. I mean, Claire, I mean, this is super commercial, isn't it? It I mean, is, yeah, because it is, it's, you know, it's that, like, especially if, if you're gifting, you know, you look at um, Wall of Fame, there's lots that aren't there where people put the effort in and they gift it to somebody, and yeah. so it's something really personal, and it's really lovely to say. I always say to the girls, oh, you're a star, you're my star. It's, it's just a lovely way of, I don't know, showing affection, isn't it? Doing something personal for somebody, and that's a nice detail to put in there. Love that, absolutely love that. Now, we only have 200 already 20% of the stock has already gone. 925 sterling silver, they're not tiny. We're not talking about two mils, these are seven millimeters. So you could literally, Claire, you've got, we've got a deal on sterling silver mm. wire coming Snakes, up a little yeah, bit later five on. Rings. 
You yeah. could literally just feed that through, mm -hmm. yeah. solder it. Yeah, yeah, sterling silver, yeah. There's your stack of, yeah. stack of rings. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. Oh, I'm also gutted the ring fell off. The ring oh, you made Oh, yeah, I'll have to do another one. That's all right. That's okay. Um, you know, what about this bracelet that, our, uh, that Anne and Sue have yeah, created? Nice. Yeah, Literally putting five of them direct onto a slider bracelet. You could even stamp initials, couldn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe members of your family. See, that's what I would look at. I'd, me, that's the girls, the dogs, and that's all of us there together, isn't it? It's nice, nice that you, you, know, you put things together like that. Love it. Absolutely love it. Yeah, you can put initials, you can put birthstones within there. Um, you can literally just have the one on the sterling silver chain. The, a spacer is, I'd say, one of the fundamental ingredients for us as jewellery makers. But like I said, we're used to having maybe the rounds, the two or the three. Not very often do we actually get these sort of special mm. um, sort of designs, um, which become a, a pendant in their own individual right or a charm in their own individual right. Now, we did promise, we made a, a price pledge under £10. Consider that there is two grams of sterling silver. Right now, this is £2 per sterling silver star. They're not base metal. That's £2 mm. a star. Yeah, and your precious metal. Yeah. Well, we were just saying that, Ollie. With that, with 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 the wire that's coming up. Yeah. No, 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 no. No, if, no. We were just saying if you feed that through, it could become a spinner ring, couldn't it? Never yeah. mind, solder him. Yeah, and a lovely pendant. As, yes, lots and lots of of lovely things you can do with those. Should we do the wire straight after? Yes, I think so because it goes it it, it goes it, very very well. And it'll go well with your kids. Yes, yeah, it will. Now. Yeah. Now. 200 of these were available. They are already flying. We're just catching up with you. People are multi-buying. We're not stopping there. When we said under 10 pounds, we don't talk about a penny. Although that is two pounds. That's two pound per precious metal star. And they're seven millimeters. They're not itty bitty, they're big. They're big sizes. Shall we do something? Liam's in the hot seat for one show only. Shall we, shall we use, Liam, can we use you as an excuse today? Yay, there he is. <laughs> he says, he says, I'm going to, I'm going to take the management route. Okay. Uh, actually, yes. Oh. Technically, we have two members of the management, te uh, management team in the gallery. So management, are you going to make an executive decision? Yeah. Can you promote us to managers then? If you're, if you're managers, we could all be managers. I mean, we were just talking about um, about about our crushes. Yeah, we're not selling ourselves very well if that's the case. What? Uh, no. This is what no. they can do. Do you reckon we can do better? Yeah, definitely. Right, this is crazy. That's crazy, Liam. Well, see, and in that Ollie. case, in that case, what I'd do at that point, <coughs> so that would be me, the girls and the dogs, and I'd get another packet and that'd be Mick Hucknall and then I'd be absolutely <laughs> fine then at that price. Do you know what? Do you know what? At that kind of price tag, send him your jewellery. <laughs> send him your jewellery. Will you marry me? Is he, is he, is he married? <laughs> is it? Is it? Is, is, it, is he married? You could do at that price tag. You could do a full-on proposal, couldn't you? <laughs> How would you propose to me? I'd stamp it out. I'd stamp, it, stamp out. it. I'd multiply. Stamp it out. And would you do? Would you actually spell? Because I wouldn't be you, creepy. Or would you do the you? I now if I was proposing to somebody, I'd do Y O U. I wouldn't do a U. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> if I was going to propose. <laughs> To a complete stranger through the post of the piece of jewellery, I'd make sure that it was I'd done a good job. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Oh, bless. <laughs> um, yeah, no, to be fair, and he's an amazing musician, isn't he? Yeah. yeah amazing, he amazing yeah. musician. Yeah. Proposal. I, I look forward to that wedding. <laughs> I reckon it would be quite a good bash. Because he's not short, is he? I don't know if he's married. I don't know. I'm really sorry to oh, Mrs. I, I just, Mrs. I just, Hucknall. I feel like his destiny is with you, Claire. <laughs> I feel like it. Right now, <laughs> I reckon, I, uh, yeah. I reckon you two will be good together. The final 52 of these available. Well done. Well done. Is he wife? Is, is he wife? Is he married? <laughs> yes. Yeah, okay. So sorry.
Oh, oh to be fair, they've, they're very happily married. Oh. Oh. Sorry about that, Claire, to burst that bubble. Oh. Is he touring? Is he touring this summer? Summer 22. That's what you didn't think of they were touring. Um, I don't know, but now, now I'm intrigued by Mick Hucknall. There's a name that hasn't popped up in a very long time, and we've spoken a long time about it this <laughs> yes. morning, haven't we? And there's yes. still, what, how many in baskets? 33 of you with this still in your baskets. As you can see, we're over-allocated, and that's assuming you only want the one. Brian's just... Well, take a look at the core screen. Look how many of you are there. Yes, and Brian, yeah. Jane, Jenny, Kim, oh, Molly, Lauren, morning, Lorraine. everybody. Good, Good morning. morning. Who was it that texted earlier on saying, oh, no, it's us two together again? Oh, yeah. Every yeah. time, Claire. Every yeah. time, isn't it? No, it, it, no, it's always troublesome when Claire and I are together. There's always something, isn't it? There's always something that goes on. <laughs> Liam, put, add Liam into the mix and then yes, it's even it's worse. Liam. Absolute chaos. Um, rapidly approaching single figures. Good morning, Aww. lovely jewellery makers. You can see if you've got, if you're on the other side of the line, I can see the number, if you've got a number one next to your name, our call centre are getting to you. They've almost sold out, so we'll leave that there. Teresa, Rachel, Dorothy, Valerie, stay on those phone lines. Our call centre will get to you. Oh, happy um, weekend, everybody. Oh, love. I thought you were about to say happy new year then. I was like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. Not quite, not quite. Now, one of the things we said... Claire, yes, yeah. I might pass it to you because you're the expert. Oh, thank you. Um, I feel like I haven't seen uh, One Mill Wire on its own like this. <coughs> now... Wayne spoke to me specifically about this deal. Right. He's like, Elle, I've put together a sterling silver yeah. wire deal. He didn't mention at the time that it was one mil, and, um, but he did mention how good the saving was going to be. Amazing. That's brilliant. So, I mean, that's a metre long length. Yes. We're going to get yeah. two metres. Yeah. yeah. You could literally just put those spaces direct on there, couldn't you? Yeah. And create almost spinner style rings. You yeah. could solder them. Yeah. So if you look at if you look at the, the rings that I wear all the time, that's it, that's what that is. And and I'll be showing you in my demo how to um uh to make little rings like that and you can add embellishments. And, so if and you, you think can do about things that. like this, can't you? I know yeah. they're slightly thicker. Yeah, yeah. So you, anything like that. Um yeah, so all your stacker rings here, you can see so I wear them all the time. But yes, yeah, so those ones, that is exactly what that has made that one the thicker band, not how the thinner many, one. How many rings do you think you'll make out of one metre? It depends on what size, but if you think, so... It's a hard question, about, isn't it? Well, it's just, it just because rings are all different sizes. So if you, if you, I would say, I usually go about um, 60 mils, so about six centimetres or so. And you can also, um, you know, you've got a little bit of um, stretch room there. So and something I guess it like depends that. So on that's, the size. Yeah, it depends on the size, but don't forget <coughs> also when you've got all of that, so you keep keep going, keep going, keep going all the way over to you. Over to me. You know, to give you that's that's that much. And you got this twice. Yeah. And you've then got you, that yeah, twice oh, over. Yeah, you got that one there. So Eight you can twist grams it as well, meter. braid, anneal it and braid it. There's oh, so much idea. you can do. Eight grams in each meter. So 16 Lovely. grams in total. As I said, sales manager Wayne, I don't want to let, let that go, uh, promised an extra special deal for you all this morning. Um, consider the price of precious metal is still at a, a record high. Um, it hasn't really dropped, not really, um, since the pandemic. Now, for two metres of one millimetre 925 sterling silver, we should be about £39.98. That's our price tag. You're not just getting the one, you are getting the two. In 60 seconds, we're going to do a closeout deal. Remind, remind me how many we have of these, though, Liam. 250. And remind me what, what Wayne said he was going to do in terms of price. Yeah, that is mad, isn't it? You've just heard that. I just, I just don't know, because it never... It, it just goes up and up. and up. It's, Even if you, like, you know, 16 scrap grams. and things like that is... Wow. I, I mean, I've always had in my head, in my head, that if you can, if, if, if you're paying about, about two pound a gram, I don't think that's a bad price. I've always had that in my head. You don't have to stick to that. We're about to absolutely obliterate that price tag. Absolutely obliterate it. 
So I think you probably use, I don't know, about an, an inch, an inch and a half maybe? What's, I'm not very good with inches. Um, so I'm going to go with... What, do you prefer so, centimetres? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Talk about money, money. I reckon about <laughs> at the five and a half to six. What? Centimetres. Centimetres, yeah. For, about, for one ring. That means that you can make approximately, and it does depend on size, about 33 sterling silver rings out of this deal. That's just over a pound per ring. Not today. Do you What's know what? giving you? A certain person that we know very, very well would say, would say that that means that this deal, Ollie, is no longer money's too tight to mention. Let's <laughs> talk about money, money. Let's talk about money. 60p a ring. 60p. <laughs> How do you like them apples, Nick? <laughs> They are absolutely that's incredible, flying isn't it? Out, the, out the door. And well I think that's, that's me being a little bit um, generous with the, um, with the wire. So you can could, we, yeah. Can that's... We, can, Liam, can you just put different, a list of all the different um, Simply Red songs? <laughs> and I think we need to just actually try and include them in at some point. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, throughout the course of the actual show. See oh how many God. Simply Red songs we can, um, that we can, <laughs> yeah. Fairground, say you love me. Um, for your babies, <laughs> stars. Christine, check out your basket. You have got it. What's that? Yeah, but you've got to sing it, Liam. You've got to sing the song. Oh, gosh. <laughs> yeah, I only know a few of them, actually. <laughs> if you don't know oh. me by now. Oh, lovely. <laughs> you will never, never, never know me. Oh, this might be a bit too much. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Jane. That's a bonkers deal, but it's uh, just great. <clears throat> Thank you. You are very, 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 very welcome, oh, my lovely. Yeah, like I said, um, our lovely Wayne, um, he, uh, he spoke to me about this specific opportunity. You do get two metres. I know we're only showing one. Um, and he's like, we're going to do a closeout deal. That's 60 pence oh. per sterling silver ring, approximately, depending on the actual size. Also, think about the gram weight. If there's 16 grams, that's not far off a, a, a pound per gram. It's just and it's so it's such a lovely gauge, such a lovely <coughs> gauge. So if you you know if you work with um, your cabochons, your fasted stones, um, it works really well with that. I mean, just low prong setting you can do, um, you know, framework for cabochons and then net onto it. Um, and like I say, if you if you need to maybe if you wanted to maybe make a bangle, you could um, uh, twist it, braid it. Give you that extra um, sort of that that weight. Are so good, so Love so it. good. And a necessity to anyone that's a silversmith. I mean, think about the demonstrations that we're doing today. <coughs> yeah, so in both you, of those. Yeah, uh, if you uh, look at so demos. if I sort of show you, if I show you on these, can you see here? So I've added. We've got these lovely um, celestial components, and so I've used my one mill there to create um, different bales. Oh, nice. So that that works really well. You can make your own jump rings with that. Lovely links and solder. It's, you know, it's absolutely brilliant. Absolutely it's, brilliant. Yeah, brilliant it's, it's what you need if you want to be working with your precious metal. Yes, yeah. Because you want to use yeah. everything in 95 yes, you do. Yeah. silver. Yeah. Um, love that. Absolutely love that. Oh, I tell you what, uh, it's... It's all a bit nuts, I think. Here yeah, that's quite, yeah. And I'm, I'm desperately <laughs> racking my brain now of Simply Red songs, trying to think of how they actually go. Right now, I can only think of money to do like to mention, and if you don't know it by now. Now, coming after the break, um, you've got beautiful, beautiful kits coming up, all about your lovely Celeste. Um, a demonstration's coming your way. It's going to be absolutely amazing. Keep checking out those baskets, lovely jewellery makers, on your closeout <laughs> deal. Two metres of 925 sterling silver chain in your one millimetre uh, thickness. We're running behind, but you know what? Hey, it's fun. <laughs> We'll get everything in, we will. Don't you worry about it. Clear us up after this.
Uh, guys, so you, you know now, you guys, a lot of you are more educated than I am, but jadeite forms in boulders. Okay, and it's only the skin of that boulder that can, if you're extremely fortunate, contain those ultra rare colors. You know, the lavenders, the, 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 the mottled colors, sometimes a white skin. And in the rarest cases ever known, a beautiful red skin, which is the red jadeite. Now this seldom makes its way to market because it is so thin comparatively to the boulder that it's almost impossible to carve an entire piece out of a solid red color. Well, if you join me for this incredible showcase, you're gonna get the opportunity not just to see it, but to own it and at the most incredible deals. Taipei, 100% natural, Myanmar or Burmese red jadeite. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option two. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. I'm so I'm so confused right now. <laughs> I'm so confused. Anyway, anyway, lovely. Do um, are you confused, Claire? Yes, very. Are I you? always am though. I quite enjoy it. I like it as well in our wonderful little yeah. bubble of confusion. Yeah, confusement. Conf <laughs> Confusion. 
Claire, oh my goodness oh. that you've done it again. That, do you know? Seriously. I, I, would, I, would, I would really, really love to take the praise um, uh, and you have it all for me. You should take the praise. No, because these, are, these kits are, the components that are in them, are just are absolutely beautiful and you've got something I think that just it ticks every box really so you've got your precious metals but then it is that it's that celestial theme that we've talked about that is so popular so and it's then, everywhere it is isn't at it the moment. yeah yeah it really is but um, look I mean the fact that I mean you get that really beautiful mount don't you with the celestial star Christmas star North Star yeah, whatever, yeah, whichever yeah, you wish yeah but I mean this bale Claire that you've created but that's this is the beauty of so you know when we talked about we talked about the sterling silver and, and having having your um, your different wires. So you, when you're looking at something like that and you're looking at the, your precious metal components, if you've got those precious metal components and then you've got your wire, um, so it's the soldering part that means that you can put all those lovely pieces together. So you could um, that that wonderful component you can make that into a ring if you wanted to. Mm. If you wanted to solder it, um, a bail, so it's a pendant, be beautiful charm on a on a bracelet earrings you know it, so you then have the freedom to um you take that component which is incredible and then you can make it into anything adapt it yeah adapt yeah which is, it. that's that's the beauty of jewelry making really. absolutely well um like i said you've got loads of precious metal here and the components the ingredients really the luxury ingredients to to to, to recreate these yes, beautiful yeah, designs yeah. we are live so obviously if you're watching right now if you have any questions for claire then do feel free yeah. to message us because we are yeah. live in the studio um and if you've never really what would you say to people that maybe haven't advent haven't embarked on that journey of soldering so i would say a couple of things and it's been very good this morning and as much so if you haven't had if you have maybe haven't tried soldering before i would get the one mil wire yeah and i'd have a go and you can have a look on uh, online as well um, you can if you're very careful um, with when you cut your wire and then when you join it with that one mil and if you've just got a torch and no soldering no solder or anything like that and you heat it up carefully and you've got a good enough connection it will sort of um, fuse together with nothing else almost like an effect of argentium so because you've got so much and it's not wasted I would say have a go have a play about with that then you get used to almost like um uh, you get used to working with your torch and then get some, when you can, you know, get some flux, get some solder, <clears throat> obviously get the kit, you know, that your, your block and things and just have a go, just, just have a go mm. with looking at, looking at the way um, the heat works because what you're doing really with, with soldering something like this and stacker rings is really good. You're almost like just following the heat around yeah. and it is that circle um, and if you try and think about what you're soldering and, and when I do it we can we can you know I can I can talk you through it you're looking at where that heat is and you you move that heat to try and encourage the solder to flow towards the heat if that if yeah that yeah makes that sense. does make sense so just maybe don't do anything too complicated but have, have a go with that first and it's not actually as scary when you see Claire demonstrate it's not as scary as you f would probably first imagine now um, we're going to bring the graphics we've actually got what is it six different kits different colorways so what we'll probably do is bring you two kits we'll obviously demonstrate and then we'll bring you the other kits hereafter but do have a look are they going to be pre-orderable then Liam um, could we maybe upload them I don't know yeah, I tell you what, we'll put them on the website so you can actually check out the different varieties. But when we think about, I think, the, uh, you know, uh, um, the Northern Lights, mm, yes, most of us yep. will think of maybe Labradorite, but certainly your Ethiopian Opal. And that is the beautiful premium gemstone that you have mm. featured within this kit. Now, the kit includes... Um, a four millimeter Ethian opal, which is completely and utterly natural. You have that wonderful star, um, the star. In fact, let's show you on this board just here. I can put Claire's bracelet alongside it. So you have that beautiful star detail, which has become the main sort of focal piece really to this design. Um, what are these here then, Claire? So those are little, um, what you call, so solderable accents. So your sterling silver, and you can see they're different shapes. Mm. So in a way, with these kits, so I would say you, you can make, so I, I've sort of separated them out there. Um, so if I, bring, if I bring that in as well, so you can see, so what I've done now, I've used the, the main star um, on, the, on the charm. But then those little solder black ones, I, I, you, you can use them in lots of different ways. So shoulders of um, maybe settings. Uh, and, and then I've grouped all three of mine together to make another star as another piece of jewellery. So again, like, like with, with lovely you know, kits, there's, there's a lot you can do. So it's separating the components out or using them all together. You could absolutely, um, 
you know, create a, a create another charm with those, couldn't you? So you've got like your two, your large star with a gemstone and then the smaller yeah. one. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. So you could actually wear them alongside one yeah, another too, Yeah, it? it's a nice Plus, uh, collection, isn't it? Oh, it's gorgeous. Claire, and then you've also got this amazing heavy. It's a heavy it's, yeah. 925 sterling silver really, bracelet. Yeah, really, 5. really lovely. 5.5 grams yeah. in that bracelet alone. I mean, again, look at, uh, look at the prices that you can pay. Do compare the gram weight. That's really important. Um, all your sterling silver, you've got your um, pendant, you've got the actual, uh, you've got the uh, um, Ethiopian opal mm. there as well, and you've got to a topaz set within as well. <coughs> um, so eight white topaz claw sets. Is that referring to this here? Um, Must be. Is that yes, referring to yes. this? Yeah, there's yeah. topaz set within. And so with that, um, just to, to give you, so I obviously, um, when, I soldered oh, yes. the, when I soldered the bale to that, um, all the stones are okay. So that's something else to, um, to think about. Amazing. So that, that was all, you know, that, that worked really well. Amazing. And this is what we It's lovely detail, isn't it? Isn't really? it? And the, the, even the mount itself, being, having that beautiful sort of... Uh, um, uh, uh, well, I call it a rubbed over setting. Yeah. So it's going to protect the opal, but also elevate our ability to see the internal play of yes. colour. Yeah. So that lovely bright backing as well, isn't it? It's a, it's a, it's a, it's really pretty. Beautiful. Really. And so lovely, maybe you know, if I mean charm bracelets are, again, that's such a like a sentimental piece of jewellery, isn't it? This is your perfect. You have yeah. it like this and like the one I've made, but there's nothing to stop you from adding your charms. And so if you're gift gifting it to somebody, this could be, you know, you started it off. Um, you know, and then they could they could add into it. Love that, Claire. It's stunning. It's absolutely stunning. They're beautiful, beautiful kits. Again, we've got slight different variations mm -hmm. on this star kit. We've got them with the chains. We've got them with different gemstones as well. I mean, you could easily even make sort of matching rings, like I'm actually wearing mm -hmm. right now. Now, imagine what this would actually be as a finished piece of jewellery elsewhere. Would you find that amount of sterling silver in an Ethiopian opal um, of that quality at a double figure price tag? I, I don't think you would. I think you'd find it much more than that, Liam. Ethiopian opal. Uh, with that amount of 925 sterling silver. Are you ready for your amazing kit deal? Liam says he's been in and he's changed the price. He's actually gone lower. Oh. Yeah, that's an amazing deal for the sterling silver bracelet. Yeah, that, if you were to find a bracelet like this, maybe in, I don't know, Tiffany's is the obvious one, isn't it? Because they do that kind of bracelet quite a lot. There's, mm. It's three figures all day long. But even if you were to pop in somewhere like Beaverbrooks or Ernest yeah. Jones yeah. or any of those yeah. establishments for five and a half grams of 925 sterling silver, you'd be paying way more than that. And also, likewise, for your Ethiopian opal. Um, again, do take a little look at the website. Have a little look. All the W's at jewellerymaker.com and you will find sort of different versions, if you like, um, uh, um, of this kit. I'm happy at that price tag for that bracelet on its own, let alone mm. the fact that you also get your Ethiopian opal and that beautiful uh, sentiment behind the star itself. Yes, yeah. Which it, it works perfectly, doesn't it? We, and, and that's not like um, um, cubic zirconia. That's genuine topaz. Yeah, topaz and Ethiopian opal, yeah. Uh, not going fast enough, says Liam. Right, how many do we have? Oh, we've got a big quantity kit. Big quantity kit. If you want this lower, we need to see you there. Need to see, try and find, and I'm not just talking, it has to be comparable in the gram weight and the quality as well. Try and find the bracelet without that beautiful opal, without that beautiful star charm. Try and find that at 24 pounds and 99 pence. Yeah. You know, I genuinely, genuinely think you would be hard, uh, you'd be hard pushed. And then obviously add to the fact that you have got an Ethiopian opal. Ethiopian opal this year has been labelled the gemstone of the year by Levion. Adam Sandler's, mm -hmm. again, yeah, that film, Uncut Gems, enhance the value of this gemstone once more. I mean, you could go on, look at Thomas Sabo. Thomas Sabo, 39 pound for a classic sterling silver bracelet just for the bracelet on its own. And I'm actually quite surprised by that price. That's quite good. Mm. It's not bad. Ours is 20 pounds and you're getting the, uh, the opal yeah. and that beautiful detail as well. 
Yeah, Monica Valeda, you're talking a hundred pounds, aren't you? And again, you know, if you oh, forty pounds for a fine. You've got one. your, um, you know, if you've got the uh, the sterling silver wire as well from before. Yeah. That, you know, if you wanted to use that, don't. I mean, I've used all of mine together, but that's. I mean, look how lovely that little stacker ring. Oh you know, yes, is. you could actually have three that slot yeah. together. Yeah. That's, that's a hat, lovely yeah. idea. And you've got three there. So you've actually got, you know, and then you could make that into a pendant. So the, the value as well, as well if, you're, if you're selling on is, is incredible, isn't it, really? Because you could separate out, you could have it as pendant, add your wire in, and you ha you've got three rings there. Beautiful. It's a lot of jewellery. It's a lot of out. precious yes. metal for 20 Yes, it is. So, so I'd be looking at it as components, um, yeah. and you can use them all together. I, I guess if, you, if, you're selling, if you're selling on, I'd maybe look at, Splitting, splitting them up as well. Splitting up the actual yeah, kits as yeah, well. Yeah. Again, have a look at the other kits as well because we do have different versions of them as well. This one with the bracelet, um, with your star solderable components with the Ethiopian opal. Um, we've also got um, a variety which includes. Should we do the other ring one? The ones that I'm uh, the one that I'm actually wearing. Let me make sure I actually pass that back to you because it almost <laughs> went in that direction then, Claire. Um, okay, this has got a cat's eye gem, so incredibly rare. Look at the finished piece of jewellery. Look how amazing this is. So, so one unusual. single light source will bring you um, a, sorry, a cat's eye effect across the surface of this um, cabochon. Now, again, it's difficult for us to show you here in the studio because I've got floodlights quite literally above me. But when you get this home, you'll have one single light source more than likely in your bedroom and certainly the sun in the sky. But you get that gorgeous chatoyancy cat's eye effect across the surface of this gemstone. Um, so, uh, then you're also getting uh, that star component and you're getting, what's this, Claire? So this is square lovely, wire. lovely square wire, yeah, yeah. So that's going to give, is that what you created the so bail? if you have, a, yeah, if you, and if you have a look at the, I think the ring as well, can you see that little ring there? Yeah, yeah. So what I've done with that is to add to, um, I think at the minute you get angles on um, sterling silver, if you're just getting that that luster aren't you as well um so yeah i just think it look it looks so so professional so i've i have had, i've hammered it as well but you can see there you know you've got it's, it's just such lovely lovely wire it's beautiful isn't it you can actually really appreciate this yeah. the detail yes it, can't yeah you? i just think having those angles on that um you know in the in the square square wire is, is really lovely Absolutely. it works with the angles i think of the the solderable accents can you can you see that? Get them home and you will see that beautiful, beautiful cat's eye effect. We're going to go straight down. Um, wow. Super, super, super low. Oh, there you go. Look, there's, can you see that cat's eye effect just there? That beautiful phenomena effect. You pay $17.99 for the gemstone on its own. You'd certainly expect to pay $17.99 for that beautiful sterling silver mount. Um, <coughs> what would you, if you were, you know, if you look at that, so that's, it's those that, so I've made with that, so that's two feature, I yeah. say, you can call them stacker rings as well, but, you know, they are, they are feature rings, aren't they, that, you know, you can stack them or you could just have them on their own. Yeah, absolutely, loving that, well mm. done, well done, any questions again that you have for Claire? The other kits are available on pre-order, should we, should we give you a price pledge, just so you know and you can shop ahead? Each of the other kits, which are again 925 sterling silver, are guaranteed under £15. That's a good deal, isn't yes, it? Yes, it is. It's yeah, a great, it absolutely great, is. Great deal. Um, may, I, um, may I have that, the, the little components back on? That sure. One, thank you. Sorry, did that's I steal all right. yours? No, that's okay. That's, that's lovely. Thank you. There's that ring thank back you very as much. well. Thank you. So uh, take it away, Claire. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to, um, well, and, and this is, might be quite nice as well. Um, to see if you maybe haven't done very much soldering. So what we're going to have a go at is, is looking at the layers of, of something uh, like this. So if I sort of show you around. So actually, although it looks, um, the finished thing looks like it's got, uh, uh, it's all one, one <coughs> piece. We've actually got, so we've got the, the ring shank here that is, is obviously our first part of it. Then we've got, I've put all the solderable accent, accents together. So I've got one, two, and then a third at the top. So we're sort of going to work our way, um, create this little bit on the top, and then we're going to pop it onto the um, onto the ring shank. So what I'm going to do is, if I move this over, let's pop that there. Okay. So I'm going to set up 
Uh, let's have a look. So I've got, if I just find the little accent bits, if I just bring some of these on. Okay, let's just get everything to hand. So it's really important when you're working like this, you, you know, have a little bit of a little bit of prep now, um, so that you're not having to sort of like uh, you know reach too far for all the little bits that you've got. Okay, so I'm going to have these on here, and let's pop that there. So let me just I'm just going to have a have a little look. Okay, yeah. so start thinking about laying these out. So. Right, what I'm going to have, and if I pop this in here, and I'm going to have <laughs> this one here. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> Let's have a look. So, the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to pop those together. So, I'm going to put a bit of my flux on here. So next one, so I'm going to start, this is going to be my first layer of, of soldering. So I'm going to have, so I'm going to see a little bit of hard solder here and I'm going to squeeze that in between here. So this is the bit that, you know, you just take your time with this. Don't, um, you know, just take time, try not to have the loads of coffee or anything, big shakes beforehand. Are you putting it on top? No, or, or so between? what I'm doing is I'm, I'm sandwiching it in right. between uh, and hopefully we will see, hopefully, I mean, it might bubble up a little bit and move, but what should happen is it, it should sit. So let's have a, okay, right, here we are. Hopefully it's not gonna move too much and we'll see there. So we're looking in between and let's get a bit of heat on. Make sure that I haven't got the other accent bit so let's have a look so oh there we are a little bit of movement let's just move it back in just so gonna the aim the torch away now while i just get this back get that back in mm -hmm. move that back there it's probably not very helpful that my uh board is my block is quite uneven i'm just going to turn that off just a second while i set it back up so, fiddly fiddly but worth it yeah and it so it, it is fiddly but i mean to be honest this is i think <coughs> just want to if sometimes it's like with everything i guess isn't it if things are a bit too easy well, um maybe that's just me but you like things that i like things that challenge you a little bit yeah absolutely um, and you learn from them don't you so yeah. it'll be so right let's just get a bit of heat in there now so it should puff up a bit and then hopefully it'll move back in, but I really could do with a new soldering block. So I'm just gonna give that a bit of a pinch together. And let's see where that, there we are. Right. Did you see that go? Oh, that, let's have a didn't look. take long. I, I, I deliberately didn't say anything because I sabotaged <laughs> your last soldering demo, didn't I? Oh, I should have waited because then I could have, um, I could have blamed you again there. Right, see, if it, so if we look at the bottom, that's the bottom of it. Yeah. You can see that there, that has gone. Let me just get my water and then I can, let's get this bit. Okay, so here we are. So you can see, so that has, that's now one piece, okay? So we would then, we need to then clean this up. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to skip through a few, because um, we I'd pop that in the pickle, clean all that up. But we'll give it a go because obviously when you're when you're soldering, um, what you what you want to have is you want to have a really lovely clean surface so that nothing is going to get in in the way, nothing's going to interrupt that soldering. So ideally, I'd put this in in pickle. It would come all of that that sort of like um, uh, that residue on there would come off, and then I can pop pop the next uh, layer on. So that we'd be then popping the next one on, and you can see. So then I'm going to add in that little bit there so you would then solder this and this gives you that lovely um that lovely depth and that lovely uh feature and that then so then if i show you this bit now yeah so to make your uh your ring shank what you'd be doing is you would with your if we have a look so you've got your wire here 
So I'm going to start and just push this round. And let's just bring this in. So let's bring that in here. So now we'd be either with your saw or if you've got flesh cutters. So I'm just going to come in, snip that. And this one here. And let's bring that there. Okay. So let's bring that in. Thank you. Okay, so what I'd be doing now at home is you would then, it's, it's about, uh, it, the, the more you do at the, each stage the, and the more, the neatly you work, the easier it is on the next stage. So with this, what we're talking about is with the soldering, we want a good contact. So if we look really closely, I don't know if you can see really closely at those, those two ends. Can you see those? So although I've used my flush cutters, um, which are quite old now as well, uh, you can see so there are little bits there just tiny tiny less than a millimeter just little little ends there so that's where you'd go in you go in with your files just file those off so we've got a really really smooth two sides and that makes a massive difference in the contact then that, that you've got because you want to make sure that it, it lines up and if anything alter the shape so you can absolutely alter the shape of um of this so we obviously we can see that it, that it's round now if you feel like you know you're, you're more suited to um you're getting better and neater results if you have like a straight edge like that so if i just bring this in so you see so i've sort of made it into obviously it's not ring shaped but it might mean that that lines up a little a little better we can then form it afterwards um so we would then go onto the so if we look onto the uh, onto the block now i can pop that in and you can shape it afterwards, right? Yes. Yeah. yeah. But you might find that it's a little bit easier um, to, to work. Do the yes. Yeah. Yeah. So again, what we're going to look at is we want to try and get that little bit of solder in between. I'm going to try and squeeze. So I'm, I'm sorry. I'm going to lift it up again, if that's okay. I'm just going to open it up. Let's just squeeze that in a little bit. So I'm going to pop that in. So the area we're looking at is this bit here, that bit in the middle. Uh, Liam's just putting way. solder sheets onto this oh, screen. Oh, perfect. So um, that's yeah, basically perfect. What, that's what you're putting in between, yes. isn't it? Yes, it is. So and I'm still doing hard solder at the moment. So this is where, you know, when I talked about sort of using that heat. I mean, I haven't annealed this wire first, so it might move around a bit. We'll, we'll see. So I'm putting a bit of heat away from the join all the way around get some nice heat in and there it goes. Okay, so now we can pop that in. Let's get that, it's in there. You would then go in reshape. So you just use that with your, um, you can pop that on. And that's a good way of testing what your, um, your join is like. Get it back in so that it's round. And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna clean that up and then you balance that on top of there and you solder, solder again. And yeah. that will give you that little ring there. Do you ever solder onto solder? So what you can do, there's a really good point actually. That's so, so you can, if you're really careful, if you wanted to, you could solder it like that. So can you see the difference? So you can see there, so before my solder join was here, yeah. as I've done more and more soldering, so what you would do is you would have, this is hard solder here, this one I might use um, medium or easy, okay. and then hopefully this will uh, flow before this one does, because uh, this one will flow at a uh, higher temperature. So yeah, that's a really good question. Oh, good. Thank you. Good. Phew, that's all right though. That's all right. Then. So there you go. I just thought, well, as 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 you sort of flatten that area, it would make yeah, sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Claire, we've made a promise. Those are the kits under fifteen pounds. Now with these kits, though, do I need to solder? Um, so with these ones, you'd so you'd solder a little bale on them. Yes, you would solder okay. a little bale. So yeah, if you use some of your um, use some of your wire, a little bit of wire. Yeah. yeah, perfect. And that will give you. So if I move that one over to you, you can Ooh. see. 
you've got a little. Oh, Claire, they're absolutely beautiful. I mean, they're really uh, lovely, aren't no, they? None of us would ever imagine that these kits were going to be, or oh, that pendant would be fifteen pounds. Crazy. The chain and on the its chain. own yeah. at fifteen yeah. pounds. Yeah. You know what? Um, we're going to start with the peridot. They are. They have the nine two five stamp. So you've got. Look how beautiful the chain is. It's got to be diamond cut because you've got this really amazing surface luster. There's your lovely uh, um, star mount that we've just been demonstrating. Again, 925. And where is he? I can't see him. There he is. Um, there's that beautiful, beautiful peridot, which we very rarely ever actually see in, um, in cabochons. How clear that is. Which perfectly, perfectly sits within um your star mount now we've promised it under under uh, 15 pounds haven't we and by the way they were meant to be 20 pounds which is a great price it's a really really good price. that's a great a really, price really good, yeah really it's really a good. birthstone we're looking at a birthstone you've here got setting um and, and i there's, there's <coughs> the setting actually as well if you wanted to um swap the things that you've got so some of the settings actually have like a little peg in them. So you snip that out if you want to work with the, um, the stone that you've got, which is the peridot. But if you've got maybe um, half-drilled pearls that you wanted to work with as well, these settings will work really well yeah. with that too. Look, yeah, beautiful. We're not even stopping there. No, 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 wait. Seriously, next time you're on your high street, have a, try and find a sterling silver chain at this price tag. You know... Liam's going to get himself into trouble. What's he doing? One show only. <laughs> um, yeah. Honestly, he's like, yeah, what are they going to do? Are they, are they going to send him packing? <laughs> They're going to say, well, go on, off you go. No, off to hobby maker again. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true, Liam. But Liam, these are gemstones. These are sterling silver created within the What are the you earth. doing? No disrespect here, Liam, but it's not card. <laughs> Mother Nature created these. And a very skilled artist in our, Claire, <gasps> in our guest designer, Claire McDonald. What's that? What's that? Well, yeah, technically Mother Nature did create card. Yeah, true. Okay. All right. All right, I'm just saying. 9 99 Has it got an... In, you know, Seriously, though, this is Peridot. Travels 55 miles from the centre of the earth. Jewellery makers, what on earth is going on? We're at £10 only for this. Is your ghast flabbered? Absolutely. Absolutely. Goodness me. There it is. There's the components that you're actually getting. So you've got the Peridot. You've got that beautiful, beautiful star component. That on its own. Claire, that should be £10. It should be, yeah. That Absolutely. on its own should, should be, be £10. I mean, you think as well, you know, you think if you've got any of your slider bracelets, yep. you know, pop, so I've put one bail at the top. There's nothing to stop you from, you know, putting your two, you know, two eye either side, and that's a lovely connector. Absolutely. I mean, that's that'd be an incredible bracelet. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now, yeah, you've, you've, you, you've, you've backed yourself into a corner somewhat now, yeah. haven't you? Um, should we do the sky blue topaz? <gasps> exactly the same components... Beautiful azure blue. Look at that. Look at the quality of the of the topaz. Wow. That on its own at nine ninety nine. Let's be honest. Early birds. I brought you. Uh, Clear. Both of us did actually. We brought an early bird the other day with topaz. That was nine. Uh, wasn't that nine ninety nine? Mystic coloured topaz. Yes. Yes. Nine ninety nine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're getting a sky blue. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. You're getting a, an 18 karat gold 925 sterling silver chain. You're getting that beautiful star. All of this for, for 9.99 today. That's an early bird deal, Liam. We don't do mm. kits at mm. early bird prices. It has been an entire morning of it, hasn't it? Jenny, well done to you, Miss Janet, Danielle, Pauline, Lynn, Noreen, Cheshire, Pauline, uh, Rebecca, Alan, Karen, hello to you, Sandra, new customer, new customer, Nicola, and you're there as well. Uh, do make sure you check out your baskets. That's amazing. It is. It absolutely £3.33 is. per component. And really lovely components, aren't they? Absolutely yeah. lovely. Yeah, it's not just like it's a... Great. You're just your chain. Yeah, I agree. It's not, you know, even if that wasn't quite as intricately detailed, as topaz set mm. as that star. Now, this one is proving to be very, very popular on pre-order. <clears throat> the top it's the amethyst amethyst always it's, is though it really pops isn't it it's, it's yeah it's i really brilliant. like the amethyst yeah. 
Wow. That's, that's wow. amazing. What's the length of the chain, Liam? What's the length of the chain? 18. Yes. 18. Yes, 18 inches. Yeah. A beautiful four millimeter amethyst. Topaz encrusted oh start. There are yeah. only 50 of these left, so this one's proven to, yeah, we thought that would be the case. Emma's bought two, London, Cheryl, Sarah, Jenny, Vivian, Lucy, Pauline, Heather, Sheila, uh, Mandy, Robert, Cheryl, Claire, Helen, Pat, Catherine, Brenda, you're all there. Um, again, quantity absolutely flying out the door on this one. Uh, 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 and you were saying, well, it's just, you could literally just create, turn that into a, a connector. It could be a pair of earrings. Well, at that price, isn't it? I was just thinking how lovely that would be. You know, if you've got if you've got two, that'd be an amazing pair of earrings. I'm going to put the ring on just yeah. so you can actually imagine yeah, well, any, it as any, well. Yeah, any if, of those. Yeah, because if you've got the you know the, the one mil sterling uh, silver wire, you know that that would work beautifully. It would work perfectly. Yeah, work beautifully. Nine ninety nine. Loads of multi buyers getting involved on that's, this one. That setting is almost like a halo, isn't it? If you look at the the ring, it's you know and the, and the pendant. It's that you know that's that setting. It's just it's beautiful around it. Well, it's classic, isn't yeah. it? As well. Yeah. Twenty one of this kit left. It may well be an on screen sellout. If you love this, we're going to bring the sibling stone next, um, and that is your citrine. Oh, citrine nice. and the star. Just or it, it could turn into a sun then, yeah. couldn't it? Yeah, that's lovely. <sighs> Claire, these are stunning. Kits. They are really, yeah, they're gorgeous components. Great giftable stone, says Ollie. Yeah, I agree. I agree because it's like liquid sunshine. Now, there are only 40 of this kit. A birthstone as well, November's birthstone. In fact, every single one of those stones that we've brought you in these necklaces have been birthstones. So you've had, uh, you've had topaz, you've had peridot, you've had amethyst. Um, what was the other one that you've actually, we, we've actually been, opal, they're all birthstone citrine right now, £9.99, pence. but again, this is incredibly, incredibly limited, you've shopped ahead on this one, I'm not surprised, you were happy at £14.99, you were happy um, when we promised it under £15, considering that you are working with precious metal, not base metals, you know, yeah, these there's precious, isn't it? This yeah. is solid 925 sterling silver, that would be a great deal, even if it was just for the 18 inch chain. It's not, though. You are getting that four millimetre citrine and also, of course, that lovely uh, star detail uh, motif. Now, keep on dialing through for that one, lovely jewellery makers. Now, we did promise a tool, did we? Yeah. yeah. Oh, what's the tool, Claire? Now, the other, it's been brought to air once previously and it absolutely flew out. So what's yes, this it's really then? Good. So, uh, this is a new tool for me, but it's, it's really, really um, uh, um, a great tool. I mean... I think it's, um, you know, when you have a perceived value of something because it's, it's a weighty, solid tool. Yeah. So there's lots and lots of things that you, you know, that you can do with it as well. Um, but it's, it's, you know, it's beautifully formed. So it's this like um, suede <coughs> uh, block. So you're forming. Swage block. Yes, I think right. that's how um, you say it. So <coughs> looking, looking at um, different things that you can do with this, if you're working with this, so you know, we talked about how great all different sorts of wire are. So we looked at like the profile of them. So we've got the round, uh, round wires. We've looked at that square. Another really, really lovely uh, shape wire um, for making rings is if you think about like a, you know, like a D shape yeah. wire, because it sits really nicely. Now, now we actually don't have it as no. much as, you know, it, it would be nice to have it, but this allows you to do that. Because if you look at it, what you're going to do is you're going to form um, you're going to form shapes. So if you think about it, if you've got the... 14 um, Sorry, Claire. That's, that's, if you, that is a solid li lifetime tool. I, I, I love it when we put exclamation marks on our graphics. It just makes me, <laughs> it makes me laugh. So you've got all your different... Um, and you can work this with your sheet as well. You know, um, that works really... So to get that lovely curve, so you can see there... And you've got your different um, uh, different depths in there. But if we look at so something like that, so if I uh, this gives really really nice curves. So if we just have a look, so if I bring that in, let's have a look. And we're going to start to. So I'm just going to. I would actually have this uh, uh, probably in my um, in my vice to be honest. So when I worked with it, so we'll see how. Look at that. Get on. I'm just going to bring that in a little bit. So I'm gonna. So if you like, 
making lovely rings like I do. So, so that this would work with the wire that we had earlier? Yeah, it would. So all, all I'm doing with this now is I, I'm forming to get that sort of shape. So can you see? So I've got that that round. Yeah. When, we, when, we thought of, when we talked about our um, doing the soldering and you wanted that round shape, but, uh, you know, that would work really well. If you wanted to have, if you're going to work with different hammers, uh, and so if you imagine that your wire is going to sit in here and I've got my um, uh, a different hammer, and that would change, obviously, the profile. You can see just about there, that's that square. If that were round, we push that in here with another hammer, a metal hammer on there, maybe a brass or something like that. That would flatten out this side, and then it's going to keep the curve, it's going to follow the curve yeah. there, and that would give you your D-shaped your D wire. So, yeah, really a nice, you know, hardening, shape, you know, shaping. So, yeah. I can't believe that price tag for these. It's very good. I, I think our, our tools are... Um, it's very, very good, isn't it? Very good. Um, Amazing. Because these are, uh, you know, specialist forming, smithing, jewellery making tools. So, Absolutely. Yeah, really and you still good. only pay that one postage and packaging all yeah. day. Yeah. So if you're already shot with us, then it's already covered. Um, yeah, I mean, we were looking the other day and we actually found, um, there was a tool, I can't remember which tool it actually was, but um some kind of forming block of some description and it was like 40 pounds postage mm. that's but before you even buy the tool that is a is it heavy yeah, yeah. well yeah yeah if you um, need, and you need it to be you need that's you know you need it to be for that stability so even though it was, that wasn't in my vice then that, it didn't move too much did it so amazing yeah Claire, brilliant. thank you so much awesome kits awesome jewelry as per usual Thank you. Very excited for your masterclass yes, as well. Yes, yeah, yeah. Um, that is coming up at 12 o'clock now. After the break, I'm just going to put this one out there. The reddest red jade that I have ever seen. Absolutely incredible. A brand new parcel launch. And there, there is only one person that can bring it to air. The fabulous Dave Troth will be stepping into the studio for this once in a lifetime opportunity. Hi uh, guys, so you, you know now, you guys, a lot of you are more educated than I am, but jadeite forms in boulders. Okay, and it's only the skin of that boulder that can, if you're extremely fortunate, contain those ultra rare colors. You know, the lavenders, the, 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 the mottled colors, sometimes a white skin. And in the rarest cases ever known, a beautiful red skin, which is the red jadeite. Now this seldom makes its way to market because it is so thin comparatively to the boulder that it's almost impossible to carve an entire piece out of a solid red color. Well, if you join me for this incredible showcase, you're gonna get the opportunity not just to see it, but to own it and at the most incredible deals. Taipei, 100% natural, Myanmar or Burmese red jadeite. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch 
catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option two. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of eight till five. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. A definite sense of excitement, Dave. I mean, serious excitement. We call this hour the deal of the day. This could well go on to become the deal of the decade. Yeah. That's the reality. Um, I want you to know that this is really limited, uh, extremely limited, so much so that we have just three incredible uh, opportunities. Yeah, today. that is that's it. it. Um, usually when we launch uh, a kind of new variety of any gemstone, we have a big quantity, so 200, 500. Today I want you to understand that we are dealing with quantities in the double figures. So okay. I just want to manage expectations. I do have something special coming up at the end of the show, but it is not this gemstone. So I want you to know that. If you are here for this incredible opportunity, then you are going to be blown away today. Um, I want you to understand that we have our birthday coming up next week on the, our sister channel, which is our biggest incredible event. It's, yeah. It spans a whole month celebrating 18 years. And the only jadeite, this is how kind of privileged you guys are right now, the only jadeite that I've managed to bring as part of that event is black jadeite, which is incredible and Beautiful. rare. Beautiful. But the, the reason is because you have the red jade out here. And this would not be a, a show next door. You know, it's three auctions, that's it. Yeah. Three opportunities, double figure quantities. And this is a, I mean, when we see what you can do with what we're bringing you, I mean, this has been created by our in-house design team. I want you to view it like this, because yes, we're giving you the components, we're giving you the opportunities, we're giving you the gemstone parcels, but had we bought this as jewelry, you can see the, 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 the value that we're talking about. I mean, this necklace alone, I haven't seen anything like this recently um, in the market. I've even, you know, been researching this morning, you know, always researching. 
I don't know if there's ever been kind of a, a, a complete necklace like this. Usually they're just carved into single pieces. We've decided to put this into an incredible necklace, kind of an asymmetrical uh, graduation style necklace, which is beautiful. Um, when you see, if you typed in, you know, red jade eye and you're looking at Christie's or Bonham's or wherever it may be, usually the jade eye is green and this color they get from the coral. Yeah. From the, the, the legendary antique coral, which is also a high jewelry gemstone. You're going to get the opportunity t today, maybe the only few people ever to get the opportunity to work with Taipei Red Jade Eye. Wow. That's because it's been a serious, serious journey for us. You know, I've met with many people in the industry, very fortunate through my work to have met with some of the key players in the jade industry. We spoke about one of them the other day, Roland Schlussel, who is one of the uh, key uh, jade eye dealers on the planet. He's a uh, uh, French. He's been awarded diplomas by Christie's. Mm -hmm. You know, he deals in Jadeite. And he was saying that he spent 10 years writing a book on Jadeite. And he, he sells the most incredible Jadeites that I've ever seen. Imperial Green Sweet that was on nearly 50 carats. And he was basically saying if you had that color in a bangle, it would be $12 million. Wow. He's got Lavender Jadeite. He's got Black Jadeite, Gray Jadeite, Moss and Snow Jadeite. Lavender jade eye. He had no red jade eye on his wow. whole booth when I met him last year. And I've met him twice now. And he was saying that when he was writing his book, in, in, in line with 10 other gemologists, they wrote this incredible book. It launched this year. And he said just to even get a photo of red jade eye for that book was extremely difficult. That's why I want you to understand. Now, next door, I broke some news the other day uh, with jade eye, what's happening with our kind of... Uh, strategy going forward. I wanted to let all of our collectors know. I'm going to talk to you about it today, where we stand with Jadeite going forward. And as a result of that, you are now getting the opportunity to acquire Taipei Red Jadeite for the last time. The last time. For the last time. And I want everyone to understand that because, El, you know, we see everyone's names on the screen all the time, but, you know, I get messages from you guys, and some of you have nearly 200 pieces That's of Jade amazing. in your collection. I mean, serious private collections. Yeah. Maybe some of the most accomplished private collections in Europe. You yeah. know, that's what we've managed to do. Mm -hmm. Between us, uh, between both Jewelry Maker and our sister channel, Gems TV, we've managed to put Jade in real people's hands. Yeah. You know, not just the private collections, not just the 1%, but real people who also want that material to pass down through the generations. Now, Red Jade Eye, you know, I often stand here and say, you know, we're talking here about really rare Jade Eye. We're not going to talk about value. We're not going to talk about price. But I have to talk about value when it comes to Red mm. Jade Eye. Yeah, definitely. And, and the material is so valuable, in fact, that a piece like this that was, uh, went to Christie's in 2015 had a pre-sale estimate of 10 to 15,000 US dollars. Well, it's called a Red Jade Eye bangle. <laughs> but the red portion of it is about 10 or 20%. Yeah, it's minimal. You know, it's very minimal. But that is how valuable the red jadeite is. I mean, let's not forget, white jadeite, which makes up 80% of that, is extremely rare and valuable. Yeah. But yeah. then to supersede that, we're calling this a red jadeite bangle, completely red, they don't even mention the white, it means that you're dealing with something far more valuable than white jadeite. It's obviously type A, it's incredible. Um, it, like I said, it went to the auction in 2015. And it really clearly demonstrates how difficult it is to get solid body color mm -hmm. in a complete you know, round or oval or whatever it is in red jade eye. And that's because, and I've said this many times, but I always like to cater to our new collectors that might be joining us. The way that jade eye forms is, if, if you think of an apple, it forms like an apple. Okay? In the industry, we call it a boulder. It forms in boulders. And they can be small and they can be large. They can be as big as a house you know, in ultra rare cases. And they can be as small as a football or as small as an orange. That is how they form. They form in boulders over millions of years in that truly unique geology in northern Myanmar, which is in Kachin State, government-owned mines. And when they come out, you know, you've got collectors buying them. They don't know what's in there. The reason they don't know what's in there is because they form a skin. That's why we think of it as an apple. And this skin, to, you know, from, the, from the external, from the outside, is just this black skin yep. that you can't penetrate. And, and you know, th these dealers can tell what, you know, if it's got jade in it. And there's many of different ways they can tell. But they don't know what color it is. Now, when you get jade in a boulder, so you think of the flesh of an apple, it will always be green. It will always be green. Now, it's not always imperial green. You might just get moments of that. It will be the whole range. So you get the pale greens right through to the ultra-saturated greens, but it will always be a variation of green. That is the flesh, because that's chemically and gemologically how it's formed. But to get the color, that can only exist in the skin of the apple or the boulder, you know, the crust. 
And that's because that is the material that oxidizes over time. And so when you think about how thin that skin is, if you were fortunate enough, if you were so lucky to get red jadeite, as soon as you start carving into it, you go straight into green or straight into white, as the case of that yep. angle. So you don't get very much red, even if all the skin's red. It's very hard to carve pieces out of it. That's a great image, actually, Ollie. We don't have to play the video, but you can show this image if you want. So this was uh, very recently when I was in JCK Gem Show. It was in June. And this person was basically saying, um, I've got Imperial Green Jada, and they did. They had a whole cabinet, very similar to the kind of cabinet I've got here, if you imagine yeah. that the whole top of this was a glass box or a Perspex box. They had it filled with the most incredible Imperial Green Jada. I mean, seeing that material. Yeah, you know, amazing. It's like uh, we read about it. Yeah. It's like, it's like I was starstruck, and I was, looking, I was like, oh, my God. And the gentleman was kind enough to let me hold a piece of Imperial Green, which was really kind of him. He knew I had n no, no, uh, I couldn't buy it. He knew yeah. that, but he, he knew I was passionate about it. He let me hold it, and it looks feels like resin when it's that good. Wow. And so I was starstruck by I was talking about it and I was like, is this the most valuable jade in the world? And then he pulled out that tray and he went, you know, the green is, is you know, seen at the moment to be the most valuable. But I tell you right now, this, and you can see it on your screen, is the material I can't replace. I cannot replace this material because, and we're going to talk about it, it's no jade <coughs> coming out of Myanmar right now. There's nope. zero coming out. And he said, my parents sold this material like 40 years ago. Right, and he's like, they sold it for maybe five, seven thousand dollars. Here you go. To get the material, it sounds terrible, but to get it, somebody, you know, unfortunately has to pass away. Okay, he says somebody dies, and they come in with their parents' jewelry because it's old material, a box that we sold to them 30 or 40 years ago, and they're like, can you do something with this? And we're always like, yeah, of course, we'll buy it from you for the value of today. And then you hear me ask a question: How much has the value changed for that material? This is how much has changed. I guess five. $5,000 back in the day, maybe we sold a piece like this for. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ollie, it's perfect. And he says, now it's like fifty to $70,000. Wow. Yeah. And, you know, I'm holding a piece there. Thank you so much, Ollie. It clearly demonstrates how difficult it is to get solid red body color. Yeah, Take a look at you've that. Got, you've it got... bleeds straight into the white, just yeah. like the Bangle at Christie's. It's an intricate carving. It's an incredible carving. I have no doubt that that sells for fifty to $70,000. In fact, I'll be honest with you, Al, it sells for more than that because he bought it back. Yeah, so he's going to make a profit. 100%. Of That's how business works, right? So, mm -hmm. and I'm not saying, hey, ours is the same value as that. Again, a hinge bangle, white and red. Everything, all of those carvings on the left of the screen, for instance, you see, they're not a piece glued on top. That's the jade. Yeah. You know, it loses the color as you start carving it. You can see it demonstrating here. Um, I'm going to say to you right now, in all my time in the industry, in all my time, and it's not long, it's like 10 years, but, you know, for anyone I've spoke to, and I'm leaning on, Decades of experience. You know, Roland Schlussel's been in the industry probably 40 years. You know, I speak to many people like that. That family that I spoke to have been in the, the industry maybe 100 years. I've never seen a full strand. No. And do you know what's even better? You and I, are we're like new to JDA. Yeah. You know, we, we've had like this crash course education. We read up on it all the time. We pride ourselves on, you never say we've got the complete picture. We're always learning and we're always striving to learn. It's what we're passionate about. But for instance, Susie is a JDA expert. Yeah, a JDA expert, absolutely. Right? And I'm not talking about, I don't know Susie's credentials, but I don't care about credentials. I don't care about, you know, gemology degrees. No, absolutely. Or, or geology degrees. I'm talking yeah. about people who've lived it and breathed it. You know, when I, when I meet the most incredible people in the JDA industry, I don't ask for the letters after their name. No. You know, their, 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 their pedigree, their provenance, their, their, you know, their craft is in front of me. I see the jade they're working with. Right, and that's Susie, and very lucky, and so are you guys as well to have Susie, um, you know, working with us here as a partner. But also, she brought in her family's jewelry. Do you remember? I do. And imperial green earrings. I you know, know. They're the most incredible white jadeite pieces. Beautiful carvings. Susie said to me, "I never knew you could get red jadeite." No. Do you remember that? Yeah. So she knows about white jadeite. She knows about imperial green, lavender, all these. I remember like getting goosebumps when Susie said to me, "I've never seen." red jadeite and her family buy, have been buying jadeite for over 100 years you know, she had pieces she bought in her collection that were over 100 years old yeah that is the opportunity that is available to you guys here at jewelry maker and jewelry maker is an incredible uh, business i look around i see all the, the the wonderful jewelry and the components and the the jewelry making kits that we do this is far removed from that yeah this is far removed from that this is something that takes jewelry maker to the next level it takes me to the next level it takes the business to the next level. We're celebrating 18 years next door. We've been, we've been thinking about it for the last year. 
buying jewellery for it, working with the best vendors. It's our shop window, right? It's yep. where we literally, you're going to see it. It's like a month-long event. It's jam-packed. All our guests are flying over. We've got the best jewellery in the world. There's not even one piece of Red Jade out. Not one piece. And there won't be. And I said to you, I broke some news to our collectors. Well, I'm going to talk to you about it right now. The West is waking up to Jade Out. Okay, so the Far East has always valued Jade Out. In the West, the Financial Times wrote this six weeks ago, and they say, Jade Gemstone starts to win admirers with their complex beauty. Okay? The subheading says, although it's hard to quantify its value, Jade Out, the jeweler's favorite form is weaving its magic. Yeah. And, and you've got the deputy chair of Sotheby's in Asia talking directly to the Financial Times. Basically, he says, the, la the lack of standard method to value jade, which has a more complex composition than stones such as diamonds or emeralds, has restricted its popularity internationally. So let me just, let me, because I've read this, I have a subscription to the Financial Times, and that's why I'm sharing it with you, because it's always behind a paywall. So don't mind you know, showing you what's in there. But essentially, you've got the, the, the um, deputy chair of Sotheby's in Asia saying, look, the, the Western uh, uh, clientele have always been hesitant or reticent about getting involved in Jade Out because the price is astronomical and they don't know what they're getting, okay? With a diamond, it's easy. Yeah. You, 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 if you didn't buy diamonds, you know, you could look on your phone and go, okay, it's G to H color, it's VSI grade, it's this carat weight, it's this cut, <clears throat> clearly. Much you know, more straightforward. What, absolutely. Same with emeralds, same with rubies, we know what look, pigeon blood, minor oil with emeralds, you know, you're looking for these key factors and Jade doesn't have that. Jade is about this real subtle understanding. Mm. So Sotheby's have said, well, actually, we, our buyers out, and they're talking about Sotheby's in Asia, in Hong Kong. They're saying, uh, you know, our auctions are usually just Asian buyers for Jade Act. You know, minimal percent is, is Western buyers. He says, since 2019, the Western buyers almost makes up a quarter now. Wow. Yeah. So 20% now. And he says, and to encourage this trend moving forward, they're working with the Swiss laboratories like Gublin and the SSEF. And now they're going to produce the standard certification for the different colors of jade eye, for the different terminologies of jade eye. And the reason I want to say that to you, because even if you miss out today, if you have jade eye in your collection, and many of you will, many of you do, I'm going to say to you in about two to three years, go and get it recertified. Yeah. Because there'll be a whole host of new terms, which will add value to the material that you've already got home. Um, I don't want to talk too much about other things, but we're going to get into it. Now, Sally Hewer, who provides us with our incredible jade art, she also provides jade art to Chow Tai Fu, who are the biggest jewellery house in the Far East, mm -hmm. bigger in terms of revenue than Tiffany & Co. She said to me, and I'm going to share it with you, she said, it's going to become impossible to provide Taipei jade art for you at Gemporia, especially at these prices. She goes on to say, we can only provide material for export, which is already cut. You know, it's old mine material. And because of that, we can't replace it. Because if you can't replace old mine with old mine. You can only replace old mine with new mine. And there's yep. no new mining. She says the price is going up every single day. And there is less and less in the market. And now people are buying up this grade as well as the imperial grade. She says, we cannot justify the prices that we've previously agreed for this quality of jade. And I hope that you and the team will understand. Yeah. We have to. So, L, I'm going to tell you right now. I'll work with the buyers here at Jewel Maker. I'll work with the buying team at uh, Gemporia or Gems TV. You know, I introduce a lot of those contacts and then work with them behind the scenes on getting these collections in. We're not buying Taipei anymore. That's it. That's it. So, you know, we've been asking, asking, when's it coming, when's it coming? We're not buying Taipei anymore. We, we, the argument from our board is, okay, what are we going to do? Because we have thousands, tens of thousands of jade collectors around the world now mm -hmm. that come to us for their jade What are we going to do? Well, we, unf not unfortunately, fortunately for you guys, we're going to buy Type B and Type C. Yeah, of course. Okay? And that's amazing. Amazing. I will not be on your screen with it. Because L will. L will talk to you all about mm -hmm. it, which is incredible. And the team will next door. But for me, I'm not going to be bringing you type B and type C. Okay, it will still be here. We are buying it. But I want to offer you the chance to own the rarest of the type A. The absolute rarest. And we're talking about material now, which in, in the Far East is considered investment grade. Absolutely. So I showed you this the other day, didn't I? So yeah. William Langley, who's based in Hong Kong, he's a journalist for the, the Financial Times. And he wrote this on August 8th. And he's talking about this, this thing that's happening where the Chinese investors are ditching property for jade in search of high returns. That's what they're looking to do. And, and they go on to say that, um, second paragraph, a coup in Myanmar, US sanctions, and the COVID-19 pandemic have all but frozen supplies of the uncut stone, sending prices of the finished jewelry bearing jadeite soaring. Okay, then you've got uh, Tommy Chan, 
who's a director at Sheen Teeth Jewelry, also a Hong Kong business owner. He's buying up mid-end pieces of jewelry, less expensive material, because he knows the value is going to go up. You've got you know, uh, Liechtenstein-based private banks diversifying into buying Jada as part of their asset allocation. It's the Chinese high-end investors' favoured collectible, ahead of watches, luxury cars, fine wines and paintings, with 27% interest in inquiring pieces. And Chan, who is also the sales director at Sheen Teeth Jewelry, said buyers were even taking mid-end pieces, which were not traditionally seen as investment quality. So you will never get the chance to acquire Taipei Red Jade out again. This is a complete and utter anomaly. It's certified natural. It is red jade, and of course, you know it's not going to be. It is the brightest. You said that. Oh, you said it's not satellite, unbelievable. Some of color. these will have like orange tints, and that's because they aren't <coughs> natural. They're not dyed. No. If we wanted to dye them, we'd make them, you know, pillar box red. But that, that's not the way that it's going. So I want you to. And that's not how you treat this gemstone, no, really. It's a hundred percent natural. Yeah. And when I was in Bangkok three weeks ago, I was talking to the the, the front line. I was talking to the people that are jade eye dealers, and I was speaking to this one lady, and she said, I. We can't get Jada anymore. Because of the, the, the military coup in Myanmar, we're going to talk about it. And the, the mines being government owned, there is no mining for this material. So what's in the market is in the market, and it's being snapped up by investors. Mm. Okay? You've got material like this now, natural Jada, but it's clarity treated, so it's type B. It's polymer impregnated. Okay. Okay? And look at the date on it, 2017. It's old mine. Okay? Uh -huh. It's old mine. They can't get new mine. She says, when, when, I'm, when this is gone, it's gone. And I said, okay, well, how much is this material? But it's 220,000 Thai baht, okay? Not 220,000 dollars, not 220,000 pounds, 220,000 Thai baht. Okay. Which is 5,235 pounds. 5,000 pounds. For type B jade eye. That's the reality. Treated. Treated material. You are being wow. offered the opportunity of a lifetime. This is far and away above anything that we've ever done for you here at Jewelry Maker. Mm -hmm. It is far and away above anything that I've done for you next door. In any, any, any uh, uh, um, component of what I do, whether it's buying, whether it's bringing it to you, whether it's Nilamani, whether it's other varieties of jadeite, whether it's argyle diamonds, whether it's prairie tourmalines, whether it's grandidiorites, this is the ultimate achievement. Okay? This is the, the peak of my career, and I'm well aware of that, and we're bringing it exclusively to you at Jewelry Maker. But it's double figures. And I wish I had 500, but you can't. No one has 500. Oh, not, red, not in Red Jade, I. Yeah. And I, I want to, well, you know, when we take that trip to London, when yeah. we do that, we're taking this. Yeah, And definitely. I want to go and get it valued. And this is created with the same Jade that I'm going to bring to you today. This is absolutely phenomenal. I, I, I'm, you know, I'm confident I could put this on first dibs tonight. And totally. For five figures. Okay, it's red jade and certified. It's a, I'd weigh, I'd, we, could put, we could figure out the carat weight, but I don't know what the carat weight is, but it would be substantial. And you don't even find moments of red jade elsewhere. I'm going to ask for a minute clock, uh, Liam and Ollie, if that's okay. We're not going to mess around. We don't have uh, massive uh, quantities. <coughs> we have uh, an incredible unreal. opportunity for all of you. And just while this minute clock's going, I'm going back to the Financial Times and they talk about what's happening in the industry in the West. They say it's a subtle beauty that we look for, suggesting that this subtlety means that it takes time to appreciate the beauty of jade. Unlike the immediate attraction of diamonds, but jade is attracting fans. So earlier this year, Rihanna posted Instagram pictures of herself adorned in green and lavender jade, and the British actor Gemma Chan wore a red jadeite necklace in September's British Vogue. Here's a red jadeite necklace. And Gemma Chan was, was loaned that piece for the photo shoot you're going to get the chance to own it for yourself. Create your own piece. Now, this is something we dreamed up. It's a stunning design. But you guys will also be able to dream up something as beautiful, if not more beautiful. You know, let your imagination run wild. Your only opportunity, your last opportunity of getting the rarest jade out on the planet. Three auctions. We're going to start with the biggest carat weight. Four no. huge rounds and you must get these because these will go into the necklace perfectly unbelievable is, i mean that is in the studio do you know dave literally you could see them from meters away yep. the color each it, one of those is 15 carats 50 they're massive yep. and totally carats. and utterly natural i've got 73 of these i'm letting you know straight out the gate i've got 73 no more oh, really? no chance of getting more if, if, I, if I could have, 
uh, and I'll be honest, I would have loved to have brought a show during our birthday next oh, week. Oh, No, I would have, yeah. because, you know, the, the most... Susie, first person on the phone line. I'm not surprised, Susie. And yeah, they're uh, absolutely unbelievable. You know, that says it all for me. Look at the... the, the, the I've never seen that colour. They look like apples. Apple yeah. red. 60 carats, 15 carat in each round. Huge. Almost don't want to give a price. Because I'm fully aware that whatever we do on these today, it's too low. So, Irreplaceable, unrepeatable. Liam has just said the highest carrot weight that we've ever done in red in Taipei red jade. Yeah. Is what, sorry? Twenty carrots th through a pack of six. Through a pack of six. Over six separate stones. Yeah. You've got sixty carrots over four solitaires. Yeah, I mean, let's be honest. We should have just sold these singularly. Yeah. And made four times the amount because we don't have big quantities. Yeah. And 15 carat would have been incredible. Still would be, it's the single largest red jade that we've ever offered to any of our client, clientele anywhere in the world. I mean, look at it, look, look. We're in the wrong industry, the right industry for you guys. But Al, I'm telling you right now, we should get a booth. Yes. No, seriously, because we, we talk and talk and talk about you guys extracting the value and that's what we're all about. But what the hell are we doing? I know, why aren't we doing well? I'm happy about it, well. it's amazing. Yeah. Absolutely love. Yeah. This, allowing real people to get jealous. Sarah, you've got three of these. Congratulations. The first price I'm going to is a price, and I guarantee it, no one can touch me off. Going to go to £5,000. And I could sell these out right now. <coughs> Absolutely. I mean, those earrings would be more than that. Significantly more. Yeah, look at these earrings. Significantly more than that price tag. Sandy, yes, they are I'll drilled. The You've got the drill hole through the centre. Um, in the earrings, you can see the head pin running through. And in the ones that are just before me, look, you can look, see at the top. Look, look at that. That's like a tang, a, 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 a blood orange. Yeah, let me just red. take a moment to address everyone. Because th this is like uh, a moment. It's selling out. It's fine. It is what it is. Yeah. What you are getting right now shouldn't be on, a, on any shopping network. No. no. It shouldn't be on any shopping True. network. True. Like... Jewelry Maker is the most amazing place that I've ever worked, okay? And I've worked uh, across both, well, I've worked predominantly across Gem Gems TV for over a decade. This mm. is the maddest, the most wonderful, incredible place in the world because what we are is providing genuine value for our collectors, like far and above anything else. I've worked on, on shopping networks all across Eastern Europe. Yep. I've worked in shopping networks all across North America, mm -hmm. from the East Coast to the, well, where is it, Minnesota, yeah, the East Coast. Um, and I did another one in Atlanta as well, so I guess that's the East Coast as well. And, and the one in Atlanta only sells one of a kind. Only sells, I mean, the, our, our average sale price here at Jewel Maker is probably, what, 15 pounds or something, I don't know. Some, uh, It'll something be some, like that our average selling price would probably be under 20 pounds. Their average selling price was 10 grand. 10,000 pounds. We worked with them for two years, and me and Jake yep. used to go over there, and we used to take, um, it was only 18 karat gold or yep. platinum. And we used to take our Larique collection. Yeah. Do you know what their co complaint was? What? Too cheap. Too cheap. Our Larique collection. So I saw a half a million dollar Canary Diamond sell live in front of me on the channel. It's an incredible place. And they used to, they used to have a guy that used to come in and bring a state jade. We used to bring a state jade out because, you know, you can't get it. This is before COVID. And I'm telling you now, I never saw red jade out, but I did see jade out at, you know, prices that would make your eyes water and beautiful material i wish i could go back there right now and just take this red jade no, you, create you, some jewelry and just go we've got certified red jade um i'll have a minute clock please ollie if that's okay ollie's just said something in my ear and it's something i know that i had a conversation with steve a few years ago about as well um with regards to sort of burmese rubies and he actually said, oh, we've made our, our life so, diffi so, so difficult for ourselves because we've we'd underpriced it. Yeah. And then basically that perception, it confuses, if you like, the customers, doesn't it? it but also as well, we have underpriced it and it's an amazing business model. I know exactly where yeah. you're going with this and what Steve's saying. So many years ago, Steve was the first person to buy bulk, right? To buy quantity. Yes. No one does that in jewellery. No. no one. Don't get who they are. Steve came along and said, how do we make this different? How do we get great deals? We buy every Burmese ruby you've got, right? Yeah. And then he would say, he'd get an incredible deal, kill the market, and then would put a tiny margin on to keep the lights on and bring you an incredible deal. And you guys, I've seen the valuations. Yeah. Valuations from like 2010 or whatever yeah, it is. Yeah, absolutely. Some crazy valuations. And then we go to replace this material. 
And they're like, okay, it's $1,500 per carat. And it's like, and we know we can still bring you the best value. How can we in good faith go, remember that ring you paid uh, 199 for? It's now 2,000. Yeah, exactly. We can't do it. Right, take 4,000 pounds off the price. Wow. <coughs> wow. Who's doing this? Um, Who's doing this yeah, in this the world? Yeah, this is the thing. I mean, we can do that with certain gemstones, can't we? What we've just been discussing, rubies, sapphires, and emeralds, how, how diamonds. Do you how, how, how do you do, you do that with red gems? Also, how do you quantify the ability to be able to do this? Because we can do this. We're doing it right now. Yeah. But That's in a normal business, each. exactly. But in a normal business, right, you don't do something if you can't replace it. No. Right? So you wouldn't sell something that then you couldn't go. You, for instance, and I always use this analogy, and it's so fitting when we hear about investors you know, moving away from the property portfolios and property market to invest in Jadeite. Say um, our parents say, oh, bought a house, their first house. Yeah. Say they paid, I don't know, let's say 20 grand for it. Yeah. And today, that house is probably worth 250,000 pounds. Yeah. You've seen the property market. It's a, it's a reality. You guys might remember. And say they say, OK, we're just going to make a tiny profit on it. We're going to sell it for 25 grand. OK, we're going to sell it for 25 grand. We've made 5,000 pound profit. OK, great. Amazing. Can they get back in the property market? Can they get back in? Yeah, they no, not for, yeah. They can't. Yeah. You know, because they should have sold the house for 250,000 pounds. Then they can get back in. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, this is what we are doing. But we are telling you, we're out of the jade market. Yeah, we can't type buy Type B, anymore. type C, possibly. I'll take a minute clock. I'm going to blow your minds. We're going to do a final deal. Half the stock's gone. Multi buys. This is it. This is the. This is the moment. <coughs> I'm warning you. I'm telling you. You've got 50 seconds to absolutely secure this legacy deal. 15 carats in each of those gems. 60 carats in total. Four incredible rounds of Type A glowing natural certified jade eye. And I'm going to go straight down to your price, and then you're going to miss out. So you've got half a minute. I mean, look, look, look at this. I mean, we are talking about. 30 Look at the size of it. Mills. It's huge. That's, That's red working jadeite. out at 250 pounds. Well, you, jadeite. Each. Yeah. But we're not even stopping there. Not only are we sort of priced out of the jade, type A jadeite market now. We've said that. We've been really transparent. Dave's been, you know, kept us up to speed. But he's, you've got to remember this is the rarest as well. That fine, thin skin that you... T yeah, we've got to consider that. It's not, it's not just priced out, Dave. Roland Slusho didn't have a red, nope. a red jade on his stand. OK, I can't believe what I'm about to do. I can't it, either. It makes, me, it, it makes me feel amazing what I'm about to do for every single one of you. I, I, I'll give you as much warning as I can. Usually we'd stagger it, OK? And, we'd do, but we, and that's to, to help our contacts. Center. I don't need to help them out because we don't have the quantity. They can answer these calls in a minute. They can all be confirmed. So... I'm just going straight down to it. But I have tried to warn you. I cannot believe I'm about to say this. It's, it's absolute sacrilege. Um, Liam, who's uh, producing today, for the final red jadeite opportunity, take £900 off the price. Pardon? Take £900 off the price. Good luck. Well done. Double figures? Yeah. Double figures on 60 carats. I did warn you, didn't I, guys? I did try and make you aware of how crazy the deals are going to be this morning. Of, we take huge pride in educating you guys, uh, allowing you to be informed, make oh the best my. decisions for your heirloom collections. I, you know, I spent 30 minutes doing that. And now we are bringing you the largest carrot weight red jadeite deal we've ever done. Do us a favor, though. Please, please, please. I always say this. I never get to see them. I don't know why. Can you send me your designs? Yeah. Please, please, mm -hmm. please. I want to see what you do with it because seeing what our team did with it was blew, blew me away. I mean, this. And, and all, like I always say, less is more, but that's red jade. I should be wearing white gloves, okay? Yeah, Let me you show know? you what you do with, with the piece that you've just got. I'll show you right now. Amazing. There it is, at the top. Look at how beautiful. Just one on there. Amazing, amazing. I mean, you could put literally that... On, on a, an 18 karat gold or platinum, you, we saw those imperial greens earlier on that just glow. This is the equivalent, isn't it? This is that glowing red. There are 24 of these left uh, and uh, we're massively over allocated. So just to clear, clarify. Suzanne's got five. We will not get red jade again. No, no. We and can't price it out. Usually I say, and usually I would say, if you want it, I can get it for you, but 
you come to me separately if you want. I don't want to make any profit on it, but you, I just have to tell you what the price is. I'll pass it on. I'll introduce you mm. to people. No one's got red jade out. No. Like, no one's got red jade out. That's the problem. If you want Imperial Green, guys, I'm speaking to you at home. We'll never bring it to you as a channel. If you want Imperial Green, if you reach out to me, I'll introduce you to some people that have Imperial Green. But don't, don't think jewellery maker prices. Okay? Do not think jewellery maker prices for Imperial No. Okay. I mean, for this £25 red material, pounds on split pay. I know. It's, it, uh, Sonia's got three, Sharon's got three, <coughs> Sue's got two, <coughs> Amela's got two, Suzanne's got five, Sarah's got three, Tracy's got two. This is what I'm talking about when I say we've got collectors here in the UK and America that have some of the finest private collections to date. Absolutely. Through what I, we've done. I, I can't believe the colour as well. The colour is absolutely astonishing, isn't it's it? It's a joke. It's, just... it's actually a joke. Like, yeah. It shouldn't exist. Um, Jane, lovely message. OMG, thank you. All the jade I've bought from JM has been superb. Looking forward to seeing my red jade. You know, it, that, that's what I live for, by the way. That's what I live for. Yeah. I, I mean, I certainly don't live for money because look, so look at what we're doing. But I live for, for these comments. And, Nothing. you know, it, it, it makes us feel amazing to know what we can provide for you. Unbelievable value. Um, absolutely not, Liam. Sorry. The show's that's gone. sold out. Um, <laughs> Liam's just said, shall I put the others on pre-order? No, please don't. No. Don't. No, Liam's no, no. been out of that chair for a little while, hasn't, hasn't he's, he? He's, he's heading so up other operations in the building. He's, he's a very important guy here uh, across the, 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 the business. But he's just come in. He's like, do we put things on pre-order now? We do, but not Red Jet. No. Okay, we don't do that. It will um, sell out. Give everyone get the chance. equal opportunity. So now we're going to go to a full strand. I mean, now you get the chance to make this a reality. Yeah, so the A-mills are at the front of the necklace yeah. here. Look at that colour. I absolutely love this. Honestly, our, our, our in-house design team are some of the best in the world. Yeah. They truly beautiful. are. Look Absolutely at. beautiful. Natural, natural, natural. Yeah. Keep Which is it. mad yeah. that we're looking at that. It's ludicrous. Right, let's bring the graphics in. How many do we have, Liam? Let's just let everyone know. Um, 85. Oh, okay. Not enough. Oh my God, look at the carrot weight. Yeah. 80 carrots. And you 80. sell them singularly. Oh my God. I know. That's it. That right there is priceless. Actually priceless as well. I, well, it might not be. I, I'm not equipped to give you a price on that. Like a market price. I have no idea what that should be commanding. But you would, uh, well. I, I know it should You wouldn't be. think it would be affordable, would you? It never has been in all my time in the industry. No. So just, a, you know, Roland Schlus, uh, Schlussel. Yeah, Roland not, Schlussel, yeah. Not one single red jade. one red jade. Red jade and, and that gentleman had everything. Um, oh, let's, start, let's start at five grand again, which is phenomenal. We do have the six mil to bring you as well. Yeah. Uh, we've never done a strand. I'm going to count these because they are individual. Let, let, let me just it. warn everyone at home. I'm going to do a, a, a ridiculous deal, but let me warn you. The phone lines are filling up. Everyone who just got involved in the previous auction is getting involved in this auction. Just letting you know, because you've got the big feature piece now. Yeah. But this is where you get to create the jewellery. This is where you get the opportunity. It's there, ready to go. Whether it's a bracelet, whether you're going to make buy two like Sonia and make a full strand, whether you're going to make this part of, of another strand, this is it. It's happening, and you are in with the chance of getting involved, but you've got to be quick. I'll take a minute clock... Uh, Please, Ollie. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, it's getting busy already. Double figure stock is all we have. Eight mil, which is just enormous, isn't it? Yeah, massive. And it is for solid red body colour. It is for that unbelievable matching that we've got going on here. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Obviously, you know, with, with the greens, which almost makes it sound, I don't know, it sounds a bit complacent, but with, with your sort of your apple greens, maybe, you're able, we're able to big, bring big quantities. When yeah. it comes to red in particular, it just not happen. the case. It just doesn't happen. And, and to have the opportunity to offer you something like this, you know, the, this incredible strand that we're bringing to you, that's the, the portion of this strand that is on your screen right now. Amazing. Amazing. In 17, 16 seconds. Yeah. I don't know what Dave's going to do, but I'm going to go to, I'm gonna go to one price. And when that price comes in, Ollie, I'm going to go to a minute clock and then your final deal. Okay. I'm, just, I'm staggering it once for you, giving you one opportunity. Um, so well done to everyone who's already secured this. You know what I'm going to do straight away right now. Take uh, £4,000 off the price. And when that price comes in, 
one a minute clock, bigger carat weight, uh, you know, more stones, matching this up, you know, visually stunning, matched to perfection, type A, mm -hmm. red jadeite, and in a minute's time, you're going to get your final price. So if you want it, I'd be on, this is your minute to get yeah, it. Yeah, this is your call to action. And people missed out on the previous auction where we were talking about the sort of the big uh, feature, piece, feature right? jetstone. Which, if you look at this, is, is the piece right there at the... Right there. At the base. Here we go. I just handed the, the, the necklace to out there. Just wonderful. Eight mil, I mean, I don't want to start talking about oh, millimetres of gemstones in terms of, oh, it's, it's versatile. You already know that. You know, they are the ones that we see knotted in Sotheby's. Yeah, you've got 24 you seconds. You know what? This is going to be a wild deal. And I want you to, 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 to secure it. I take no pleasure in anyone missing out. Um, this is it. And once this is done, we've only got one more auction coming your way. You can be a part of this historic moment. But you've got to be on the phone lines. Quick right now. Penultimate red jadeite auction yep. ever. 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 Yep. Never to be repeated. You know what I'm going to do? Because you guys have trusted me, because you're on the front lines early, let's match the price for a larger carrot weight, for more type A red jadeites. This is, this is the auction yeah, that helps yeah. you create the jewellery. Take £900 off the price. Good luck to every single one of double you. Thank you for figures. joining us. Double figures. Yeah, double figures for. 80 carats of type A red oh my. jadeite. That's the best deal we've done today. That's the <laughs> best deal we've done. Because best deal we've, we've done probably gone up a little in, bit in, in a year. Weight. Yeah, we've gone up 20 carats yeah. in carat weight. And this is the piece, we knew this would be the one that everyone wants to own. And the reason for that is really simple. This is where you can actually make the jewellery. Yeah. This is where you can create the necklace, you can create the bracelets. Yeah. Look, and look at the multi-buyers. This is what I would do. Tracy's got three, Susan's got three, Dorothy's got two, suja has got two. This is 100% the only way to capitalize on a deal like this. It's a madness deal, it's a crazy deal. Mm -hmm. If you want to create a strand, get five of them. You know, yeah, we saw yeah. collectors buying Oh, wow. Can you imagine? Yeah, absolutely. You know, and that count. sounds like an indulgence. £500 is no reflection of the true value if to get five. Um, Ollie's just ha uh, pointed out in my ears, just saying, normally we would say wish list it. It's probably going to be a pointless exercise. Do you, yeah, because no one's Nobody's going to give these back. Uh, forget the wish back. list today. No. Actually, forget it. We're not even going to show yeah. that clip of film. It's pointless and it's just... You know, we're, we're given this false sense of security. It's not happening. Mate Cumbria's got two. Yeah. Julie's got two. Catherine's got two. Every single one of you is, is adding an, more of these to your order. This is the genuine deal that we're giving you right now. There's 20 chances left. That means you, are, you can be one of those 20. Even if you haven't, Margaret's just got three. Even Angela's got two. Even if you're not on the phone lines now, you can still be one of these 20 people that can capitalise just, on it. I just, again, it's really resonating with me here, Dave. You know, the likes of... You know, Roland Schlu uh, Schlussel, yep. one of the, the powerhouse names in the jade yeah. world, didn't have type A red jade. No. And, and yet all these lovely viewers who are seen on the call screen, yep. you've got it. Well, not just got it. Susan's got... Uh, how, many, how many carrots now? Eight, You've got three. 240. They've got 240 carrots. Susan's got that. Tracy's got that. Margaret's got that. How amazing is that? Gloucestershire's got that. In a definite red. In, in a definitive red, yeah, you're absolutely right. Not that just a saturation. percentage. No, not just like a portion of it, yeah. a patch of it. This is the, 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 the best of the best. You, you are so discerning right now. You can afford oh, to be. Oh, they've sold out. I well apologize, done. I apologise, I apologise, I apologise. Well done. Well done. Now. Man, oh, man. Oh, my goodness me. Six mil. Right. Okay. Before you see this, Ollie, don't show this yet. I want you to understand what you're getting the chance to own now. I've got a bigger, I've got a bigger carrot weight. Uh, sorry, I've got a bigger quantity. Okay, so you, you, I'm going to say you will have to multi buy this because even with the two auctions you've seen already, and you said definitive red, incredible red. I've never seen saturation. No, not me. It's not orange. It's not amber. It's not butterscotch. Ollie, you can show it now if you want. Look at this. My God, we should be pricing this sky high. Color is king. Oh my god. And look, it works together with all the other varieties because they all come under that red umbrella. But with sat more saturation comes a bigger price point. And I'm going to guarantee you the lowest price point of the show on this. Which Even is, though it's stronger yeah, colour? Yeah, yeah. And I've, I've said it, Liam, I've said it live on TV. We are going to do that. We should be sky high. Liam is objecting in my ear, by the way. I already knew he would be. And I've, <laughs> I've said it. And that's why I've said it. 
We've got a bigger quantity, so I'm going to do a bigger deal. But that saturation Look at is it. actually, that's, that's what I would call imperial red. Yeah, it is. Right, I'm going to bring in the graphics right now. No clock. Let's get them in. Let's get you an opportunity. Let's get you on the phone lines. 60 carats. This is going to be the most affordable piece of the showcase. And every single one of you should be priced out. Oh, my out. goodness No, you should be me. priced out. You should oh. be priced out. I, you know, we shouldn't ever, we shouldn't <coughs> even ever get to see this quality. We shouldn't get to see it. Yeah, perfect olive. I mean, uh, seriously. You don't see it for fifty, seventy thousand dollars. <coughs> like. That's what difference. red jadeite should look like. Uh, I'm so glad it's coming across, Heather. It's unreal. This is going to be the most affordable deal of the show. It's a massive carrot weight. It's a full strand. Imagine matching for that grade of color. Uh, Greater London's got two. David. Sonia's got three, Renata's got two, Janice has got two, Angela's got three, uh, another collector on West Yorkshire's um, just got two. Dave, yeah. that was the quantity we had. Yes. Do you want to see how many we've got now? Yes, please. Okay. Cumbria's just got four. Do you know where I'm going to start? Do you know what the first price I'm going to put on your screen is? I've got a funny feeling. 499. Not, not 4,999. Four nine nine. That's my start price for this. Color is king, and this is the best color I've ever seen in ever any gemstone. Seen. In any gemstone, and for at it to any be jadeite, location. Yeah, and for it to be jadeite is outrageous. Oh, there's a ten minute wait on the phone lines. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. My God. Ten minute wait on the phone lines. Listen, if you have got a phone in your hand. Download the app, right. speak to our call centre. Let's do a minute clock. They're going to sell out, but let's just do a minute clock and I'll give you your final deal. That's what you're here for. You're oh, going to do it. You're going we to can't make it actually keep up with you. Sorry. We, yeah, there's not, there's literally, there's nothing we can do about the demand on the phone lines, but you can always shop with us via the web and the app. It is, I apologise if you don't have access to that. It's going to be an on-screen sellout. Uh, we'll try and stay with you as long as we possibly, possibly can. Um, if you've pressed your option one, our call centre will get you as soon as they can. You Again, there is the opportunity of a wish list, but I'll be truthful, I can't see any anybody sending them back to the studio. 20, well, you haven't got 25 seconds. I'm pretty sure they've all sold out. I apologise. I wish we had a 1,000 of these. I don't even think that would be enough, if I'm honest. Um, they've already sold out. Okay. I said I'd go to the lowest price of the show. I'm going to do it. 89.99. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. I'm sorry, guys. If we had, I mean, let's not be blasé. This is type A red jade. If, if we had thousands of those, we'd have still sold out of them. A collection of Worcestershire's just bought seven. Yeah, amazing. That's how good the deals are. Uh, amazing. So we've got a 10 minute wait on the phone lines. It has sold out. I apologise. Please don't call for it. Um, I did say I had something special coming up for you, though, didn't I? Yes. I said, look, we know this is gone. I've got something crazy for you. If you're a jade connoisseur, you've got the original jade opportunity coming up. We're just going to play you a quick clip of film to let the phone line settle down. When we come back, you've got the opportunity of a lifetime. Good luck. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. 
Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry maker, create, wear, share. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Oh my goodness me. Who wants an imperial green jade bangle? Yeah, take a look at that. Oh my goodness me. Yeah, so this is the original jade. This is the original jade. And the, the most valued uh, color of this material is this beautiful kind of spinach green, this glowing spinach green. And this is considered to this jade, what imperial green is considered to jadeite. Do you know how many I've got of those? Less than 10. I mean... Less than 10. Sotheby's will have one. And when I was in Bangkok, this is what type B, the material I won't sell you, jadeite was going for. And this is type B jadeite. It's not even the, it's, it's not the original jade. Polymer impregnated, okay? It says at the bottom, polymer yep. impregnated. Origin, Myanmar, 220,000 baht. Wholesale price of 5,235 pounds. If you're a retailer and you double your money, it's 10,000 mm pounds. -hmm. Yeah? It's not in dollars now. I'm showing you what it is in pounds. British pounds. 10 grand. For, and I'll be honest, because I don't care and I get in trouble for it, but I, you know, consider the relationship with you guys you know, paramount. Type B, type C carries no value long term. Beautiful, pretty, pass it down, amazing, carries no value long term. Mm -hmm. Type A does. And I'm going to give you this opportunity right now to own the best of the best. So this is not type B? This is type A, but it's nephrite. So it is the original yeah. jade. And the GIA did an incredible article around the time of the Beijing Olympics um, just after that. And they called it the Nephrite Jade Road, okay? The evolution of the green nephrite market. And they said in Xinjiang, China, which is Khotan or Hotan or Hishan, goes by many different names. You know, Hishan, also known as Hotan, is located in northwestern China um, and has always been synonymous with the best nephrite. The area is known for yielding the famous top quality mutton fat material. Traditionally named Hishan Jade, it's mainly from this, uh, this region, from these mountains. Most of the production from these two areas is white, light greenish white, or light green. Not today. Nephrite with ob very obvious green hue is called green nephrite, or bai yu in Chinese. Most green jade production is from the Manasi River Valley in the south of the Jungar Basin. Primary deposits are located on the, the slope of Tian Shan, uh, or Tian Shan Mountains. In the trade, it's called the Manasi Green Jade. That's what I've got for you. Okay, this is the location, top left, which is Khotan. So the mining of Manasi green nephrite has a long history. 
during the Qing dynasty, it was completely controlled by the imperial court. That's where the term originally imperial, imperial green comes from. Uh -huh, but they were okay. talking about this material. In 1789, Emperor Quinlong ordered the closing of the area's green nephrite mines. After that, the mines were dormant for more than 180 years. In 1973, the topic of green nephrite resources and mining was raised in a national meeting. This facilitated the reopening of the old mines and an exploration in search of new resources. Local government support led to the establishment of a nephrite carving factory in Manassee County in 1974. That year, green nephrite's production reached several tens of tons. The roof was transported to the carving factories in southern China. Finished products mainly are what, what kind of facilitates the domestic market. It doesn't get exported. And then they say, between 2005 and 2000, we'll bring the graphics in if you want, Liam, because people are going to go crazy for this. But between 2005 and 2011, due to the shortage of rough, the price of the white nephrite skyrocketed. Okay, we know that, the money yeah, fat. Yeah, we know that. And they say $500 to $10,000 a kilo, making it unaffordable for the majority of consumers. And then they say, this opened the opportunity for large amounts of well-priced green nephrite to be imported into China, right? So they all turned to this incredible material. And the price of this material, green nephrite rough, reached a price of $50,000 a kilo in 2015. Wow. Five times that of the mutton fat material. Wow. You don't get to see natural, you know, manassi green, spinach green, imperial green, nephrite jade in the market. You do not get to see it. This is the material we're talking about. This is in the GIA article. The green wow. nephrite bangles in China uh, market are mainly today from British Columbia and Siberia. They say it's very rare to see good quality goods made of the Xinjiang material. You, you can't find it, it's not being mined. They imported in from Canada, from Siberia. This is Xinjiang, this is Chinese. The material that's even extraordinarily rare in China. You are getting the best of the best right now. And they go further. In the GA article they say the jade bangle first carved in China from the nephrite is a style thought to date back at least 4,000 years. It's a smooth circle of bright jade wrapping the wrist is thought even today to bring peace and protection to its wearer. Jadeite bangles can be highly important pieces of jewellery. Some bangles are hololiths, which is what this is. It means it's carved from a single gem, single wow. stone. When a cutter fashions a bangle from a single piece of rough, a great deal of, of weight loss results. For this reason, hololith bangles cost more than bangles that consist of several pieces joined together by precious metal hinges. Mm -hmm. Okay, And even the precious metal hinges of the nephrite today are in the thousands. Wow. This is today, right now, on first dips. Not in Christie's, not in uh, 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 Bonhams. This is hinge material. And we know the, 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 the hololith that we have for you commands more. Here they are. They're sold, 2,744. Sold, 1,500 pounds. Sold, 3,500 pounds. I've got the hololith. No hinge, no pieces, no cut together. Do not miss out on this opportunity. Unbelievable. Right, I've got nine. That's it. Oh, um, sorry. How Robert many? How many, have, how many do we have left? We've now got three. Oh, congratulations. Do you want your final price? I'll give you a minute clock to make your mind up. Oh, my goodness me. I, I mean, 130 carats. Look at the glow. It's I'm wearing one. The glow's amazing. It's incredible. The glow's amazing. But what's even more amazing is the color. That's the top color. And it's Xinjiang, it's Chinese. Oh my goodness me. And again, we're gonna do what jewelry maker makes a habit of doing. We're gonna give it away. When we know the inferior material in the, in the market, i.e. material that is cut or sawed mm -hmm. or pieced together, is commanding thousands. We've got the hololith. And we've not just got like a, a dusty green color or pale green no. color. We've got the ultimate color. And That's it's not the opaque ultimate. either, is it? Nope. You've got that beautiful translucency. Real translucency. I, I, it's I, going, I, Liam, it's going to go wild, mate, on the phone lines. Liam hasn't worked here for, for a few months. I, I wish I was with 299. you. 299. 299 pounds? Mm -hmm. That's madness. Uh, we know that. Carol, blessing in Surrey. Patricia, Sonia, you've got two. Richard, you've oh, got one. one left. Greater London got one. Sorry. Oh, wow. Sold out, sold okay. out, sold out. You can get it home for 60 pounds, seriously. 60 quid. Okay. 
Do you think I would leave you like that? Oh. No. Do you see the one you've got on, Elle? Yes. It's 150 carats. Oh my goodness me. The one that Elle is wearing is larger. Okay, it's yeah. 150 carats. And I don't have nine of these. I've got 70. How many? 70. Minute clock. You've got 70? 70. Massive carrot weight. Can I be Big really clock. unprofessional? Why break the habit of a lifetime? Hey. I'm joking. I'm, hey. joking. I'm joking. Of course you can. I, want, I need to get one of these. Liam, before these even go on sale, take one off. We have 69 now. Okay, and that's fair. Oh. Elle did not know that. When she thought there was only nine... I didn't know I didn't wasn't... get involved, and that's fair, and I think we can all appreciate that. But Elle isn't, isn't, doesn't have the, the, the kind of luxury of being at home in front of the TV, ready to go. She's here bringing you this incredible opportunity, uh, modelling this incredible opportunity, talking about this unbelievable material. So I'm letting you do it, Elle, and I'm going to do everyone a phenomenal deal. 20 seconds, and this will be available. There is seven, uh, 69, sorry. Unbelievable. I've never seen such. It's that beautiful. As soon as you the see like, jade. The, yeah. gl the glow. The, it's that here glow, here is, here that here imperial color. And they color. are both the same quality. They are both the same material. But don't forget, this is the original jade. And you've actually got a larger carrot weight there, Al. Right, graphics in. Oh, my do goodness to, me. Do you want me to do, uh, before the COVID pandemic, before we even managed to get jade I, or jade, I went to Myanmar and I saw bangles. And... I would never have even dreamed of picking that up, I'll be honest, because yeah. I know the value of it, right? I've read the GA article, so have you. So I said, I want to get one for my daughter's collection. I know we can't buy any as a company because they're too expensive. And I thought to myself, you know what? If it's 700 pounds, 800 pounds, I'll justify it to myself. Um, so my daughter's got Jade Bangle in her collection. I went direct to the source in Myanmar. I'm going to show you a clip of film right now. It's going to blow your socks off. Take a listen to this. We found a, a Burmese dealer with carved incredible bangle of natural jade. They tell me that this is one of the most prized colours here in Burma and in the Chinese market. I just asked the price for this incredible carved natural jade bangle, 15,000 US dollars at trade. Incredible. 15 grand at 15, trade. 15,000 pounds. And this is the original material that China can't even get from that Xinjiang province, from northwestern China. Material, they have to import British Columbia material, they have to import Siberian material. They say you don't find this material even in, so, so we know it's old. You know, we know this material is old. We know that only the imperial court were allowed to own it. Then they closed the mines for 180 years. And you're getting a chance now, 150 carats. Look at, look, look, look at the difference, the yeah. marked difference in this material. All right. This wow. is my final deal with you guys, okay? It's my final deal, and I'm going to give you an exceptional deal because that's what I want to do for you. Um, I want to, to, for it to be one of those incredible days that we're all a part of. I want to leave you on a high. The only way you're going to be leaving this on a high is if you get involved, trust me, because you're going to regret missing it. Straight away, I want to go to 1,000 pounds. Just oh my word. Greater London, congratulations, you've bought two. Cumbria, congratulations, you've bought two. The original Jade, the, 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 the incredible Hololith. It's unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. I want to show you the translucency. I was just taking it off. And it's complete rounded as well, so it's not a flat edge on the internal. It's completely rounded. I've got my phone here. Apologies. Um, oh. Phone light. I can see it from there. Uh, there you go. Oh my goodness me, look at that. That's, that's spinach green, isn't it? That's that. Yeah. 25 have gone. Right, minute clock, Ollie. Let's not mess around. Let's not stagger the calls. There's nothing to stagger. It's unbelievable. There's just not enough going. I said I'm going to leave you on a high. Massive. Look. Oh my God. Do you know how confident you have to be in the quality to do this live? Yeah. Just go, take it off your wrist, yeah. bring it over here, get my yeah. phone light out and do that. And there's not one moment where it doesn't go transparent. Look, I'm going all the way around this incredible. Look at that. You have no idea how difficult this is to find. Elle I can't, is I can't actually get, get out. Phone. 
This is hilarious. <laughs> I can't get out. I'm trying to get my phone. Liam can't do it. Okay. Liam can't do it. This so at the not... minute, there is actually 70 available, guys. I did say we took one off for Elle, but at the minute, she's gone to get her phone. This I... unbelievable material. Go on, Elle, you go do it. This, I mean, like, you know, this is when you know you get an incredible, unbelievable deals. We've had Susie on the phone lines, in-house designers, it... Elle. Are you ready, Elle? Let me know when you've got the app open, because I'll wait for you. I... We might have melted the system. That's what we're actually thinking right now. Not touching the price yet. I'm going to wait. Everyone, it keeps... everyone to be equal chance, okay? Elle's got the same chance as you guys. You have the head start, in fact. I'm going to wait. It won't let me add. Oh, oh yes, no! it has. Come on, am I there? Come on, come on. Have you got it? I don't. Am I there? Okay, cool. I can see Eleanor in, in Worcestershire. Hang on. Um, 299. Match the price. 20 carats more, bigger size. You're here, aren't you? I just saw you. Check out, did I check out? Susie, you're in as well. Everyone's in on out. this auction, it's crazy. Have I done it? I did see you, but I can't see you anymore. I've checked out, but it's, I've, got the, I've got the circle of doom. Oh no. I think I've done it. I think I've, oh, I've got, I've got two, apparently. Wow. <laughs> oh yeah. That's all right, that. win-win scenario. Yes. Uh, here's Elle. Sorry. There you are. I won't uh, part with it. No, I won't part with it. Oh my goodness me. Uh, uh, we matched the price. We've gone up 20 carats. Still both the same grade. Still the, 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 both the same incredible uh, uh, material. But we are talking about um, an opportunity right now for every single one of you to get hold of this. There's eight left in the world. Natural, incredible. Unbelievable, translucent, spinach green, manassi green. Uh, I'm literally bowled over by it. Yours, like... There's yours, isn't it? Yes! There's yours. And your other one will be in the post. Love that. Absolutely love Oh, my goodness me. Well done to it. I've never Jane's seen anything got to, like it. Bev's got to. Elle's got to. Lorna's got to. Sonia's got to. Cumbria's got to. Greater London's got to. So many of you getting involved. Congratulations. Um, what an unbelievable opportunity. Wow, well done Dave. to every single one of you. Thank you, thank you, oh, no thank problem. you so much. No problem. As Look, I have, I have to leave, but I'm going to leave you with an incredible showcase. Okay. Yeah. With all the news that we've been hearing this morning about the ultra-rare colours of, of jadeite, we've, we've seen the, 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 the staggering prices. It's in the Financial Times article talking about how Rihanna is, is pairing together lavender jade with green jade. Yeah. I've got a last of showcase. So small quantities, massive deals, massive discounts on Taipei Lavender Jade. Wow. Unfortunately, I can't join you for it, but Ellie's going to... If you are here, and there's thousands of you that want the best jadeite, you're about to get a, a last chance saloon at the lavender material. And going forward, you want that material, it's going to be type B, type C. I'm going to wish all of you the best of luck. I know Elle and Liam and the Dream Team here are going to look after you. You're going to have an incredible opportunity. But from, from me... Thank you for joining us and, and incredible work on securing those legacy deals. Oh, Dave, absolutely unbelievable. Thank you very much. Literally, I think you've made my absolute year. Do not go anywhere, though, lovely jewelry makers, because this amazing gemstone, classified as a gemstone yep. of investment, is continuing to be available. We've got ultra rare lavender coming your way at, I can't believe we're about to say it, close out deals. Yep. Um, don't go anywhere. Best opportunities. We'll be back after this. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. 
You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one P&P charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Five years ago, I had a dream to put together the most impressive G-Dite line of jewelry, and so we have been selecting the top stones for this project. Myself and my team of G-Dite experts have assessed every G-Dite that has passed through our inventory for this offering. Have you all come down from cloud nine yet? Nor me, honestly, I think I'm, I'm literally going to be skipping around the place for I don't know how long. That's so exciting. And if you spoke to, because I know our lovely Susie, guest designer Susie is watching right now, who is absolutely, absolutely, uh, um, well, she's a collector of Jadeite for sure. But she's an expert on this gemstone because it has been within her family's legacies for literally generations. And if you ask Susie, I know this and I can say it confidently because she, she's mentioned it to me. Her favourite colour, her favourite colour of jade is not the imperial green. It is the lavender. And I get that. It has, this is a gemstone which in Chinese culture is symbolic of the heavens. It has that meaning, that protective uh, appeal that we spoke about a few moments ago with Dave. When you start seeing this beautiful gemstone in a natural type A lavender, and it's a hint, a soupçon, a beautiful, beautiful little hue, a delicate hue of lavender, all of a sudden it has this wonderful aura about it. Now, on the back of the last time, oh, that's really sad, actually, when you say it. it's so final, isn't it? The last time that we'll see red jade. I'm not going to get it again. We can't get it again. We're priced out. Executive decision board meeting, we can't buy anymore. Can't buy it, can't afford it. Now, on the back of what was an absolutely amazing showcase with the fabulous Dave, 
Let's, and it's ridiculous that we even do this, but let's do something completely mad, completely bonkers. Let's make, let's make some of the rare, equally rare colors, the likes of your ethereal lavenders, sometimes referred to as dove. Let's bring them to you at close out deals. There's no logic to this other than it being sort of like uh, um, <laughs> true to jewellery maker form. We have, a big, we, have, we have a big morning and then we'll turn around and go, I tell you what, let's give away some of the, the rarest gemstones then. You know what, let's bring the graphics straight in. Should we just do a giveaway deal on a gemstone that is absolutely documented, documented, We've heard earlier on, was it Roland Schlusso who said the fancy colours, your lavenders, your reds, are, he believes will actually command a higher price point moving forward than your imperial greens. Those aren't my words, that's Roland Schlusso saying these fancy colours because nobody stockpiled it. Look at the quality of that lavender colour. Look at that ethereal glow. You can absolutely see why the likes of guest designer Susie loves this particular colour. Now, Sally Hewer, uh, lovely lady who we have a wonderful collect, uh, uh, um, relationship with, we have a recording of her talking to us about jadeite, our jadeite acquisitions, the transitions that we have made in the past, and in particular, the lavender. So, the very parcel that you are about to get the opportunity to own, a heart cut cabochon, is the precise parcel that she is about to talk to you to, talk to you about as well. Take a listen to Sally Hugh herself, and then, if you can, if you're a lover, if you're a connoisseur and a collector, action is needed, because we're going to do that closeout deal despite what she says. This is the last 我们很愿意拿出这一小包的一部分来为你们提供这种材料的价格呢在中国正在不停的上场价格变得越来越昂贵他们呢都来源于一种巨大的原石的表层像这种稀有的纯天然颜色尤其是紫色和棕褐色的
Every, I mean, it should be have zeros after the price that's on your screen already. Renfusia, Cardiff, Carol, Patricia, Gail, Renata, Alison, Sonia, Tracy, Zoe, Michael and Miranda, Fiona, Gabrielle, Angela, Shona, Tony, new customer, Cambridge, Tracy, Carol, Jane. This is an absolute no-brainer. If you're, if you're a jadeite, do you know what? I was about to say, if you're a jadeite collector, even if you don't regard yourself as a jadeite collector, to get certified natural type A jade in any color, any color, even the more, more plentiful, and that sounds very despondent, but even the more plentiful apple green is absolutely astonishing. But to get the color that is tipped, if you like, as being the color that may well surpass the valuation of your imperial green moving forward why is it rarer yes two it has never been stockpiled the, the skin the reds and the lavenders in particular those are the two colors that we're discussing those are the colors that have been mentioned have never been stockpiled and are, are sort of tipped if you like for being the the, the more expensive varieties 20 pounds in a beautiful 14 carat stone. Liam, have we overlooked that? It's 14 carats. <laughs> oh my goodness me. You know, Dave was saying earlier on that it's, uh, it's Jen Poria's birthday. They're about to celebrate their 18th birthday. The quantity that we had in this particular opportunity, we could very easily have passed to our own sister channel and they could have made an amazing celebratory birthday piece, couldn't they? With lavender jade, natural certified lavender jade. Alison, you want to see the back of it? No problem. Let me just turn that round for you, lovely. It is a cabochon, so this isn't drilled. You've got that flat back just there, so you can you see? Um, loads of you need to check out those baskets. They're absolutely flying. It's a closeout deal, even at twenty nine ninety nine. No, let's ref let's let's rephrase that. Even at ninety nine ninety nine, even at one hundred nine ninety nine, one hundred ninety nine. That's an amazing, amazing deal for natural certified type A lavender. So we've said it. We've been very, uh, or rather Dave has literally said, look, board meeting, we're priced out of type A jade, uh, the red jade. We can no longer afford to bring it uh, to our customers, to our audience, which is a real, real shame. But I don't know if that's the case that with the red, that may well happen with your lavender as well moving forward. If you love it, if you're obsessed with this gemstone, as most of us are, get it whilst you can. Now keep on dialing through because we're going to do a little bit of a closeout, uh, closeout showcase. I've got a graduated strand, Liam, that is just amazing. Should we do it now? Gorgeous Dan. Is he directing? Uh, Flynn, can you, pass me, can you pass me a bust? <coughs> Excuse me. Black. Let's go black because then you can really see the glow. That's it, lovely, perfect. Thank you, darling. Here we go. Are we gonna leave it for a bit? I'm gonna show you though. I'll take this opportunity to show you because this is dove blue. But look at the glow. And I might even borrow, I might even borrow Dave's stand. Shall we see it under the spotlight? How many do we have of these, Liam? Liam? Um, oh, he's here. <laughs> Can we take a, take a wander? Is that all right? Because Liam, don't go anywhere, Liam. You don't have to run off. Oh. Here he is. Lovely Liam. That's what we need to do. Oh, yeah. Oh, are you sure you've got permission? Nope. No, nope, to do these close-out deals. Sorry. Sorry, Ollie. I'm causing havoc for the directors. <coughs> Look at that, dove blue coming up in a graduation. Look at it, oh my goodness me, it's insane. Coming up, but not yet. Um, right, let's do some more closeout deals, shall we, with your lovely lavenders. So the blue is coming your way. I'm going to start with... Yeah, I've got a really beautiful, it reminds me almost like of a paisley shape. So kind of, I don't know how, uh, how to describe it. Um, yeah, almost like a letter, uh, an S. You've got a graduation here as well. So I wonder if I actually can, 
if I'll try my best to hold them up towards you. Definite, definite, beautiful, obvious lavender. When it comes to sort of your jadeite colours, um, if you remember, if you recall and think back to the GIA colour wheel, you know, you have some which are most definitely red, like the ones we were showing with Dave earlier on. And when it comes to your pastel colours, it's a much more subtle, a much more subtle colour. There we go. The value of this particular material um, is accelerating here in China. Now, again, these are the exact cabochons that we're seeing in the photograph, the video sent from Sally Hewer. The exact cabochon. Um, totally natural, certified. Look at that. It's it, really lavender, absolutely. And that might sound so, uh, so such a daft thing to say, but <coughs> it is down to, it, it's not a hue, it's not a hint. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Place these into the hands of, place these into the hands of, our amazing jewelry maker viewers, our incredible, talented um, guest designers like Claire. You know, can you imagine these sort of with your gallery wire or your bezel strips or your prong setting as a single solitaire ring, maybe with halos of diamonds. Tomorrow we've got some the best diamonds jewelry makers ever brought to air, hands down. They are calibrated stones too. Um, imagine one of those diamonds at the top of a lavender jade. I mean, seriously. Now, that's where we launch them. We're going to go straight down, close out our, but try and bring you as many of your type A lavender, well, coloured jadeite deals as possible. Liam, Liam. £7.50. £7.49 on split pay. I don't think you can take the split pay off now, Liam. Oh, lovely idea. You've got the, yeah, parent and child. Love that idea. We, I don't think, Liam's like, I shouldn't have put split pay on. I'll take it off. You can't take the split pay off whilst the graphics are on, once they're on. I mean, £29.99. That beautiful movement that you get with this soft, almost pastel palette. We're not going to stay on that any longer. Have a little look on the website just because that is a bonkers deal. Absolutely bonkers. Right then, Liam, what else can we do? I've got a beautiful marquee shape. Yeah, look at this. I'm going to hold it, um, hold it in my tweezers and you can visualise it now with maybe a halo. Earlier on when we showed uh, Sally Hewer, one of her collections... Um, she actually has a green jade, I'm not comparing the colours here, with a halo of pearls all the way around. Can you imagine with some Akoya pearls framing this or maybe some fine quality, um, fine quality diamonds? Eight carats, gallery wire, bezel strips, prong setting. Let's not mess around. Let's not dilly-dally. Oh. Liam, do you see a, a, a type B anywhere on those graphics? He says, I see an A. Hmm. Type B would be amazing at that price point. It's not type B, it's type A. Natural, certified, marquise, the most wasteful in, one, in the world's most valuable gemstone. Regarded, it is internationally regarded as the most valuable commodity. £14.99. Imagine, yeah, the grand digirite alongside it. Imagine the fine quality diamonds that we've got coming up on tomorrow's show, haloing it. Yes, I know it all sounds very opulent and very expensive. Well, really, we should be paying four figures for the piece that's on your screens right now. Not the £14.99 that Liam's doing. Close out deals. Hello to you, Michelle. Catherine, Sonia. Hello to you, Cambridgeshire. You're there as well. New customers getting involved. Lovely to be with you all. Each and every single one of these are completely natural, certified, completely and utterly natural. And we've been very honest and transparent moving forward. We know that this is not sustainable. We can't, you know, it, it's amazing that we've been able to bring the opportunity of Jade out to our lovely jewelry maker family and ultimately the Gemporium 
Victoria family. Um, but sadly, now the world has opened uh, back up. Well, not sadly, good thing that it's opened back up again. But the price of jadeite now, um, uh, um, uh, it, it, well... We, we won't we can't sustain and we can't afford so if you're all right with type b and type c that's all good still jadeite but type a is the most valuable the reason why i don't have those now um okay now let me just explain for a second because we're often asked this question how do you do it then? How do, how do you continue to bring? If you're saying this is the most, one of the most valuable gemstones, if you're saying that it commands and showing prices from places like First Dibs, why don't you do it then? That's a, a question we get all the time. Okay, well, we could. We could absolutely do that. But that would actually go against our founder's business model. Steve Bennett, when he started this company... He basically bought as much of uh, 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 parcels of whatever gemstone it was. Take jadeite out of the market, for example. Amethyst, rubies, garnets, sapphires, oh, not so much diamonds, that's a bit different. But he would buy as much as he could. He would, uh, he would buy mines in some cases. And what that meant was, instead of you having to pay the 400, 500% for most jewellery establishments, he would work off minimal margins. And it meant that everybody, he could, he could sell, yes, volumes at a much smaller price. So no, yeah, we can easily go and sell these for thousands of pounds. We can. But that goes against the business model. That's not what we're about. And I don't think we're ever going to change that. Long may that continue to. Now, shall we bring you some more ultra-rare? Oh, my goodness, Liam, these are the lavender. These are the lavender. They're the lavender, the red. Have we got those red, Dan? If you, got, if you were one of those people that got the, the, the big reds, the ones we started the, the show with, how much were they? There were 73, yeah, 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 at 99 pounds. If you were one of those um, uh, lucky people that got hold of the, um, of the big type A reds, you need to get these because they will be the most perfect, thank you, Dan, the most perfect addition, I think. Look, look, look. So, oh, my goodness me. Sonia, straight on there. Well done, Sonia, my lovely. Straight in there. Look at that. There's a millimetre difference, but I actually like that. I'm going to put this one in there because I quite like the glow on that one. Yeah, the reds were 13 mil. For, uh, the, jade, uh, the lavender are 14. I like that, though. You'd actually have the... I personally have the red on the, bo on the top and the, and the lavender on the bottom. <coughs> Why not? I'd multi-buy for sure, because you could definitely team... You got four in the red jade, didn't you? How many do we have of these then, Liam? Um, no, Only 45, so they are more limited. You get a perfect pair. So it makes sense to do £49.99, and meaning that you can get... Yeah, you only get two, so that means if we were to double the price, it's equivalent to that of the red. OK, I, I see your logic. I see your logic. Sonia's straight in there with three. Well done, Sonia. You're not alone. Jean, Lynette, Susan in Newport, Wilma, Northamptonshire, Gloria and Zoe's there. But we promise you close out deals. But there's only... OK. We've got more rounds to bring you as well. So... Um, yeah, we've got a, a, a slightly smaller sizes if you wanted to create that beautiful graduation. Make sure you dial in. If you're looking for that perfect pair of earrings, can you imagine these? Remember the pair of earrings that Dave was showing on that display cabinet that, uh, uh, that our in-house designers created? Imagine creating that wonderful texture, that contrast between the soft subtlety of your type A lavender um, with the intensity of your beautiful, beautiful, rich, natural reds. In 24 seconds, it's going low and it will sell out because I can see collectors getting multiples of these as well. 
certified completely and utterly natural yes it makes a difference it makes a big difference in every single gemstone that you discuss you know for example if i was to show you a natural ruby alongside a fisher filled ruby of course the natural is going to be much more valuable if i was going to show you a diffused sapphire alongside a natural sapphire of course the natural is going to be what what stop no please can this be that's mad liam Liam, Liam, 20 pounds. It, it, no, it's out, it is outrageous. USA getting involved as well. Well done. Well done. Absolutely outrageous. No, that's madness. Absolute madness. Type A natural 14 mil. We had 45, half the stock has gone already. Absolutely incredible. It is a soft, beautiful lavender. Also remember here in the studio as well, I have literally got floodlights above me. So when you get it home, you'll really appreciate that beautiful. I've heard that before. One of my old producers years and years and years ago go, that's so that um, that's so you look all right. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, Ling. Loving the prices, says Sonia. Oh, Sonia, these deals will continue until one o'clock. We've got Claire. She's just getting uh, getting ready, setting up in the background. The most amazing masterclass coming up. Um, got some more beautiful pearls that would all look beautiful, wouldn't they, alongside your Type A? Type A. Do you know that's something? You know, we'll get we'll get uh, fast forward. They've sold out. Well done. Fast forward. I don't know, six months a year and we'll go oh do you remember when we used to do type age aid that's what we'll be saying oh this one's type c that's nice yeah we we, we literally will say we'll be thinking we used to do type a once upon a time guess what once upon a time gemporia used to do brazilian paraba tourmaline can't get it now you can't get it now. Once upon a time, Gemporia did Russian Alexandrite. Can't get it now. That's the situation. We're in that moment. Now, I've got a set of what? Set of what? Set of four cabochons. Yeah, I'm going to put this on a black background so you can see. Now, these are very limited. Um, so, and there's a lot of demand out there for your type A jade. Yeah, we'll look back on this opportunity and go, remember type A? Remember when we had type A jadeite? Perfect cabochons, perfect for things like your bezel strip, your gallery wire, um, the new tools that Claire was demonstrating the other day. Um, so there's a lovely graduation. Sorry, the OCD in me is get, um, means I have to actually put it in that graduation. There we are. Um, so you can actually see. Totally natural. Look at that definite, definite hue. £29.99. It's just, it's just, that's just crazy absolutely crazy one of those no not even saying it not even saying that jay gemstone starts to win admirers with their complex beauty although hard to quantify its uh, value jade the jeweler's favorite form is weaving its magic look at that color that's not light trickery. That's not, you know, we haven't enhanced that. We haven't impregnated those, uh, those jadeites. It's all completely and utterly mother nature, completely natural. Okay, so from here, I'm going to move to some oval cabochons. Um, I don't think I've got an oval. I have a drop. Let's do that drop then. Let's have a little look. Oval, oval, oval. Oh, I got it. Yeah, I have. Sorry. Sorry. I'm cause this be causing havoc. Causing absolute mayhem. Oh, this is pretty. We're going to go straight down. Oh, there's only 28, so I need to get a wriggle on, don't I? Show you. Far. This is a big, big, big. Jade, like, look at that. Oh, I love this one. Look how beautiful that color is. 
Again, uh, guest designer Susie, she's a massive fan of the lavender colours. I can see why. It has this really beautiful sort of whimsical, ethereal-like colour. Really compliment. What, Liam? Liam? He says, I was, I was wondering when you were going to clock it. Stop it. What is that Twelve ninety nine, Liam? Can you just step into the studio and just sing that so everyone can hear it? He's just sung bad boys at me. What are you going to do? What are you going to do when they come for you? you? You are a bad boy, Liam. Twelve ninety nine for lavender jadeite. That is why, ladies and gents, that's why they call him the plummet prince. The viscount of value. But no, 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 stop it. This is typey jadeite, Liam. The Baron of Bargains. You can't say type A jade, it's a bargain. You can't. It is today, yes, it is today. For one day only. Gail, hello to you, Cumbria. Lorraine, Zoe, Sonia, hello to you, Moy. Hello to you, Julie. Hello to you, Dorset, Suzanne, Oxfordshire, you're there as well. Abs look at it, it's just beautiful. It's magical and it's ethereal. Um, yeah, lavender and your red, they are the colours that were mentioned by Ronan Schlussel um, as what he believes are going to be the colours that could potentially uh overtake your imperial green okay now let's do the oval the one i was meant to do a few moments ago but i couldn't find it sorry liam got it now he says don't you worry oh i love it oh <gasps> no no this is a brand new premiere it's also seven by nine millimeter in a calibration so you, you we bring you mounts for this but also you pay a premium regardless of the gemstone if it's a if it's a diamond if it's a ruby if it's a jadeite if it's an emerald whatever you pay a premium for a one carat solitaire my engagement ring is just shy of a carat do you know why visually you won't see the difference visually you won't see the difference but the price point is vast Can I just show you something that will go put... That is ridiculous, Liam. How many do we have? How many do we have? 75. I'm going to be getting some of these. Coming up tomorrow, we have a parcel of blue diamonds. Claire. I know. I saw them. Oh, they're unreal, aren't they? <laughs> I've said it before. These, this is the the, the the diamonds that are coming up tomorrow are the best oh, we've ever. They done. are, they are absolutely stunning. Every every single um, box of them, just amazing, absolutely incredible. You've got completely colourless diamonds, which are an engagement yeah, ring, wouldn't yeah. they? Just some yeah, the shapes, the colours, just the sizes as well. These will be beautiful alongside your lavender jadeite. Type A, type A, type A. Gail, well done. Melanie, Ella, Zoe, Janice, London, Sonia. Um, close out deals, which is just ludicrous. I'm going to move on. Those diamonds are coming up tomorrow as your deal of the day. Um, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay. Can we do... Can we do that strand? I'm really excited about this. So... Um, I can't remember, I can't, uh, the, past, the past couple of years always seem to be a bit of a blur. A, I've had Tiggy, but also we had sort of the pandemic, so I never really can gauge time frame. But I was lucky enough to actually join Dave on the first ever launch of the Sally Hewer uh, um, collection here at Jewelry Maker. And historically, that might well have been one of the biggest shows um, that we've ever done in Jewelry Maker history. That that relationship that collaboration we knew was always going to be uh, sort of quite a, 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 a short window i guess because sally hewer is a name over in asia uh, and she's renowned for producing and offering some of the best jadeite in the world her aim was her her, her ambition post pandemic was to actually open her own jewelry the only jewelry uh, shop in paris 
that specialize solely in J-Dye. And what a, wonderful op what a wonderful dream that actually is, because it, there is definitely the gap in the market. That's definitely something that we're all missing, I think, here in, uh, over in, in Europe, um, Paris, UK, wherever it might be. We are missing that. But, of course, pandemic did hit, and that sort of delayed, and I will say delayed, I do hope that she still has, holds on to that dream, um, that delayed that ambition. Now, Sally Hewitt will, well, does offer to the Asian market more frequently than us opportunities to purchase your lavenders, some beautiful imperial. We've had the imperial uh, emperor white uh, jadeite from Sally Hewitt, but also she is the person that made it possible for us to own your dove jadeite. It is just breathtakingly beautiful. When we say the word ethereal, when we say the word magical, when we say this, this, this humble glow, this beautiful, beautiful aura about it, um, you'll, you'll see those words. They'll almost ring through your ears the moment you actually see the strands. Just, Flynn, can you just pass me? It's that bust over there, lovely. Can you just pass it to me? There we go. Um, so when you see this, under all different lighting conditions, it has this magic... Um, quite unlike, thank you, darling, any other colour that you could witness. Now, there's a question. So if you go onto the website, the GIA, that's the Gemological Institute of America, well, under their frequently uh, asked questions, a question that was mentioned was, does jade occur in blue? They answered that question. They said yes but very rarely. Pinks tend to be referred to as your lavenders. They describe the Olmec blue of your Guatemala. They don't even discuss your Burmese blue because it is seldom ever seen. One of the only dove blue strands that we have in the entire, entire partnership is about to be offered to you all today as a star buy. It is nothing short of breathtaking, and it's next. Now we have 25 of these, that is, is, is significant. Let's bring the graphics live. There's 25 of these, and that is it. Your, have you not seen the blue? This is your first experience, Liam. It's, it's stunning, the dove blue. Absolutely stunning. It's got this, do you know, it's, it, it's got this really beautiful, almost, well, heavenly appearance. And jade in Chinese translates to heaven. We know that. So to actually witness it in a heavenly blue color, I just, I don't know. This is my mind going into overtime, overtime right now. There are 25 of these in existence. Straight away, an amazing collector secured theirs. Well done. Sonia, not leaving anything, anything to chance. You are not alone. Angela, Zoe, Tracy, well done to you, darling. Fife, Carol, Caroline, and London, you're all there. This is the only Dove Blue opportunity that we have in the entire biz uh, business, and it is a definite, definite blue. Can I just point out something as well? With certain jadeite colors, we will encourage the color through the, th the, through the cord. That's not something that's unique to us here at Jewelry Maker. That is something that is used globally. Do you think this has a blue cord running through? Do you want me to ask, answer that question? No, it is a pure white cord. This blue is all certified natural, certified natural. The quality is just stunning. I wish I had more. From six to 10 millimeters, this is the kind of piece that I, I, I know I've said this before, knot it with silk, 
put it with a platinum or an 18 karat gold clasp. And if you want to make money, then literally take it to Bonhams. That, that's all you need to do. Oh, but I personally couldn't do that. I couldn't part with this. It's the only dove blue that I've ever actually had the privilege of seeing. Do you know what I would do? I would knot it. I would put it with the high end precious metal clasp and I would put it under lock and key because this is legacy opportunities. You know, we've said about the Taipei, we're not going to be able, we're priced out. We can't buy it anymore. We can't. Uh, us as a, as, as a company, and um, they've got they've got the money. Gemporia is you know is a successful company. They can buy pretty much any gemstone. They're priced out because literally we can't offer savings to our lovely viewers anymore. Taipei Jadeite is considered an investment stone. When you then start thinking about when you start thinking about the the Dove Blue in particular, how often do you see it? Do you own it? Even if we were to stop here, that would be amazing. How about then if I said, let's half that price tag. Look at how in, look at the blue. Look at the blue. You could be, you could literally compare this to an aquamarine blue, couldn't you? You have a minute to secure yours. There are just 19 left. June, Carol, Angela, Sonia, Tracy, well done. Well done. Every single one of our absolutely amazing collectors. Susan. Susan has said, I have this. It is lovely. But the photograph in the graphics really does not equate to the beauty you get. That's so lovely of you to message in and say that. Because you know what, Susan, it's so difficult actually on our uh, so the live TV cameras, live TV screens, and, and literally with the camera, you, oh, you see it on the Wall of Fame, lots of our lovely viewers will say it's hard to capture the colour. Look, get this home, use your 30 day money back guarantee. It's dove blue. Yeah, uh, this is a thing. Do you think if you bought it from Sotheby's and said, I, I tell you what, I'll buy it. But give me 30 days. If I'm not quite happy, I'm going to send it back to you. That's just, just not how it works. There was 25 available in existence. Half the stock has gone. This is a one chance only. £199.99. Absolute madness. It's the only Dove Blue, thanks to the wonderful Sally Hewer that made this window of opportunity available, even if it is just for a handful of us. Um, that was the quantity. Margaret, Bev, you've got yours. New customer, Aberdeenshire, Nottinghamshire, Surrey, uh, London, and also West Midlands. Um, so yeah, Bev, Margaret, new customer, June, Carol, Angela, Sonia, Tracy. I've also got Moy, Kent, Lancashire, Louise, Zoe, Fife, Caroline and London in there. Can you not? If you can't not, we can teach you. You, one thing that I really, really, really dig my heels in and sort of jump, start, jump on soapboxes and whatever the expression is, we should be, we should be selling platinum clasps here at Jewelry Maker. We should be selling 18 karat gold clasps here at Jewelry Maker. Do you agree, Claire? Yeah. And, and yeah. do you know, I'll be honest, I'll tell you, I've gone to the powers that be, I've been to the managing director, I've been to the buying team, and I'm saying, why aren't we doing this? Look at the quality of the stones. Look at the quality of the stones. This should have an 18 karat gold clasp. Yeah, totally. I have to go to our competitors to buy an 18 karat gold clasp. Yeah. 50 pounds. 50 pounds on split pay. The final few, Lynette, you've got yours. Um, I'm in single figures. We're over allocated on that. Get it home. It's the only blue that I can bring you with that graduation. Absolutely incredible. If you don't, my order's open, isn't it? I'm going to be getting one, one of these as well. Unbelievable. Absolutely unbelievable. Now, uh, okay, we've got just a couple of minutes to squeeze in just a couple more of your closeout deals before I step over to the gorgeous Claire McDonald for an absolutely amazing. There she is. Do you want to? Do you want to show your kit? Yes. Yeah. You show everything. What what you've made? Yeah. So what do you get in this kit, Claire? Oh, you get a tiny weeny 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 bit of sterling silver and a tiny weeny weeny bit of um, spinel. 
Are you being sarcastic? I am being very sarcastic. Yeah, I thought so. I am. I thought so. Huge amount of sterling silver and a huge amount of spinel. Natural spinel. Incredible strands. Now, you heard Liam negotiating the price this morning. I did, yeah. He's yes. done a deal, hasn't so, he? Yeah, get ready, yeah. He's done a deal. Ah, oh, look at that beautiful necklace. So, um, join us in the next hour where Claire will be showing how to make that amazing piece. But just before we do, a few of you have asked for some green. Okay, no problem. Now... Um, after your masterclass, after the kits, etc., we do have some more jade that we can um, include in the show if need be. However, just to sort of round up the top of this hour, I love this because you have your high goose, which are flat, don't you? And you have donuts. This is, I don't know, a curved donut ring. Does that make sense? It doesn't make any sense, does it? Let me just show you. I've actually got this piece. I actually wear it on a, on a gold-plated chain. I've got this very piece. And all I do is let, literally feed it through. Oh, that's lovely. On a 20-inch gold plate. Let it move on the chain. Sterling. So super simple. Nice, yeah. It gets yeah. so much attention, this piece. Uh, what I love, you've got amazing, amazing texture. Great way for gents to wear it. You could you can have this like on a lark's head knot on a bit of leather. You can macrame from it either side. Um, I literally just put the chain straight through the center of the donut and wear it exactly as is. It's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. In fact, actually thinking back, I've actually gifted this to my niece as well. She loves uh, her gemstones, a protective gem. So just oh. to wear it around something really casual, quite tactile. It doesn't have to break the bank, whereas it would do ordinarily. Certified natural Taipei, 29 carrots do you think we're going to stop at 29.99 do you think that's a closeout deal claire i think that's an excellent price this is a closeout deal or use it as an alternative in a toggle yeah like a nice maybe like a nice chiffon scarf that would go through wouldn't it Just have it like a, a, an a angle chiffon scarf a shift well yeah a chiffon <laughs> Chiffon. A chiffon scarf, nice, you know. Well, it's nice in this weather, isn't it, to start wearing those sort of like that are your well, lighter, not your big woolly ones. I love those as well, but until it um <laughs> big woolly, big woolly scarf. Woolly I'm scarf. not saying yeah. a woolly scarf. <laughs> Give up. <laughs> oh my goodness me. Um, oh my goodness me. Yes, I get it. That's a great idea. And it'd be lovely, wouldn't it? Really what about lovely. like a lariat? Yes. Lovely as yeah. a lariat too. Yeah. Um, close out deals. Well done, everybody. Congratulations to you all. Lorraine, Sonia, Pat, Jenny. Hello to you, Melanie, Heather, Sally. Hello to you, Carol. New customer, lots of multi buyers. If you want a really quick gift, like I said, I popped down. To, well, it was when my niece actually, she just sat her GCSEs. Uh, summer just gone. And... Um, and uh, um, she did really well, so just as a well done, I, I bought her a piece, well this, this very piece, thread it onto a 95 sterling silver chain, and I hope that she loves it. Um, I certainly wear mine loads. 24.99, well done everybody. Now coming up, we've got the most amazing masterclass with the fabulous Claire McDonald, a mega, mega kit with loads of your spinel and all that lovely sterling silver. We've also got what? Three strands of yeah, freshwater beautiful. pearls oh. with a sterling silver connector, which we can bring to you at a closeout deal that would go amazing alongside the masterclass. <gasps> oh, goodness me. Next hour is going to be absolutely amazing too. Don't go anywhere. Congratulations, everybody, once again, on each and every single one of your type A jade eye. We're not going to be able to say that for very long. So type A jade eye opportunities. What an amazing achievement. We'll be back after this. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. 
If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, 7 days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Stay interactive with Jewelry Maker by texting the studio during our live hours of 8 till 5. Start your message with JM Studio and send it to 78070. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one P&P charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. For the weekend. That's for you. Oh, thank you. That was just for you. Claire McDonald, everybody. Oh, thank you. Oh. I love the weekend. Me too. Uh, I mean, I love the weekend as well, but yeah, I, I love the weekend. Oh, we got told off earlier on. Must, oh. We mustn't be unprofessional. Oh. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. It's just a comment. This comment was made. Oh. Right. No, don't change. Never change. This kit is nothing short of exquisite. Yes, it is. Is this an Alice kit? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Very likely. She does make beautiful, beautiful She really kits, does. Yeah. We love our yeah. Alice. Yeah. Absolutely she love brilliant. Alice. She is lovely. Do you know, and she puts together... I mean, it's, lit, it's simple in terms of the components, isn't it? You've got two very luxurious components. Yeah. yeah. That make up a lot, if that makes sense. Yes, I would say probably... Uh, like I say, so the largest most intricate um, focal piece and as, as much, I don't think I've ever worked with that much um, of any gemstone, oh. particularly not a black spinel, because it's all about that sparkle. If you'd put that, if you put that, that centerpiece with any other gemstone, yep. I don't know if it, you know, because it's, they need, it needs to be that sparkly spinel, doesn't it? It needs to be Guess that. Guess what, to, that is Alice, sit. by the way. Yeah, well, there it we is go, Alice. yeah. Now, yeah. I ignore the photograph on the website. Um, because it only shows one strand of right, it's spinel. Okay. Yes, you definitely don't get one strand. How many strands do you get? Uh, you get eight. Eight? Yeah. You yeah. definitely, definitely get eight. Our, our, our photograph is wrong. Look, it even says it there. Yeah, yeah. Eight 
and our sample in the studio is wrong as well. You get eight natural black spinel strands, all of which, by the way, 32 centimetres, three millimetre faceted rounds. They would go absolutely beautifully, Claire, with the other deal that we have for you today. Yeah, they're perfect, aren't they? Perfect combination. Black spinel pearls and silver. Yes, please. Ooh. Ooh. Do you remember the first time, Claire, that we ever saw those little black spinel faceted? Yeah. Do you remember that show? I do, yeah. Back at Ivy yeah, House. Yeah, yeah. And I was like, oh, Claire, you need to make a stretchy bracelet with that or two. Yeah. I mean, black spinel is, it's amazing, isn't it? It's the ultimate. Yeah, and so you can just, you can just have, uh, you know, one stacker bracelet, or one simple bracelet with, with, with spinel, and you'll get so much sparkle, so much sparkle. You get loads. I wish you could actually feel the gram weight on this. Yeah, I mean, so to give you an idea... <coughs> three, how many? Three yeah, metres of black spinel. There is an absolute load. And then there's this pendant... Oh my yeah, goodness, Claire. Yeah. Look, look at the ground I mean, weight. How amazing is that? Is that pendant? Sterling silver. Oh my goodness me. It does look like the emblem look on the front of the never ending is. story. Yes. Look at that. Solid 925 sterling silver. I thought so. Nine grams. Yeah. Have we it's ever done a no. pendant of nine grams? No. It's absolutely incredible. And and but it's so it's so clever because you can use this. You could use this in, in so many different directions. Because if you look at the front, it's absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. You look at the side, you look at profile, and you've got so many connector points. As yeah, well. because you've got so that gallery, haven't points. you? So if I turn it sideways. Oh, I love what you've done there, Claire. So you've flipped, almost flipped it upside down, haven't you, in that piece? Yeah, so you've got that, um, yeah, that lovely... There's the gallery, one. so that's yeah. your connection point. But look at how many connect... And you've got... And, and there's so many, so many different, um, so many different ways you can work with that, say, with your jump rings or, um, you know, if you're going to use your gar wire guardians. It, it's, it's genius, absolute genius. And it looks beautiful. So, I mean, firstly... All your Christmases must have come at once to get this kit. I know, I know. Just yeah, beautiful. It's, it, it's, it's, a, it's the elegance of it, I think, yeah. as well. That's really, really, really high end. And, um, and where do you go with something like this when it lands on your doorstep? Eight strands so, of beautifully <coughs> faceted spinel and, and that amazing statement pendant. So it was really, really lovely. So I went in and talked to um, Sue, you know, uh, uh, in house. Yeah, yeah, Anne and Sue. Um, and she'd already she'd made this beautiful piece here, and okay. so you can see you've got you've got that thick thick band of um, spinel. Um, so I talked to her, and then um, yeah, and so so I'd got my kit through, and then so it's doing something uh, doing something very similar, but then adding I just wanted to add a little bit of um, a bit of sort of bulk I guess around that connector, almost to, to recreate those um, uh, like the geometric shapes you know of like your. Art Deco and things like that. So, so using um, making your beady beads just to create a bit more um, uh, of the sparkle uh, around that connector. So it gives you. I think it's really nice that you've got two different examples of using um, using the kit, isn't it? So you can yeah. see diff different ways. But just to give you an idea <coughs> with that with that spinel. So if I take if I take this off, so this if I take this off and you can see on here, so you can oh, see how many oh, how many are here. So that all, there's all that spinel. So you've got you've got like 12 beady beads on here. And if I take, you know, see, so then I've done my prep work, and I've still got and you've all still of got this. Four left. That, so that's that's one kit. So wow. you know, the amount you're getting is <coughs> absolutely incredible. And, uh, really, really incredible. Black spinel. It, it is a performance gemstone, isn't it, Claire? I mean, you, you know, you look, look at look at the that. Very. Oh yeah, exactly. And that's natural. It's not coated. Yeah. Look at the very beautiful. Jennifer Aniston, that's it. Oh, lovely. Oh, she's lovely, isn't she? She is. Look, literally just one almost... Ro it is rosary-linked, isn't it? Rosary-linked. Yeah. yeah. She's got there in a, a plunging dress. Beautiful. Look at this necklace. First dibs. Oh, stunning. Gosh, that's lovely, isn't it? With some chrysophrases. Terrible English, by the way. We have chrysophrase in tomorrow, yeah. Look at that. One simple tassel. Oh, and I, I, that, that's beautiful. I think our spinel is um, much better. Than yeah, that. I do as well. Don't you? Okay. Yeah. Could you make that? Yeah. 
but you're actually getting an all all right there's a little bit of gold in there but you're getting eight strands mm -hmm. of natural faceted black spinel and i'm going to say it the most elaborate elaborate of pendants that we've mm -hmm. ever featured mm -hmm. yeah the drops included too so you don't you this is built in right yes yeah so it come it comes like that it so, absolutely comes like that so if you think if you think about <coughs> all the different the different ways that mm. you can you know you can work with that so when i first saw it i thought it was um i thought it would go like that that way yeah that's what i thought because and if you wanted to you absolutely could turn it round and you, you work everything separately again like a really 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 good kit different components you can work with different things so have your jump ring here and have that I mean that is have an absolutely amazing pendant if you wanted to and you wanted to work with your you know when you know when you see those beautiful chain mail uh, bracelets chokers and you've got loads of um, anchor points here wonderful yes big those chunky pearls galleries. anything like that this this kit may well sell out Claire so we need to perhaps bring the graphics to air should we just go should we go to where kit team have told us to go okay. and then should we do what we're gonna do oh now for the eight strands on their own that's 12 pounds per uh, 12 pounds 50 per strand without the nine grams of sterling silver that you've got within that mate nine grams you do need to check them out how many do we have liam Oh, it's only 50. Look at how beautiful Do you know it is. Oh. Baskets. All right, so it's not messing about then, is it? We should stop here. Look at that. I think this is Downton, yeah. Oh, I've not yeah. watched. Just, I... just a couple of stitches onto some <coughs> black velvet. Um, you know, that, is, that would oh. be lovely, wouldn't it? What That's, about literally yeah. just feeding onto a sterling silver chain? Yes, totally. And you could go either way, couldn't you? So you could have your chain going through this section here yeah. or like I say you turn it round shouldn't be going lower than this turn it round or that way. Right that way too yeah you've got four monthly split pay here look at that look at the detail on yeah, yeah 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 wait a minute we've forgotten something we've forgotten. I'm just gonna borrow our lovely Sue's necklace which is just amazing purely because if we took it out of the out the reason why I haven't got them all here it's because that takes an opportunity away from you right now. You get eight Look at strands that. of natural Look at that. black spinel. Eight strands. That alone for $79.99. Plus, you're getting the nine gram sterling silver pendant as well. It is your Christmas party. That's £10 per spinel. And the nine nine grams of nine two five sterling silver for free. All that detail and work. Shop it. Oh, let me put yeah, it on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh wow, 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 wow. Hello. Yes, hello. Split pay. Seriously, Alice. Gorgeous kit. Beautiful. Gorgeous, gorgeous kit. On the verge oh, of selling out, there. I know. <gasps> I wish I I wish we had more. If we had 150, if we had 150 yeah. of these, they were still I sold. I think it's because jewelry makers know it's a, it's the components, isn't it? And you've got two amazing. You want me to put the necklace on, Charlene? Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. No problem. No problem, darling. I certainly can. I'll try anyway. This one or Claire's? Oh. It's a toughie. You pick whichever one you want, Al. <laughs> or else. <laughs> oh, my. Look at that. Oh, Claire. Look at that sparkle. It's so lovely, isn't it? It's so, so lovely. Oh, my. And do you know what? It feels amazing It does, doesn't it? Well. It feels... I, I wore it for a little bit yesterday. I, I really... Did you? Yeah. Where were you yeah, going? Nowhere. Just cause? I took my woolly jumper off and, um, and you wore it. You took your woolly jumper yeah, off? Yeah, did, did, did you? Yeah. Just to wear your black spinel? Yes. Did you feel like Lady I Such did. and Such I from... I did feel uh, like, yeah. 
Oh. I can't say Lady Claire Macdonald because there is a Lady Claire Macdonald already. Is there? Yes, she's a Scottish chef. Oh, right Yeah. yeah. How but about... yes, you do sort of stand... Lady, stand. Lady Mac. Lady Mac, yeah. Let's go with that. I'll be Lady Mac. Yeah. Lady Claire Mac. Yeah. Um, OK, um, oh, don't forget, before we dive into the demo, we're going to bring you a closeout deal on those beautiful pearls, which also come with further sterling silver. But just before, because it will go amazing with uh, uh, with with the spinel, we're gonna have to do it by picture. What are you talking about then, Liam? Multi silver plated, base metal, multi strand. Can you say that? Me silver plated base, base metal, metal multi strand clasp with five, five loops. loops. Oh, it's a mouthful, isn't it? Yeah, if you wanted to create a multi strand, it would be perfect. <laughs> yes, it would be perfect. But do you ever feel like we overcomplicate things? <laughs> I definitely. It's a short and snappy uh, name. <coughs> Silver plated, base metal, multi strand clasp with five loops. I know. Um, I know it's base metal, um, but you could also mix it up maybe with some of your other strands within your stash. Maybe you're inspired by these beautiful, this beautiful masterclass. And you're thinking, OK, I've got some of the hematite from earlier on. I can create a multi-strand with that. I've got some pearls that I purchased earlier on. I want to create a multi-strand with that. Um, I don't know. The, all, all of the gemstones within your stash, you know, those multi-layers. And at £2.99, we might as well. Yeah, it's a good way, isn't it? Maybe if you've not made any multi strands before, um, it's a good it's a good way to um, sort of. Is there you know, a way of approaching it? Multi strands. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So I don't do lots of beading. So um, what I tend to find is if you're doing a, a multi strand, I tend to do okay. I think because with wire work, so I just do a lot by eye. So I don't tend I tend not to measure or count too many things. Um, you don't count. No. <laughs> so, so i think because i do a lot by eye but i do think it does make a difference if you're doing multi strands because what you're what you're looking for is how it how it's gonna, <laughs> you're how it's gonna sit. <laughs> they're teasing you claire aren't they sorry claire uh, liam in the, he's naughty isn't it's he it's very funny he very, is very funny, funny. yes he's suggesting that claire doesn't know how to count uh, or I'll tie my know. shoelaces or tie yes. your shoelaces yes. she has not got velcro <laughs> they're slip-ons yes <laughs> so so what, what you want what you want is it's this middle one that usually gives me um issues this one here so to me it's like um you want to just sort of like work on the number of um, beads that you're going to work with. So the spinel, but it, what's helped me here is that I've got, so I've kept all of these the same length, mm. which I found work quite well for me. And then it's these bits here, these connectors that I've made that are obviously go from like longest and taper down. So I found that has helped me a lot. So I have done a little bit of counting. Um, and these are bead beads, beads yeah? About. Yes. I'll tell yes. you what, Claire, um, ideal opportunity, do you take it away. Any questions and do message us. The pearls are coming up as well at a closeout deal. If you missed out on the spinel, we have got another spinel deal, which is a pack of seven in multi-colours um, that we can bring a little bit later on when Claire's ready. So, okay, are, uh, is this what you, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna learn? Yes. So I'm gonna show you. So if I just take this off here and I'll show you, I'll show it to you um, flat about how you can see so how it's um, made up. So what you've got um, is. If we have a look, so the components that we're going to work with are, so if I open this up, we can see, and this will give you an idea as well um, of sort of like the, the, the lengths of things. So we've got the amazing component here. We're going to make the, um, the extra sparkle because I think a really, really good way um, for you to show it off is, is your standard sort of beady bead and we have these connectors. And then if you're going to do that, it sort of it does make that almost that two triangles which sit really nicely um, if we're sort of like looking at the geometric um, shapes. So uh, if I talk you through, so on each of the um, each of the strands when they come to you, uh, they're on um, like a temporary uh, cotton. So you are going to, um, you know, it, you're going to need to transfer these onto your, uh, I've worked with beading thread with these. Now you've got about, um, there's about 100 and, <coughs> 130, 133 uh, gemstones on the strand. Wow. Thank you. I did count them. So I've gone with, uh, I've got about 66 on each <coughs> single 
uh, strand. So that gives me, if I just look at this, so what, to give you an idea. Each side? Each side, yeah. So if I just look at this, because then that'll give you an idea of, um, of how, you know, depending on what you sort of like your uh, lengths of, uh, you know, necklaces to be. Because obviously if you wanted to have like a choker version, um, you wouldn't, you know, you wouldn't need it to be as long as that. So that's going to give you, it's going to probably be about a 20, 21 inch, so if I just bring that up a bit, uh, necklace. So to give you an idea, so that's about 60, uh, 66 on each individual strands. So uh, three on either side, so six in total. And that's what it's going to give you, mm -hmm. that sort of 20, 21 inch. So if I just bring that in. So what we're going to look at is... Simple techniques, but again, it's a bit like time saving. So uh, what I did with mine, because you're, you're working, you know, with so many, so many stones. So I got, so if I just take this off, so cut that off there. And then I got my, so if I take one of these, you can either pull out a little bit of the, um, the, the cotton from one end, but I just sat and threaded, so I didn't take them all off the strand, I kept them on that, that, co that cotton and literally just fed them on because the, the beading thread is um, see, stronger uh, and more rigid than the cotton and so they'll just feed on. So that's how I'd found it was quicker for me. Yeah. Please, if you've, got a, if you've got a quicker way when you're working with that many, let, you know, let me know because that, I think that's the thing that, you know, it takes up the most time with something like I that. I find it easier to go direct to the strand. Yeah, you're just transferring, aren't you, from one to the other, but you, obviously you do need to take it off that, um, uh, that you know, the, the temporary strand that it's on here. So I'd, work, I'd worked with that, and so I'd done all of my, transferred all of the, um, the 66 onto the beading thread, which if I just come along, and that's, so I've got 66 there. Beautiful. So I've worked with my sterling silver um, findings. So I've got, I need, um, if we get, get some of them out, and again, like we said before in the demo, get, when you're working with little components, get them all out, probably even one or, you know, two or three of them so that in case they sort of fl fly off or anything like that. So you, you're not struggling when you're working with little bits. So I've got, I've got my jump ring, I've got my uh, crimp cover and my crimp. So... I've done one end already, so I'm going to take the other one. So what I want to really make sure with this is I don't want to have it so it's too it's too taut because you can see how it's going to sit um, like that. I want to just make sure that so when I crimp that I'm still going to have not loads so that I can see uh, I've got gaps in between, but so it's not too taut so I get that lovely movement um, as we're wearing it and so it's going to be comfortable and it's going to sit properly. So I'm going to pick up my uh, crimp tube I am just going to double check. Yep, so with my jump ring, I'm just going to come in and make sure that this is closed up. So I've just got my two lots of chain nose pliers. Just make sure that that's, that is closed. So I've got my crimp tube. Pick up the jump ring. And let's bring that down. So let's go back through that tube. And so let's hold. There we are. So I'm just going to bring this down. So like I say, so we're doing this now. So I'm pulling now. So now when I'm, I'm just running my finger down just to push, just push down so I've got, make sure that I've got nice movement before I close this off. Because if I need to, I can just pull just a couple of millimetres and just push that down. Okay. So now let's hold that there. So basics here that you're going to use your basic tools with, but that are really, really important. So, you know, you can really overlook crimps, crimp covers. But what I'm making sure is that beading thread in there is not crossed over. So you can see that I've got two, uh, two strands. It's not crossed over underneath uh, the crimp tube. I've got my chain nose pliers. I'm going to squash down. Now, hopefully, you'll be able to see that as I've squashed it down, you can see so it's not crisscrossed there. So I'm going to hold here. So again, remember, we want to try and get this small uh, crimp cover around this crimp. 
And it's things like that when you're working with um, not many components here, but they're really, really high end. It's atten definitely attention to detail. So what we want to make sure is we're going to get this, this crimp tube so that it goes small enough so we can cover it with this. So I've got two lots of my chain nose pliers. And I'm going to hold either side of that, that crimp and just bring this in. So force, you know, force on a small area and I'm just bringing it in this direction. Okay. So, you, so you're making it into like sort of a, I'm just doing this folding it over. Yeah, because this is so if you've got crimping plies, you can absolutely do this. But a lot of people, maybe if you, you haven't made very much jewellery, you might have a standard toolkit, which is your chain nose pliers. So I'd always say definitely get yourself two lots of chain nose pliers. Um, but you might not have a specialised pliers like that. So mm. this is a nice way um, of still getting neat results, but maybe not with as many specialised tools. Because it's, it's important to remember when you see a necklace like this, it's not necessarily um, difficult techniques. It's just, you know, taking your time with them yeah. and the fact that they're yeah. high end components. So I'm just going to bring this in a little bit more just so it stop. So it's gone from that flat to the kidney shape, kidney bean shape. And I'm going to squeeze that. So I'm just holding here and pinch together. So you can see the difference now. So I've halved the size. So now when we take that, that crimp cover, I'm going to slide it around that crimp tube. So now what we've got is that is going to completely disappear and we're going to get, so when we close that seam, what we're going to get is we're going to get the look of a, just a spacer bead. So just take your time with this, nice, gentle, especially if you're working with sterling silver, you don't need to give it a real good squash. And so now it looks like you've got just a spacer bead that's there. Because remember, if you're going to be having yeah. this at this section, you know, <coughs> you're going to yeah. notice that. So just, just take your time you with that. You want it to look good. Yeah. So I'm then going to go in and make sure that I snip off the right bit of the beading thread. Oh. So we've got that, that um, connection there. So then with my uh, beady beads, so again, because you've got so many, um, and it is, you know, uh, when you're making uh, beady beads like this, you know, again, it's it's repetitive and it, and it's and it's I guess time consuming, but I really really think it's worth it for the for the extra sparkle that you're getting um, to make those. So I've got some of my uh, my fire line. I mean, you can use uh, monofilament. Oh, perfect. So I've got um, a little section there. So I'm going to take my twelve. So again, beady bead, really really easy starter um, and I take 12 of those so two four six eight ten twelve okay so I'm going to bring this in and make my beady bead so I'm going to go one two so the the whole thing with a beady bead you're going to think of it in series of uh it's going to look like it's a series of, of four beads. Okay, so I'm going to just bring that in. So I've popped three on, and I'm going to go crisscross through the fourth. So if you just take 12, and then you know when you've reached the end. So I'm going to crisscross through those. And let's bring that down. And so I'm going to tighten that up. And you're going to add. And keep doing that so you add one to either side and crisscross through that third. So I'm going to do so one to that side, one to this side, and crisscross. So while I do that, have you, have you got the. Um, the oh, I have. Is that all right? Just to, I'll yeah, speed no, no, through. That, that's fine. Probably Don't soon. rush. Um, because your kit, your masterclass kit, did sell out. I'm not surprised, yeah. But there's an alternative. We haven't got any more of your black spinel. Well, we have. But we've got a, a bundle of the multicolored. So you could do this same design or maybe add to. Oh my word! Can yes. you imagine this added? Can you imagine this added to your masterclass, Claire? Oh, that's lovely! Look oh, at that! Oh yes! Oh my goodness me! So you've got your black spinel in there, but then you've also got look. You've got more of a blue colour, the golds, the coppers. Seven strands. You're getting seven strands of. It's exactly the same. If I show one of the strands that Claire's got within a kit. Just so you know, there you go. 
it will go perfectly alongside uh, the masterclass kit. So if you missed out on that, or if you got the masterclass and you wanted to really go all out, you know, why not? Think about it this way. That could be quite, I don't know, it could be quite gothic. Yeah. It could be quite, yes, Christmas. It could be quite New Year. It, it's very Downton Abbey, very 1920s, as you said earlier on. But look at that. The ultimate performance gemstone. I'll say it. Black diamonds are lovely, but they're, they're, they're outperformed by a black spinel, aren't they? They are, they are. I love black diamonds, they are. No, I'm talking specifically about black. Blacks are almost opaque, completely opaque, aren't they? But a black spinel um, will absolutely, absolutely surpass it in terms of its beautiful, beautiful... It's that, it, it is that paparazzi flash. £49.99 only. Should be. Seven strands. So that's already less than £10 per strand. Okay. $49.99 divided by seven, £7.15 per strand. It's not bad. Hey, look at that sparkle. But quite a few people did miss out, Claire, mm. on, the, on the masterclass. Mm. Shall, we, shall we do a little apology deal? Yeah, yeah, let's do it. How much do we have then, Liam? Oh, 180, that's good. That's good. You know, it's the kind of thing that would go, yeah, amazing alongside With every, the everything, everything that you've got in your stash. Absolutely everything. That's what, Le uh, that's what you've just said, Ollie, isn't it? It's the kind of thing that you will always, always mm. use. Liam, go back to that black spinel PowerPoint, if you don't mind. Because every single celebrity, well, not every single, but there's a huge amount of celebrities. Mm. Mm. Look, look, at, look, look, look at Jennifer Anderson there. Oh, she's a sauce pot, isn't she? Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And then look at the next piece. Just flick through these. Can we? Look at that. What about the next one? All of these. Oh, that's nice as well. Yeah, yeah. 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 Gosh, this is an old PowerPoint, Liam. I haven't shown this PowerPoint in a long time. One hundred. Oh, sorry, one thousand three hundred thirty pounds yeah. for that tassel off first dibs. Look at that. One thousand one hundred sixty-one pounds. Tune in tomorrow and you can make that piece if you get hold of your spinel right oh. now. Shall we do an apology deal? Because so many missed out on the uh, masterclass. How about who's got £3.60? Wow. £3.57. That's it per strand. £24.99. That's incredible. .99. Incredible. And especially like this time of the year, you know, you could be doing all your lovely Christmas makes, Ooh. couldn't you? Your party. Oh, yeah. That's worth arranging a New Year's Eve party for yes. the necklace, isn't it? I'm the most boring person ever when it comes to New Year. I need to do something this New Year because um, I'm not working this New Year. I, I need to do something. Uh, if you make this necklace, you'd, I, you, know, you absolutely should be arranging the party, shouldn't you? I mean, just look at how you think about how many um, BDBs you could do with that. Oh, wow. You'd have like your slide because it's different, the multicolour. And then you could almost treat them as as then individual beads, and then you thread them on. Love it. You could have like a lovely stretchy bracelet. Couldn't can you? we? Can All we? Of... Oh, okay, I'll just use I'll use Sue's here because you're working with yours. But look, they work with the blacks, don't they? Yeah. From your yes, I mean, why not? Definitely. An additional. <coughs> By the way, the masterclass kit was meant to be ninety nine ninety nine. That's what the kit team told us to do. Liam took it to seventy nine ninety nine. <laughs> so for for what really, really what five pound extra? Really, you're getting you're getting one hundred and sixty carats of spinel on top. That is it, that's exquisite, isn't it? That's gorgeous. So lovely together. Absolutely gorgeous. Love that, love that. Final 81 opportunities. If you want to multi-buy, you absolutely can. Can I just say, basically, this is, this is, that's her, her, her piece, isn't it? Yeah. Basically, it's just a strand. Just a simple strand, rosary linked in between. 71 out of the 180 that we originally started with. Uh, keep on dialing through, lovely jewellery makers. Um, hello, Diane. And Diane is saying, hi, Ellen Claire. Uh, are you, uh, you crisscrossing on a third or fourth bead okay. on each level of the BDB? Please, thank you. Does that make sense yes. to you? Yes, yeah, Good. Diane, sorry. So if we look at this, so I've, I've opened it out now. 
So you can see, so when I say it like it's groups of four, our first lot that we put on was, was I put on four beads. Those are my first four. And I crisscross through that fourth. And the, the next sections that I work on through those 12 beads, I steal one from that first section, which is this one. And then I add on three beads. So I add on one to this side, one to the, the other side, and then a third bead that I crisscross through. So if I just move that in, so you can see I've crisscrossed there. Okay, so that's, and that then becomes my group of, of four. So I always steal one from the, the previous one. Now on the last one, when I've gone to my last two of the, um, out of the 12, so I just close this, all of that up, and then I go back to the beginning and I steal from the, the beginning. So I, my fourth one in that last section is actually the very, very first one. Are you using fire light, a wildfire yes, now? Yes, yes, fire light, yeah. You did yeah. put on the, you, yeah. Yeah. <coughs> it's so, wildfire, is that the yeah. same thing? Uh, I guess, I'm not, I'm not a beader, but, so yeah, so I've just, yeah, I've just got that. You want something that you're not really gonna see too much. So okay. we've, we've got closed it. all that up, but I mean, look at that, look at that sparkle there. And I'm gonna do a couple of knots, okay? So a couple of knots on there. So I, I when you're doing something like this, my way of working is I just do each, each um, component and I spend the time and I make all those. So all the beady beads are just sat. It's very repetitive, but if you're doing something over and over and over again, you tend to speed up. So I made all my beady beads, I did all my threading and I worked it like that. So I've got my three beady beads here. Mm -hmm. So what we want to do now is we're going to add this connect to connect here. So if you think about it, I'd made, so I've done my 12 um, here and that's gonna give me that, that tapering up. Okay, so there you go. if I bring that in. So to create this little section here, I'm gonna take some of my uh, 0.4 wire and this time I'm gonna work with my uh, round nose pliers. So the first thing I'm gonna do, I cut a little bit of that. And so if I just, I'm gonna make a, a wrap loop so I'm just going to hold here and so just straightforward wrap loop and let's cut that off there, snip that there. So the first thing I'm going to add on because it's, it's quite a small and delicate loop, so I'm going to take one of my spinel <coughs> because we've got so many, add on one, two, three. And a last one. One, let's have a look. And let's pop that on there. Okay, so now that's going to just sit nicely. So hold this on here. And you do need those two little spinels on the end just to stop it from, because um, otherwise that, the wrap loops will get swallowed up into the beady bead. Okay, so let's snip that off here. So now we've got the the component here, so I'm going to open and close different bits, and we can add it. We can add it together. So I'm going to take the one that I've got the uh, the jump ring on here, and let's open this, and we can pop that on. So that's going to come up here and close. So now if we look at the connector, so I'm going to, first of all, I'm going to take, because what we want to have, you've got lots of different areas in here. Now, if you go for these ones on the outside, it's probably going to be easier, but I went for, so I took some of my um, jump rings, different sizes. I'm sorry, I don't know what size they are. Um, I did give Liam the code, sorry. So the larger ones, I'm going to slide into that section now it might be a little bit fiddly at first but it really is it's worth taking the time just to see how they sit differently and then i'm going to just push mm. that and close that oh, okay so yeah. we've got this here so that is now connected so can you see the difference of so i've gone onto the the sort of the ones that are more um on the if i just move that there rather than these outer ones <coughs> they've gone in there so I'm using a four and a three mil. Okay. okay. So that's the larger one. Which we're bringing one. to air now. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So I've got that larger one has gone in, into the um, into the silver. And I'll take the next one. So we're just going to let sit, let that sit. Bring that through. And let's close that up. And there we are. So 
close that there. And you've got that's going in there. So all you're going to do is repeat this. But so I've got three here, two here, and one there. And that means then when you, when you wear it, it, it helps with the amount of, um, so it's going to sit nicely because you've got that, that graduation and it gives you that big block of, of spinel sparkle. So you can see how that, you just keep repeating that. So whatever you do on the one side, you'll do on the other and you're just going to taper, taper up. So there you go. There we are. You can see, so that's how it looks. That's I mean, amazing. look at that. It's su such a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stone. That. It's so beautiful gathered together as yeah. well, all that black spinel. Yeah. The kit has sold out. There is multicolored spinel, a bundle of a multicolored spinel. That's still available uh, just about. But Claire, absolutely stunning. Thank you. It's a pleasure to work with. Stunning, lovely. stunning. You say you don't do beading very often. Well, it's, do you know, I, all my beading is, I, I don't feel very confident with it because I only know basic techniques. But honestly, with when you've got components like that, it's, I, I just think they work really well because you, you've got so much sparkle there. There's nothing there. basic about that. Oh, thank nothing you. Nothing basic it's at lovely, all. It's really lovely. Um, Bernadette saying it, uh, it's a very royal necklace. Beautiful, oh, Claire. Yeah, thanks, Bernadette. Thank you. It is Thank stunning. You. Absolutely yeah. stunning. Sorry's messaged in as well saying, uh, careful uh, with, uh, with the teasing, Liam. Uh, or we'll have to remind people of the time you whacked your head on the shelves laughing. Yes, uh, thank you, Collector. That's a yeah, good point. What, when did you whack your head on the shelves? Over Liam? there. Oh, did you? Oh. Oh. oh, I thought it was on there. Who was that? Uh, I mean, there's loads of things that we can tease Liam for. Don't worry. It was there. It was yeah. there, yeah. Don't worry, we, we've got plenty of things in the bank for Liam, don't worry. We'll make sure we get him back. It's all good, it's all good. <laughs> we look out for our lovely Claire. Liam, it is nice having you back though, because he's naughty, he's very naughty. He is, he is. And not in a malicious way, of course. Are you ready? Are you ready for a star buy? What's been an amazing show so far? Oh, brilliant. How about, so you've had your black spinel, you've had your amazing jade. How about, close out deal, on pearls? But not just pearls, three strands of pearls and sterling silver. Okay, so um, if I shout out a few gemstones just for kicks, let's, let's humor me on this one just for kicks. If I shout a gemstone, name another gemstone that would uh, that would look amazing with it. Yeah. So I'll start with the obvious black spinel. What's that? Watch it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. 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 If just for fun, just for fun, humor me because you know where I'm going with this. Okay. But if I shout out a gemstone. You shout another one that's going to go amazing with it. Claire. Black spinel. Pals. Yes. Oh, is that the... Oh, OK, yeah. Right. <laughs> Sapphires. Rubies. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, pals. Thank you. I get Thank it now. You. I get it now. Go on. Jadeite. Pals. Uh, pals. <laughs> pals. Pals, 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 pals. They go with absolutely everything, don't they? Yeah. Apps. They do. <laughs> It's been a long week. It has. It's been a very, very, very long week, bless you. <laughs> How about we do a close-out deal on genuine cultured pearls? But even more than that, you're also getting another sterling silver oh. component. You have this lovely bar of 925. But if I put it that way, can you see you've actually got what could be a pendant, but is, yes. am I right in saying, Claire, that could also be um, a, a sort of a multi-strand? Oh, yes, it is. Oh, that. it is. Look how beautiful. Anne and Sue have done it again. They have, haven't they? Oh, I love that. Do you know what? That right there looks like something. Where's your necklace? Oh, here we go. This looks like something from the V&A Museum, it does, doesn't, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Yeah. Honestly, we could be, we could be di yeah. almost displaying mm. the royal jewels. Mm. How amazing. Two, a bundle that's going to go perfectly alongside your masterclass kit. You're getting three strands, three strands of genuine cultured pearls and the most beautiful connector. But take a look at this connector. 
It's very clever, isn't it? Very, very clever. Claire, so we know it's 925 sterling silver. Mm. Do you think they're cubic zirconias? Oh, I don't know. No. They're white topaz. Wow. So that necklace is literally all gemstones. <gasps> all gemstones. No knotting, just a few additions of your Mayuki beads. Beautiful graduation, all brought together in one big lobster class. So, I mean, if you can imagine, how much would something like that be in, in, in most jewellery establishments? It's hard to put a price on, actually, Claire, uh, Claire, don't you think? Because we don't often see a, tri no. a triple row. And it's just that. It just finishes it off perfectly, doesn't it? I, lo I love the way it groups it together at the front, and then you've got that one drop. Lovely. Um, we've shown in the past, and I think we did yesterday, actually, uh, different celebrities, Hollywood icons wearing their pearls. Um, I think we had uh, Marilyn Monroe. I think there was Princess Grace. I think... Um, uh, Angeline Jolie, mm. um, they're all wearing, yeah, Harry Styles, absolutely, lots Wayne, of different celebrities. Wayne, he wore his as well, didn't he? Wayne? Yeah. He's not on the PowerPoint. Oh. Did Wayne wear pills? Do you know, that, I think it transformed him. Did it? Yeah, I did love all of a sudden that he had this air of sophistication? Yeah, he did, he did, absolutely transformed him, yeah, yeah. I love it. I love yes. that, and I love the fact that this is a gemstone that is going, um, uh, sort of, is is crossing uh, um, but, well, all ge uh, both genders and all different ages as well. Yes, they are yeah. timeless. Yeah. Something like this, I mean, you can imagine it around the decolletage of maybe um, uh, uh, the Princess of Wales. You can imagine this around the decolletage of uh, Grace Kelly. You can mm. imagine this around the decolletage of Angelina Jolie, as, as we've just said. Olivia Coleman. Yeah. But also, like, I would say Rihanna as well. If, you know, Beyonce, that, you know, just, just totally, I think it just, it can go across absolutely everyone, all different styles, different ages. Yep. Beautiful. Mm. We have 150 of these available, and we are promising it at a closeout deal. Here we go. Thank you, Liam. Never gone out of fashion. You've got Jackie Kennedy here wearing a triple mm. row, literally a triple row just there. Um, a necklace that she was photographed mm. wearing quite a few times, yeah. in actual fact. Uh, there she is, Angelina Jolie, looking beautiful in her she pearls. Does, doesn't she? Catherine Heigl. Yes. Wearing a triple row there with a big connector. Then you have Sarah Jessica Parker. Uh. Then you have. Be no, it's not Beyonce. That's Rihanna. <laughs> I love. <laughs> 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 I love how unwith it Liam is. <laughs> <laughs> um, then you've got Rihanna, all wearing beautiful layers and layers of pearls. Yeah. Now, pearl necklaces like this would cost an absolute pretty penny, wouldn't they, um, from most establishments? <clears throat> but when you're making them yourself, you can make it at a fraction of the price. I mean, yeah, this, it's never gone out of fashion. Whether you have them in this lovely, very demure, almost arranged... Mm. Um, arranged format, or whether you choose to wear them in the sort of a, a sort of casual and loose. Harry Styles, there we go, there we go. You've got Pharrell Williams, and I still don't know the guy on who. ASAP Rocky, thank you. He's got lovely trousers. That's Pharrell Williams. Kanye West. Kanye West. Right, let's bring you. Let's bring you the closeout deals because we're rapidly running out of time, Liam, oh, aren't we? Not, I'd, I'd have that. Those tassels, <coughs> I'd have the black spinel tassels. Oh, the yes. spinel tassels for that. That's a great idea, isn't it? Yeah, put it with all the multicoloured. Yeah, yes, right, yeah, so you're yeah. On. Closeout deal, three strands of beautiful, genuine culture pearls, plus you're getting this beautiful, beautiful... Uh, um, it could be a pendant, but it can also... Um, well, if I put it on the I think, of my it, I mean, it's because you have that sway, don't you, of pearls, but they are, <coughs> it, it keeps them separated as well. Yeah, it's like a sash, isn't it, yes, to your curtains? Yes, you know, yeah. when you gather up your curtains yes. and you create that beautiful movement. Yes. Um, it's doing that with your genuine pearls. Now, at £199.99, £99, amazing. But we did say close out, didn't we? Three strands, top quality, amazing, lovely pearls, beautiful surface luster. If I had the time, then I would talk about those five virtues. I don't think we need to. When we're looking at a necklace that has been constructed so beautifully as this one just here, perfect graduation. The, what, the, a lovely addition, I think, to Claire's masterclass mm. as well, if you wanted to create that beautiful monochrome. Now, we are rapidly approaching the top of the show. Now, 
Go on, Liam, tell me. Do it. Should we do it, Claire? Yeah. Are you up for yeah. that? Yeah, most definitely. Bearing in mind that sterling silver and topaz Brilliant. in that connector. Yeah, but it's, it's the weekend, isn't it? It's, it's the weekend. party. Yeah. Sorry, I say it every time. Sing it to Willow every time she says it. It's the weekend. Um, you know you split payment. Okay. Who loves bills? Put your hands up if you love yes. bills. Yes. Yeah. Everybody love pearls? Yes. Yeah. yeah. See that split payment? How about we go lower than your split payment? Yes. Are you do up it, for do that? It, do it. There are 150 opportunities. If you don't grab these, I absolutely will be. Before, well, for my holiday, I was making jewellery just to wear, literally to throw over the top of the head, really simple beading. Nice. Simple. I know yeah. you mean simple. What was it? Pearls. Pearls, because they go with everything, yeah. every occasion. But you don't have to overcomplicate the techniques, do you? No. Let's see. Great with your, your black spinel masterclass. Amazing with that. Yeah. 39. Wait, wait, wait. Liam, that makes it, I don't know, £13 per pearl strand and the white topaz and sterling silver pendant for free. Or, yes, £10 per component. That would be much easier <laughs> maths, wouldn't it? <laughs> much easier maths. The phone lines have absolutely lit up. Oh, gosh. Um, we had 150. Look at them all, Claire. Look at our lovely I viewers. Oh, yeah. Hi, everybody. Hello, Aww. Zoe. You were first on in there. Karen, Linda, Manchester County, uh, uh, Antrim, sorry. Annette, hello to you. Janice, Suzanne, Mary, Kathy, Caroline, Robert, Louise, Meath, Wiltshire, Illinois. Well done to oh, you. Oh, wonderful. Already a third of the stock has gone. Liam says he doesn't think. Um, he doesn't think Wayne is going to let him back on that hot seat. He will. He will. I hope so, anyway, because yeah, it has been quite too. nice been to have the, have the naughtiness of Liam. Yes, there. and do you know, I think it's a good. it was a good naughty mix of uh, Liam and Ollie. Yeah, to, to be fair, it's yeah, absolutely. A good, yeah, a good naughty I mix love of that, those love two. that balance. Yes. Very good. Because there's an element of that with Ollie as well, isn't there? Yes, Ollie, yeah, very naughty, Ollie. Ollie, Ollie. Yeah. We were just talking about how naughty you are as well. Yeah, I don't think you're, you come off all <laughs> like a saint. You ain't perfectly in All the managers in, all in there. Oh, well, yeah, all the management team. Down to the final third. Make sure you do check out those baskets, <laughs> lovely, uh, lovely jewellery makers. You can get hold of this um, for just £20 on your split payment. Yeah, Flynn, Flynn, good as gold. And Dan, to be fair. And Dan. Absolutely. I, I don't know about Dan. <laughs> <laughs> Gorgeous, Dan. Gorgeous, Dan. Gorgeous, gorgeous, Dan. Yeah, anyway, enough of that. Listen, we've gone off on a tangent now, haven't we? <laughs> oh, dear me. Stay where you are on those phone lines, everyone. Just stop it, Liam. Stop it now, because I'm trying to literally close the show as you talk about gorgeous Dan in the background. He's lovely. Yes, he is lovely. Um, 20 seconds. Claire, thank you oh, so much for joining us. Oh, lovely morning. Lovely, lovely morning. When are you back with us? Uh, next week, Friday. Friday. Friday, well, we look yes. look forward to that. Yeah. Enjoy the yeah. rest of your Saturday morning. Remember those diamonds are coming up tomorrow. <gasps> it's going to be a mega, mega show, but enjoy the rest of your Saturday. Lots of love.